Hello. It's been a while, guys. It's been a while, hasn't it? It has been. It's been like two weeks since I've streamed. How is everyone doing? Hello. It's been a while, oh gosh, guys. I hear echo. I have my own stream open. It has been. It's been like two weeks since I've. Howdy. There we go. Finally early. I'm making a Todd shirt, bro. Can we appreciate the Todd shirt for a second? We got it, boys. We got the Todd shirt. And it looks good. I'm happy with it. You already know I'm rocking the Todd shirt today. Because you already know we're getting Todd back in this. We're bringing Todd back. I'm glad you're doing well, Octopolis. I've never been so early to a stream in my life, dude. 5.50, I said 6. I'm 10 minutes early. <clears throat> and it's usually... I don't stream this early usually, but, you know... I happen to pick the worst time to stream, which is, like, literally when the Super Bowl is going on. But, hey, shit happens. I want to get this done. Um, and I've been cooking it up for a while. I'm going to wait a little bit longer. Just so more people can kind of, like, flow in here. Because I did say 6. But, I mean, for the next 10 minutes, we can just chat. We can just catch up. It's been, a, it's been a little bit. Not much has gone on with me, honestly. I've just been editing. I've just been on the grind. I'm starting to work on the, the shrine videos, which is going to be awesome. This, did I say videos? I mean video. It's going to be a single video, probably. I don't think I wanted to. But that's going to be a good one. I'm really excited for that one. Welcome back, Alice. Is Todd going to be in the stream? Of course, dude. Of course Todd's gonna be in the stream. Do we have to ask? Dude, I'm wearing the shirt. I mean, even if he's not in the game, we got him here. We're repping him. We're repping the Todd shirt. Multi-video series. This stream might get used for a video, depending on how we go with it. And I'm gonna wait to introduce it a little bit, because I just want to wait a bit longer. Vincraft's making the shirt. W Vin. Who watches the Super Bowl anyway? I feel like when you're a kid, you kind of just get forced to watch the Super Bowl. At least in my experience. When you get older, you kind of get a bit more freedoms. And, I don't know. Football's not for me. That's not my thing. But we got the goats here in chat today. We got the goats that care more about the stream than the actual Super Bowl. <laughs> it's like a religious character. Dude, we're never going to forget Todd. We can never forget him. Because without him, I don't know how he would have done that. Like, would it have been possible? Maybe. Probably, but it would have been a lot harder. And I might have given up, actually. Because if I didn't get Wind Temple... I guess we didn't need Tulin, to be honest. But, I, I don't know. We used to make a religion out of this. The Todd religion. Hmm. <clears throat> Would you guys want to see me do a, a key item speed run? Basically what I did in the stream, but <laughs> instead of it taking 31 hours, I think I could do it under like three. I think I could fit it into one stream. I know that's the most bullshit thing I've ever said in my life, but like, listen, listen. I've learned a lot. I know what to do way better. Todd percent. That would be kind of interesting actually. I mean, you need to get off the Great Sky Island, and then you need to get a torch, and then zuggle that torch. And light it. That's definitely... It, it, it would be like a 30 minute speedrun. It would be a fast one. It's basically just GSI percent. There's no torches on GSI, that's why. At least that I know of. I'm pretty sure there's none. I love that everyone's just embracing Todd. To think that I almost got rid of him at the start, too. Alright, let's jump into this, guys. Let's get into the challenge. Oh, excuse me. Okay. So, today I'm going to be beating the game with only glitches. What does that mean? Well, I've already beaten the game with only key items. So, where do we go from there? <laughs> We remove the key items. It's so simple. And we're going to try to beat the game 
with as few key items as possible. Now you're probably scratching your head thinking like, dude, you can't do that. You need to pick up the key items. You're right. Even if you use Timber's GSI skip, it doesn't matter. You need to pick up at least a few key items. I'm not going to do GSI skip, so I'm going to have to pick up quite a few key items. But... I'm never going to actually use them. So like, I'll have to pick up the pure pad, but I'm never gonna teleport. I'm never gonna look at the map. I have to pick up Ultra Hand, but I'm never gonna use Ultra Hand. I have to pick up Fuse, I'm never gonna use Fuse. I'm gonna pick up all like the necessary things to complete GSI, but I'm never gonna actually use them. As for the heart container at the end, I am gonna have to trade in the spear orbs for the heart container, I believe, and then I'll just have to not get hit. <laughs> I'll just have to not get hit after I beat the Great Sky Island, and that's fun, and that's exciting, so I can't wait for that, and we'll, we'll try to do it with as few as possible. Is it possible to do a zero? Probably not. Maybe. I don't, I don't think so, but we're gonna try our best. I believe in you. My brother in crime, if there's one person who could do it, it's small. <laughs> Dude, what about me? What about me? Listen, guys. Smollett would probably never do this because this is. Let me zoom that in a little bit. Smollett could do this, but I don't think he has the knowledge to. Like, he's really smart, but I don't know if he has, like, the glitch knowledge to pull it off. And I could be super wrong, but, like, there's a lot of very specific glitches to pull off. I don't know if he's got that in the tank. But I've been cooking. I might have it in the tank. I might. Okay. First things first. I am going to be starting with a 100% save file. Which I know is kind of cheap. But it's just going to be so much easier. Guys, I know you didn't come to the stream to watch me like grind out uh, a save where I am going to be picking up items. I just want to skip to the part where we have like the alt save and we can just keep switching back and forth between the fake save and the real save to get what we need to get done. Otherwise, you guys were just gonna be having to watch me for like an hour and a half just collecting items for the alternate save. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, basically the way the time is gonna work, we're gonna have to keep moving between save files. So like I'm gonna be picking up shit in this save file and then juggling it and then moving it over. It's gonna make more sense as we go. But with that being said, let's get into the run. So this is, uh, this is technically not a 100% save file. This is actually my main, like, casual save. So... I was testing some stuff in here earlier. Let's just get out of this area. He tried to do no key items run, but halfway through the tutorial, he didn't know any further, but we believe in Todd to save you. Yeah, Todd just fixes all problems. Todd the legend in time. Todd is the goat. Is that music loud? Is it chilling? <clears throat> oh yeah, also, I kind of changed my stream layout a little bit. So I added like the controller input display. So like you see when I'm moving around, it shows that. I don't need to explain what a controller input display is. You guys know what that is. You're not stupid. Anyway, if you're wondering what key items like are in the game, obviously all the runes are key items. The pure pad, the battery cell, the paraglider. Basically, we're gonna not pick up anything. <laughs> we're not gonna pick up armor, bows, shields, weapons, materials, food, zonai devices. And we're gonna have to pick up a few key items, but we're never gonna use them. Let's make a save here. It's fine. Title screen. <laughs> Man, the Todd religion is getting big. <laughs> I'm so glad I got the shirt. The shirt was so worth it. Okay. Here we go. The madness starts right now. Oh, start the timer. We're in it now. Are we setting up with Yuzu? No. This is on my Switch. Need more proof? There you go. This is a Switch run. No mods, no glitches. I mean, sorry, no- <laughs> There's a lot of glitches. I don't know why I said no glitches. Plenty of glitches. Just no- no mods, no hacks. 
But imagine getting rid of an entire religion in the first video. I felt bad when Todd died, but there was no way I could have avoided it. How long do you guys think the stream's gonna be? Wait. I already think I can't kill the bats. Because I'm using a weapon if I kill the bats. I just realized that. Uh oh. We might have to already so <laughs> We might have to already start doing glitches, guys. Because I don't think we can use our master sword here. I allowed it in the video. Thank you for the follow. Hopefully the timer works this time around. Yeah. The the timer like broke a lot in the last streams because I was stupid and I just didn't set it up very well, but it should be fine now. But like please spam the shit out of me. If the timer doesn't work, just make fun of me, please. Just say anything to get my attention. Maybe not anything, <laughs> but you know, within reason. I think four hours a day, bro. That's that's a crazy thought. If it took me 30 hours to do it with key items, you think I'm gonna do it with four without? That's some math. Guys, there's no way we can kill the bats without the Master Sword, right? Like, Zelda's torch isn't gonna burn them, is it? It would be hilarious if I, if I could, like, lead the bats into Zelda's torch. That would be so cool. But I don't think it works. Because the bats move around, and they're probably not dumb enough to just fly into Zelda's torch. Okay, Zelda, we need you. There's no, like... I don't even have any abilities in here, so... You hey guys, come over here. Well, come right here, guys. It's, it's warm. Please. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thank you so much for tuning into the stream. This has been a fun time. No, we have a way around this. Dang it, dude, it would have been so good if that worked. Okay. We're moving on to backup plan. Real life bats would. Real life bats would not fly into fire. <laughs> I don't know what bats you're living by. Thank you the follow up, Apollo. Alright, here's the plan, guys. Here's our plan. We're gonna do... Three glitches, I think three, because we're gonna gas a wheel, which basically just means we're gonna get a wheel. Thank you for the follow. We're getting a lot of new followers. Thank you guys. We're gonna try to get a wheel permanently on. We're gonna try to just, like fuse it to our weapon and then juggle that weapon into the clean save. Hopefully that makes like a tinge of sense. So I'll kind of explain it as I go. I think a wheel would work because keys are like really easy to kill. Also, just, just to be clear, if you see me wearing armor, I think that's like a good way to know I'm on... <laughs> Thank you for the follow. That's a good way to know if I'm on my alt save, if I'm wearing armor. Okay, so we're gonna slot... Sorry, not slot. We're gonna fuse and tangle the wheel. Oh gosh, the lightning is gonna kill me. Put it down there. We're gonna get a weapon. Let's get a nice claymore, it looks nice. Use it to this. Okay. Let's unequip it for a second, so we don't die. All right, let's re-equip it. Walk away. Oh no, did that despawn the shield? When I unequipped it. I think you're not supposed to unequip it. Damn lightning, bro. Why did I make the save right when there was a thunderstorm going on? That was probably not smart. How did Zelda get Todd? Nobody knows. Okay, the storm's gone. Let's unfuse the wheel and reset. So fuse and tangle. This is the glitch that it's Bluetooth. If you like use your shield, it turns it on. Anyways, we can't actually use that functionality in the clean save. 
fuse that to that. Pull it. So now it's permanently on. You can see it's like rolling and it's not using my battery either, which is really nice. So I shouldn't need the battery cell when I go back. Although I've never tested this, so you never really know what these glitches. Okay. So now it's zuggled. So you see I have no weapon equipped, but it's still in my hand. This is like the most broken glitch that we're going to be using the most of. It's a glitch that like lets you traverse things through saves. But I can't actually like attack with it. Like if I try to attack, he'll actually just do like the earthquake manual ability. And then we also need to zuggle the shield. So it's going to look like we have a Hylian shield and it's going to look like we have a weapon, but we actually don't. So don't worry about it, guys. The world's fine. All right, hopefully this works. Beneath Hyrule Castle. Prage. Is Link short or the wheel giant? I think Link's a little short. He's a short king, I'll be honest. It's not a glitch, it's unintended game design. Yeah. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> so easy. So easy, dude. We're cooking. Look at that. Already through the first three bats of the game. This is gonna be easy. Link normally doesn't have the Hylian shield here, right? Just the sword. I don't think anyone's ever killed the bats like that. Maybe they have, but I've never seen anybody kill bats like that. Oh, and it's gonna show the cutscene with the wheel always on. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's let's see how this looks. Oh no, it's pre-rendered. Oh, that sucks. What is that? Pre-rendered just means like this is like an MP4 file, whereas a lot of the cutscenes in this game, it renders it as you do it because like usually you have your own armor set and stuff like that. So This one, obviously, you, you have to have the Master Sword, you have to have, like, this arm ex armor set exactly, so we don't get to see the weird Zuggled stuff. This is gonna be easy, Burrito Storm. <laughs> yeah, Zelda's got Todd. So you can argue that Todd's been with us from the beginning. What's up, dude? I've seen this cutscene probably 500 times. And it never gets old. I love it so much. I have an idea to do a Todd only speedrun. Thank you, Quinn the Gamer. A Todd only speedrun. Like, kill Ganon with a torch? It's not possible. Ganon's immune to fire, and dude, it, it, I hate that he's immune to fire so much. I hate it so much. But he's completely immune to fire. So I wouldn't be able to use the torch. Thank you, Kate Jot. Hopefully I'm saying that right. How would I do a Todd only speedrun? Guys, give me ideas. Give me ideas for this. How do you... I mean, I could juggle overload like a bunch of torches and then use another torch to attack with it. And then the damage would be like stacked by like 10. So it would deal like, it would deal okay damage. Might be a fun idea. I also want to do burrito percent speedrun, which is like cook a burrito as fast as you can, or at least get the ingredients for one. I don't think there's a burrito recipe in this game, but like we can make our own. I think there's flour for like the shell. We can put like chicken and cheese in there. Use a ruby to make a megaton. That's an idea. Yeah, we could we could put like a topaz or a ruby. I think a ruby would make more sense. So it keeps Todd like kind of lit. Bye bye Zelda. See you in like 60 hours or something. <laughs> no, Todd's falling. I don't care about Zelda, bro. Look at Todd to the side. Why are you reaching for Zelda? Where's the torch? 
What? The torch was right there a second ago. Reason for the wrong thing, Link. What's Zelda gonna do for us? She literally threw our run by giving us the Master Sword. She makes everything worse. When do we just want torch? You gonna go to bed and still see me playing? Yeah, do be a school day. Can you give me food to cook? I'm hungry. Hmm. Yeah, let me ship it over. What's your Addy? Don't actually send me your Addy. <laughs> Wait, would this break our vines for us? Oh. <laughs> Damn. Well, I think you guys know what time it is. I think everyone knows what time it is. Do I even have to say it? Do we have to speak the unspoken? He's coming back. He is coming back. Our boy. Our boy. Or a girl. Or a girl. Or whatever Todd is. He's something. He exists. Alright, let's, uh, do I have a torch on me already? No, I have a, s I don't want to use a stick. No, that'd be disrespectful. If I use a stick instead of taunt. Thing is, a stick wouldn't work either because the stick would, like, break after a little bit. I think torches are the only weapons that, like, stay on fire and don't break. I could be wrong. But as far as I know, torches are the only ones. All right, you guys want to see where Todd lives, where he was born? It's somewhere over here. I think it's, I, dude, I'm telling you, it's like right there or something. Watch that marker be within two meters of it. And if it's not, I'm gonna be ashamed of myself. Cause I've collected Todd so many times. Like, I've, like, I think of Todd as, like, my kid, and I'm, like, going to school to pick him up, you know? I'm, like, the parent going over to, to pick up Todd. I don't miss. I don't miss. Maybe a little bit more than two meters, but look at that. Alright. Todd. There's a, there's a torch I look out? Really? Okay, let's drop... Our zuggled wheel claymore. Let's pick up our torch. And we have to light it. So we're going to firefruit it. Yeah. Bada bing bada boom. Now it's lit. But it's it's still a normal torch. This is how you make the normal to torch into Todd. You go beep beep boop bop bop bada beep beep boop boop beep. And now it's zuggled. Yay. So we can reload the save. Room of Awakening. I believe while Todd is waiting on us to retrieve him, he's chilling with some torch tricks in Power World. Maybe. Let's go back. Todd casually starting forest fire. No, we don't need to talk about that, guys. And here we are. Burn it, burn it, burn it, burn it, burn it, burn it, yeah. Never gets old, man. I love it. I hope we never have to get rid of Todd. Huge. Oh man, I wanted to do like one of the speedrunner strats to get up there, but without a weapon, we actually can't. Imagine, imagine picking up the Master Sword. Who actually picks this up when they're playthroughs? I don't need that. That janky ass sword. <laughs> I 
I wonder what the stupidest cutscene would be for Todd to be in. I know the Colgara one was pretty funny because it's like a windstorm and the wind's blowing on it so hard, but Todd is still lit. Oh, also, like, we had the fire in Tulin's face for like a solid minute, which would have just roasted it off. I don't think there's anything we could do in that, in that room. It's been so long since I've gone this way. No, we lost the fire already. I forgot that that happens. Thank you for the follow Fire Phoenix. So just so you guys are kind of aware of how Todd works, like we can't attack with them. If I hit Y, nothing happens. If I pause and I spam L, I can't go there because there's nothing over there. I don't have any weapons, I don't have any shields, even though it looks like I do. But even though it's kind of like he doesn't exist, he still kind of does. Because if you go in water, like I just did, he loses his fire. But we can get it back, we just have to find a fireplace, you know? So it's like... It's kind of a, a an interactable object, but it's also kind of not. It's weird. It both exists and does not exist. I'm so ready to play this game again, dude. Two weeks of editing, and I'm just ready to play again. All right, let's go. The Great Sky Island. <laughs> Link's already dripped out. Nobody's this dripped out when they leave the Great Sky or when they get to the Great Sky Islands. Bro's got a torch, bro's got a Hylian shield. Still in the undies, but you know what? Can't judge them. It's nice to, to, to be a little free with your body. My favorite bread. Baguette's a solid one. I don't want to like steal your answer, but I'm going to steal your answer, dude. I think I'm going to say baguette. Maybe like a nice English muffin or biscuit or something. Hey Zelda, thank you for the sub. Appreciate it. Welcome back. Sourdough's good too. But I haven't had a baguette in a while, so I would I would do all sorts of things for a baguette. Okay. I am going to pick up a key item right now, but as I said, we're allowed to pick up key items, we're just not allowed to use them. So this is our first key item pickup. Which is actually a lot more useful than you might think. You might be like, oh, the carrier pad, like, you don't really need that anyway. Kinda do. <laughs> think about how you got to the recall shrine. The recall shrine is the one near Room of Awakening, which, the, which is the island we just jumped from. So we gotta get back up to that island without teleporting. And you might be like, oh, like, fly up there. With what, bro? With what? <laughs> I can't use my battery because I'd be using a key item. I can't spawn things because that's picking up something to spawn it. Where are we going, robot? Temple of Time? Cool. Been there. Another way. It's the Todd Pad. <laughs> I love that name, the Todd Pad. Okay. Can I make that jump? I don't think I can. Do I send it, though? I feel like I want to send it. There's no shot I make that jump, but if I do... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a dream. Go! I'm not making that. Oh my god, I'm not making that. Why did I try that? Listen, listen, listen. In my defense, in my defense, normally you can jump slash. Normally you can jump slash to get a bit more distance. 
But I can't jump slash. I can't do anything with this challenge. This challenge is so restricting. Like, what can I even do after this challenge? And please, nobody say, try to do, like, minimum key items, minimum items, shrines. Because, oh my god, bro. I think the shrine streams were longer than beating the game streams. It was, like, 40 hours of footage almost. But it's so worth it. I don't have any regret in my mind of doing the shrines. The shrines was awesome, dude. And honestly, like, I want to say almost more crazy. It probably didn't have the same, like, moments of, like, really, really hype, crazy moments that the being the game did, but just, like, the solutions that we've gotten. Yo, thank you for the cheers, Swinny. I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, I like it. I actually got to thank Sirius for that one. Because Sirius was telling me there's a new controller input, which is what I got now. And it works well. I used to have one before, and it would always crash and break. But yeah, this kind of helps you guys see what I'm doing, which I like. Especially because there's so many glitches going on. And I know that as well, when I'm saying things like, Hey guys, look, I'm pressing Y. I could be, like, lying, but when you look at the controller input, which is, like, right next to me, you're like, oh yeah, he is clicking Y. Like, I'm not lying. Unless I, like, animated that shit beforehand, I guess, but... That seems like... Th this wouldn't make sense. I'm like clicking M on my keyboard or something to like make the button <laughs> light up. It'll be pretty obvious if I cheat. Watching the Super Bowl, nah. Yo, thank you for the follow. TOTK, but you can't press Y. Man, that is this challenge. You guys wanna know something funny? You guys want to something a little goofy? Almost every button I have is completely useless on my controller, okay? Hear me out. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't want to die. Actually, I should have had a death counter. Should I have a death counter, guys? What do you guys want a death counter? Okay. Listen, listen, listen. If I click Y, nothing happens. If I click ZR, nothing happens. He, like, pulls nothing out of his ass. If I click ZL, nothing happens because I don't have a shield. If I click R, nothing happens. If I click L, uh, actually L something would happen, but we're not allowed to use L for this challenge because we can't use runes. So nothing happens if I click L. If I click up on the D-pad, nothing happens. If I click right on the D-pad, nothing happens. If I click left on the D-pad, nothing happens. If I click down on the D-pad, okay, there's something that happens if I click down on the D-pad. What else can I not do? Oh shoot, I just hit scope. I didn't mean to do that. Let me reload. Let me reload. I use the pyramid pad. I use the pyramid pad. I'm reloading. I'm, I'm reloading. I forgot that if you hit right on the D-pad, or sorry, right on the joystick, he goes, wadoosh. Not that that's like a useful thing anyway, but like at the end of this challenge, if I do never use the pyramid pad, I can prove that by showing that I still have the pyramid pad like intro animation. Cause like the first time you pull out the pure pad, it gives you that intro. Oh, thank you for the follow, Gandorf. I hope you're not terrorizing Hyrule. I hope you make it easy on me. No picking up items except key items. No using any item. I'll say. Oh yeah, that's like the the rules. Yeah, I would do like where I can't pick up key items if I could. So obviously I'm going to try to pick up as least as I can. Like, I, I'm not going to pick up any that I don't have to, like the paraglider. But, yeah, you just need to pick up key items. Nobody's found a way to skip all the key items. Yo, what's up, Gandorf? Welcome. Welcome to the first stream. I'm pretty good. Thank you for asking. I'm very happy to be streaming. I'm very happy to be back. Back on the grind. Alright. Ultra hands. I don't think there's any shot of us doing this normally. I'll go in it and just like double check. But I have I have my plans, guys. I have my plans. Raru. Ha. <sighs> Oh, hmm. Oh. 
Why can't he just talk like a normal person? Why he got that Minecraft villager going on? Hmm. Hmm. Todd Drahand. That was bad. He looks at Todd. Yeah, maybe he's getting excited looking at Todd. Mm. This is the Ultra Hand ability. It allows you to move stuff. We're never going to use it, but thanks. Thank you for nothing, Rario. Use ability L to activate. Yeah, the L button's not on my controller, actually, guys. So we can't, we can't do that. Yeah, I mean, now that I think about it, like, the only thing that we can do normally in this entire run is pick up items and throw them. I'm not even joking. There's nothing I can do with no runes. I guess I can climb ladders and climb. So I can walk, I can climb, and I can pick up rocks and throw them. That's awesome. <laughs> okay. Let's try to solve this. Obviously, we're going to go back to our alt save. So... Let's go back here. And we're going to do three glitches. Not the same ones as before. One of them is. Should I keep taking coding notes while I want stream, or should I play Halo? Uh, taking coding notes. Sounds exciting. Alright. So we're gonna go to the alt save, and it's this shrine. Uku. Or Yukau. Something. What I want to do is I want to build a hover bike, and I want to slot it in that shrine. There's a few issues with that, but I already know how to get around them. I've planned. I'm thinking five steps ahead. So first of all, you can't spawn zona devices inside of shrines, right? Otherwise you can cheese like all the shrines because you'd just be able to build hover bikes inside of shrines. So how am I gonna get the zona devices in the shrines if I can't if I can't go in there and spawn them? A glitch. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> so if I want let's say a fan. Alright. B and A on the fan. So now you can't see it, but the fan is still trying to leave my inventory. Even though it left my inventory, there's a duplication where it's still trying to leave my inventory. And you're gonna see that in a second. Also, if you're going to watch the Super Bowl in a few minutes, please enjoy that. Have fun with it. And if it's over, I'll probably still be streaming. Like, when it ends. So you see, now I can still spawn zone devices in the shrine. So, what we want is two fans and a steering stick. Okay, so we're gonna fuse and tangle that. Oh. Oh, wait, I forgot. Oh, no, I goofed up. Yeah, I goofed up. I goofed up. It's fine. It's fine. We gotta redo it. Wait, actually, we should uh, have the puppy bowl and, like, a little window at the corner. It's not illegal, though. Because you have to, you can't just stream the Super Bowl, right? Isn't that like for broadcasting of different TV channels? Okay, so fan BA. <laughs> okay. Two fans and a steering stick. Gonna click B. We're gonna fuse and tangle the steering stick. We're gonna fuse and tangle the fan. Bluetooth, fun. 
Now we're gonna drop this, and we're going to fuse and tangle that fan. Okay, and now we just zuggle. Zuggling the glitz is the glitz that we can like get th things to traverse through safes. So if you're confused what I'm doing, since I'm slotting and like fuse and tangling the shields, like the the shield that's on my back right now is fuse and tangled to one of these fans, I think. Uh, so if I zuggle it, it's gonna come back to me in the other save, and I'm also gonna build it in this save. I'm gonna build the hover bike. But burritos, you're gonna use your battery if you do this. No, I'm not, because you don't actually use battery when you're in shrines. And I don't even have the battery to sell yet. No worries, enjoy it. Okay. We go up right there. We're gonna angle this down. And right here. I don't like that placement. The one scary thing is, if I flip the bike over, I don't think I'll be able to fix it. Okay, I think that's good. Now we just hope. <laughs> now we just hope that this works. Oh wait, this is still the dirty save, isn't it? Yeah, this is still the dirty save. I think this one is clean. I think this is the clean save. I gotta be careful about the saves, because if I overwrite, yeah, this is the clean save. If I overwrite the wrong save, then we could lose it. There it is. Can we write it? Yes. <laughs> Just listen to all the puzzle rings. <laughs> Dude, I don't think even speedrunners do this shrine this fast. Oh, that's gold. Oh, gosh, I thought I died there. Uh, yeah, TTS does work. Um, it's, I, I've been hearing it. Yeah, I've, I've been hearing it. Uh, I don't know. Okay. We got Ultra Hand. Or we completed Ultra Hand. Without using Ultra Hand. And without using items. You have done well to reach this place. Boy, have I. Hey, Belitos, where did you get the gamepad viewer? I think it's called Periscope. Back with a bread question. How much bread have you eaten today? I ate a biscuit today. So, two biscuits. Two biscuits worth of bread. Guys, who, who has these? The Sour Patch Watermelons. I think everybody in the right mind would just choose to eat normal Sour Patch, right? Why do melons exist? It's just a worse version of the kid. <laughs> Make a Todd emote. Oh, we have one on our Discord server. Actually, Zelda, if you're here, can you plug the server and then pin it? Or if you put the, the server in by code? I'll pin it. <gasps> you did very well getting through that shrine and you've restored a you've restored an ability. This is wonderful. <laughs> Raru, I didn't do shit, bro. I rode a fan bike through that. If you visit and complete two more shrines, you still be able to open the door to the Temple of Time. Bet. Mm. You may want to mark the shrines with distance pins. You'll never do- Bro, I can't. Wait, is he gonna force me to use the pure pad? No. No. No, 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 please, 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 please don't. 
No. Okay, it doesn't force me. It doesn't force me. We're fine. 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 We're so fine. We're so fine. We're kind of fine. Um. <laughs> this might be problematic. Can I walk across that? <laughs> Can I walk across the beam? Anyone got ideas? I'd give a whole dollar and 55 cents for a pack of Sour Patch Watermelon. It's one of the tiny ones though. It's like a fun pack. Yo, Trumpy, thank you for the resub. I'm pretty good. Zeldar, were you able to pin that or should I pin that? Okay. Here's my plan, guys. Since I can only climb, I need to get over to that island. Oh, gosh, I, I almost keep scoping. I gotta remember, do not scope. Do not scope. I'm gonna jump in the water, and I'm gonna try to climb across that beam. That's my plan. I just gotta be precise. I'm a gamer, I can do that. I just gotta hold straight forward. And you guys, you guys will see in real time if I'm actually holding straight forward. So if I'm... If I'm just lying and I'm like, oh, dude, I was so straight, and you just see me like curving like that on the controller, call me out on it. All right, you got this. Easy, easy. Let me play some music to concentrate. All right. We're in, we're locked in, we're locked in. Just hold forward, just hold forward. Nice and smooth, nice and steady. Steady, steady goes, steady goes. Tilt the camera a little bit. We're fine, we're fine, we're... Bro, I can jog this. Hold. Hold! Faster, 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 faster. Oh my god, we're fine. Okay. We're going to Fuse, baby. Mm -hmm. Wait, Fuse is gonna be tough. I just realized, because. We can't just build a flying machine to get over fuse. Okay, we're fine. Ate two whole baguettes in one day and one sitting. Bro likes baguettes. Oh, fire! You guys know I like fire because now we can let our torch back up. Todd's back. Todd's back to full power. Don't worry about the trail of things we're burning. <laughs> Look, I know that Todd is technically not great for the environment, but he's great for me, okay? What's up, Aru? I love the view of the Temple of Time. I always took a moment to appreciate whenever I passed by here. The garden time was quiet. The only sound to be heard was the time bell ringing. Settle down, music. The garden of time was quiet. The only sound to be heard was the time bell ringing in the mornings and evenings. It was as if the whole place changed as it chimed. Especially at night when the sound signaled the emergency of fireflies. Those times are glorious. Bro, like, wants to live in the 2012 days again. That just sounds like me reminiscing over, like, Subway Surfers and... I guess Subway Surfers is still popular. But, like, OG Mario Galaxy? Yes, nobody even knows what that is anymore. But the ones that did play it, I see you, and I respect you. Okay, you guys want to see how bad Todd is at killing enemies? Hold up. Hold up, let's try to... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Wait, he's not bad. Wait, I'm lying. He's actually great. No, 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 no. Why did I backflip there? 
Oh man, I wanted to kill my first like squad of enemies. Yeah, Galaxy was a great game. Remember he's the bread man? Yeah, to Todd's great. Okay, look, Todd is really good for like these enemies, but when it gets to the harder enemies, he's not gonna do so good. Also, I think Todd's te technically still on fire. Let's double check. Yeah, he is, he is, he is. He's on fire. That's like a weird thing about Todd. Oh, backflip! No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. Burn, 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 burn. Yeah, even though Todd doesn't look like he's on fire. Let's go, Todd. That's all Todd. I gotta kill the guy up here. This is so pointless. <laughs> There's, there's nothing I can gain from this because I can't pick up anything. But you know what? It, it's my pride. It's my ego. Knowing that I'm still powerful even though I have nothing. I'm not worthless. Oh, we're fine. Okay. Sweet. I love chests. I'm not... <laughs> Thank you, game. Thank you for tempting me. Oh, I forgot about this lake, actually. How are we going to get over the lake? Because normally, I just ultra hand something. Hmm. Is there, like, something I can walk on? Like, can I walk on that? The gate? Surely not. I don't think I can walk on that. Oh yeah, true. Yeah, the death counter shouldn't exist because it will be too much. How do I get over there? Hmm. Are you gonna have to slot? I can't slot another hover, another hover bike, because I don't have battery cell, and even if I did, I can't use it. So the, the hover bike lotting thing only works in shrines. But yeah, that I can understand why you'd be confused about that. Lotting hover bikes is fine, but it just doesn't work in the in high roll or in the overworld. Cause I don't have infinite battery out here. I definitely can't swim it. I don't wanna have to go all the way around. But I might have to. Let me think. I know there's a secret passageway down here. Maybe I could slot something in to like open up the passageway. Yeah, this is the secret passageway. So if we... I think it's locked off on the other side, but maybe we could put something over there. Or maybe we could climb around. Like maybe we can like climb on one of these. I don't know. There's a way. There's a way. Okay, so we can't break this. Oh man, I see like a little hole right there. <laughs> I just... Uh, imagine if you could climb through that. It almost looked like you could for a second. If you just squeeze... Link, to squeeze your body through that. Get your skinny ass through that hole. Okay. What could I even slot to break that? Oh, wait, time bomb would work, right? Because time bomb doesn't use battery. I think time bomb would work. I think time bomb would definitely work. Okay. Let's make a manual save right here. And let's go back to our dirty save. Thank you for the follow, Shadow. Mr. Shadow Gamer. All right, this is our dirty and then I'm going to activate the time bomb by throwing it. Because like I said, that's like the one thing I can do. I can pick up items and then throw them. Alright, let's go to View Shrine. Bomb flower and light it with Todd. That would work too. Although I probably would kill myself, but it would open it. 
Actually, if you kill yourself, but you also break a destructible rock, does the rock stay destroyed when you respawn? It does, right? I think both methods will work. I think both should work. Okay. On this save, the rock's not here. Oh, it is here. Okay, that's fine. Let's get a weapon out and... Is there really no rocks to fuse down here? What could I... It's pretty good. Thank you. Thank you for asking. There's gotta be a rock around here somewhere. Actually, what am I thinking, dude? I can just throw a bomb at this. Bomb. Bombs away. Alright. So, let's get a new shield out. Let's spawn a time bomb. Just lot it. And then load back the save. Okay. Let's see if the bomb's here. Let's see if the bomb is here. Uh oh. Oh, hi. <laughs> that looks great. Why does he not hold it properly? What? Wait, why would he hold it like this? Huh? Is it because of Todd? That's so strange. Okay, anyway. Let's toss it. No, 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 it's gonna not make it. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Double check that we didn't pick up anything. We're good, we're good. Also, yeah, this is the one thing we can do is we can pick up rocks and we can chuck them. Oh, and look, Todd's like a headlamp for us. When we pick this up, he's just pointing straight forward. He's a little excited. All right, fuse might be a little tricky. Because we need a key. I'm not super worried about using the key because the key actually guys I'm gonna I'm gonna come out and say it. I am gonna come out and say it. The key isn't a key item. Look, I said it's a key item as a joke in the video. It's not a key item. It doesn't show up in your key items category. It's like, it doesn't even have an inventory category necessarily. It's kind of like rupees, where it just like, is off in the corner. So it's not really anything. So I am going to use the key. Because it's not a key item and it's not an item. It's neither. It's it's weird miscellaneous category. This is the fuse ability. Allows you to fuse. Mm. Hmm. Cool. Select ability. I'm good. So in the last one, we used the boulders to build a ladder. But we can't use Ultra Hand. <laughs> so we could break the rocks with a time bomb. We could also just build another hover bike to fly over this. And then we need to get the chest. Hmm. So we build a hover bike. Let's let's imagine this. We build a hover bike. We fly over, we get the chest, we get the key. We unlock the door. Yeah, just Todd. Just stuff that I zuggle in. So we get the key, we open up the door, and then we have the other problem of there's another wall. So I would need to build like a Zenai device that can go through that door. Like that can fly and fit through that door. Right? Hover bike with a cannon? <laughs> Wait, that's actually an awesome idea. That's such a fun idea, actually. I love that idea. Hoverbike with a cannon. Okay, let's build that. Let's build a hoverbike with a cannon. Um, but how are we going to get it through the door? Huck. 
Because there's another there's another stone wall, guys. On the other side of that door, there's another stone wall. Okay, let's load back our dirty save, which is... Oh boy, did I lose my dirty save already? Oh no. Oh no, did I already lose my dirty save? No, 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 no. This is terrible if we already lost it. This is so bad if we lost our dirty save. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. This is when the nightmare really starts, guys. This is when the nightmare really starts. Oh no. Guys, without the dirty save, we can't... <laughs> I think we may have to restart and take better care of save management. Oh wait, I hear myself double. Hmm. I mean, what do I like need to finish this? I need, I definitely need a steering stick. And we like, even we couldn't get a steering stick on the Great Scott Island. Yeah, we have to restart. Dead run, no. And it's cause I don't have the stupid save. Cause I made this my manual save for that one instance to get the time bomb over. Oh, the save management so brutal. Could you manual save now, play dirty to get back where you need to go and then return? The thing is, you're right, I can do that. I can make this my manual save and then like just play dirty to get the stuff that I need. But it would take probably like just as long just to get my 100% save file back. So I think I'd rather just do that. Because having the 100% save file was very nice, just so that, like, whenever we need something, bam, we got it. We got it done. But I'll, I'll leave it up to a vote. How about that? How about this, guys? Do you guys want me to go back and get the 100% save file? Or do you want me to continue from here and play dirty and then get exactly the stuff we need? And then come, come back. I think we should get the 100, but I'll... Do, like, one if you think I should keep playing from here and two if you think I should get the hundo wait hold on just saying if we're gonna throw this one away why aren't we doing the funniest thing ever and streaming Madden <laughs> no I don't even have Madden one would probably be easier to get the stuff I feel like restarting we could get back here in like 30 minutes I see a lot of twos. I think I think we get the hundo first. Guys, how about this? We speed run in this. We speed run in this now. So I'm going to close up. Thank you, the follow standard. Oh yeah. Close your eyes, everyone. Everyone close your eyes. I'm getting my, like, regular save file back. These are just saves. Okay, main, inject the backup. Yes, sir. Yes, please. These are not mods. This is just my save files. Okay. Restored. Todd's not dead, guys. He's just, he's resting back in his, his loving home. This is just like a reset. Todd didn't break. Todd didn't die. He's fine. He's living a good life on the beaches of Hawaii. Just blacked out for a second. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm glad you're back. Hopefully you don't black out again. Hopefully we don't need to reset again so you don't need to black out. Okay. Let's go to... I roll field, I guess. It doesn't really matter where we go. Thank you for the follow, Josh. He's on the beaches of Lurlin. Dude, J he's everywhere, man. Anywhere that you can find a, a torch, that's Todd. He lives inside of all of our games, inside of all of our hearts, inside of all of our souls. Hot. Okay. New game, right? Yeah. 
Wait, I don't need to do new game just yet. First, I need to do the gas thing again. All right, let's restart the timer. Guys, mark my words. Mark my words. 30 minutes of your time and I'm back. 30 minutes and I'm back. All right, that's the challenge. We're going to try to do it twice as fast. But I'm going to give myself a bit of a head start by, by already gassing stuff. The timer starts when I hit new game. The timer starts when I hit new game, okay? That's fair. So I get to zuggle before I go in. That way we don't have to deal with the bats. Okay. Look out landing. Sub three hours trust. Listen, the sub three hour dream, I don't know if it's gonna happen. <laughs> I don't know if I'm a believer of that one. The sub four throw, I mean the sub four, that's a freebie. If we're playing some bets, that's a freebie. It's not a freebie. It's not a freebie. You would lose all your points if that's a bet. Alright. Equip a shield. Spawn a wheel. Fuse and tangle. Equip new weapon. Why is it not loading any of my weapons? Whatever. I'm just gonna delete the fuse off this. Alright. Pull it, gas it up. Zoggle it up. 30 minutes, 30 minutes. 30 minutes. 30 minutes, guys. 30 minutes. I'm a man of my word, okay? Who's a believer? Who believes in the dream? The 30 minute dream? Some said it was impossible. Some said it was unrealistic. Some called me crazy. But others, the select few that believed, called me a goddamn genius. Thirty minutes. Right? Now. We know what we're doing. We know exactly what to go, where to go, exactly what to slot, exactly what we need to do. We're ready. No fooling around, no funny business. Straight to fuse, beelining it. Skipping every cutscene. It's time for Twilight Princess theme. All right, skip, 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 skip. I didn't skip that fast, it's fine. Go! Go! We're speed running. Zelda, I don't care. Stop talking to me. Oh, 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 oh. Go! Gosh, the intro's so slow. I know! I know the statue and shit! I don't care! Oh, the Master Sword. Cool! I don't need it! I don't want it. You can have it if you want. Can I have your torch, though? Can we trade Zelda? Loki, if we could trade weapons right now, I'd be so happy. I'd be so happy. That would make my day, Zelda. He's on world record pace? Oh, you already know, dude. We're hitting records with this. Beating the game with items is so outdated. The new route just doesn't use anything. Think about it. I, ha I don't have to waste time like picking up or using anything. Think about all the time we're saving from that. Because every time you attack, every time you scope with your pirate pad, every time you teleport, that's just animations. That's just time waste. Like, we don't have to do that if you think about it. Like guys, think about this for a second, right? When you go down here normally in the speedrun, you like attack the bats, right? We don't even have to do that. We're, we're, we're skipping, we're bat attack skip. That's a terrible name. What should we name the skip? 
Oh my god, the time save. Oh my god, the time save. The time save. Bro, we're saving so much time with bad skip. The bad skip is so good. Okay. I gotta focus up. The pace is crazy. I don't want to jinx it. We could record pace. Has anyone else been in the game without items? Nope. Not that I know of, at least. Oh, I love that the wheel's just hanging out. What is this place? I don't know, Goro. Why does this guy have to be pre-rendered? What is that? I just spe spent 1k betting that you will win. Win for me. <laughs> I'll win for you, Chumpy. I'll do my best. No, I won't do my best. I'll... Chumpy. Chumpy. Listen. I will win for you. I will win for you, okay? Wait, so you can only pick up key items, but you can't use them. How are you going to do anything? That's a great question, Limbo. <laughs> Why don't you find out with me? A lot of glitches, basically. Just a shit ton of glitches. Um, just to name a few. Zuggling. Use entangling. Slotting. Gassing. Drop smuggling. SLD duping. There's like probably 10 more. Oh, uh, zone eye storage. What else are we doing? What else are we doing, guys? Dark nope, it was Todd. A lot of glitches, bro. The main one that like really Can matters though, it's called run. Zuggling. It's the glitch that lets you basically like super glue things to your back and then it goes with you through saves. But you can't use them. But it still exists in the world. So that's how I killed the bats. Is I gassed a wheel so that it always spins and then I have it zuggled onto my like hand. So when I walk into bats, it just spins and kills them. Wrong scene. Oh, shoot. Thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm doing all these, like, hand motions and stuff. <laughs> My bad. I saw your key items only run with using Tiger Man and Zuggling. I meant to see how you get around not using key items. Yeah, my brain, I was like, you know. We did only key items. We did only key items on shrines. How many key items do we need? You know? And at first I was like, we, we need like all of them. But then I'm like, do we need all of them? And then I started digging. And then I started digging a little deeper. And I was like, okay. Maybe I can pull this off. Do we? I'll be so for real. No ish. <laughs> I don't think it's possible to do no key items. I think maybe we can pull it off with one. I think maybe there's a chance that we can beat the game with only one use of a key item. Which I think is pretty insane on its own. But probably not. Probably not. Let's keep the hopes like at a very like steady. 20% this is gonna happen <laughs> I'd say for the chances that we can beat it with one key item I'd say it's like a 20% chance for the chances that we can beat it with no key items like 0 0.01 and I I'm gonna try my best to do that but you guys are gonna see like how many issues there are with that there's a lot of issues with it Okay, we're back to the speed run. Oh wait, I need the torch, I need a torch. Okay, load save. Let's go back to emergency shelter. No, I don't have the torch. Okay, we're gonna use the wooden stick. It saves time, it saves time. I, I wanna get the torch, but we need to use the wooden stick. We have no time. We cannot waste time getting the torch right now. I know, I'm a bad father. I'm a bad father, I'm a bad father. I'm going to pick up Todd from school. Give me like 30 minutes though. 
like wait till after school ends you know he's still studying all right let's let's drop this let's get a wooden stick do i not have a wooden stick on this file does this burn the rocket does this catch on fire please catch on fire doesn't catch on fire oh no we need Todd we need Todd we need Todd okay backup plan backup plan we're getting Todd we're getting Todd we're doing another glitch pocket rocket oh shoot I didn't mean to do that pocket rocket is one of the best glitches in the game for movement at least do, do, do. We're getting Todd. We're getting Todd. Where is he? We're scouting him out. Alright, this is a good angle right here. This is a good angle. Alright, what do we need besides just Todd? That's literally it, right? I mean, we need a lot of the stuff in Ultra Hands. What are we at? We're not even at 10 minutes. We're not even at 10 minutes. Guys, we've got so much time. We've got so much time. We could have a picnic right now. You guys want to have a picnic? Light it. Todd's lit. Todd Zuggled. Load. We're going back. We need to get fused in 21 minutes. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Believe. Believe in the dream. Breath of the Wild, team. Go, 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 go. It's too... I need something faster. Fast, fast, fast. What's like a speedrun music? This is like puzzle solving music. Mario Slider? Mario Slider? So many cutscenes. Yeah. Mario Slider. Damn. I know this song, but I never knew the name of it. You never manual saved on the dirty save, though, so. I never manual saved on the clean save, though. So the dirty save should be the manual save. Right? We'll double check. We'll double check. Yeah, that's dirty. That's dirty. 100%. Okay. G-Dog, I really appreciate you right now. I actually love it when people, like, keep me in check of my saves. Because if I lose that save again, I'm gonna be in pain, dude. <laughs> so if you, like, realize... Oh, wait. He's about to run out of auto saves, and he's gonna get rid of his dirty save. If you're, like, that in tune, holy shit, you're a genius. You're a mastermind. Please help me. <laughs> Please tell me that I'm about to lose my dirty save if you know. And if you don't know, then don't worry about it, dude. Just enjoy the stream. Alright. Breath of the Wild 2017. I'm up for that. This sure does go hard. This sure does not deserve. It has no right being this good. Let's quiet down tears a little bit. Oh. 
I wonder, has the majority of people that have played Tears also played Breath? Yeah, right? I want to think so. Can I land on this delay pad? That would save us time. Nice, we can. Are we going to jump to this delay pad? No! That's time loss, that's time loss. Let's go, Link. Come on. Come on. 30 minutes! That's an epic trailer. The history of the royal family of Hyrule is also the history of the Calamity Ganon. Dude, I'm excited to see your game art. That has endured over the, ages. the music fits. The music does kind of fit, though. Mm -hmm. It's kind of a little, like, overly epic for what we're doing now, though. Todd pad. Todd Ura pad. Go! Gosh, spamming dialogue to this music is like. <laughs> this is like as epic as music gets, and I'm just spamming the. <laughs> I think maybe. Maybe it's not the music for this. You have no recollection of me, however. I got so many cutscenes. Ready to hear. We need to move, Link. We need to move. Stop staring at the bridge. You can make that, dude. Just run. Just run, Link. We got like 20 minutes left, bro. We got 15 minutes left. Holy shit, we have no time. Link, we made them a promise. It was Todd. It wasn't you. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. <laughs> Gosh, the dopamine surge in my brain right now from this music. Ooh, ooh. This makes me want to go back and play Breath of the Wild again. I wonder if anyone's done Breath of the Wild with only key items. It's probably not possible. But then again, people said that for this game. And I said, lol, you're wrong. I didn't say that. I just did it. You're five minutes ahead of your first- I'm only five minutes ahead? Open your eyes. Oh god, that's terrible. Gosh, I'm so- Why am I so slow? I should be like ten minutes ahead. All right, we gotta we gotta smooth. We gotta smooth it. Do we do the tear shiller now? I want your opinions. Is the is the Breath of the Wild trailer better or worse than the tear trailer? The final trailer of tears. Because I feel like final trailer of Breath of the Wild and final trailer of tears, they like matched that energy. I think tears did it a little bit better to be honest. Which is a lot to say because that trailer was good. That's the one you just listened to, the Breath of the Wild trailer. All right, I got to remember, keep the manual save always on the dirty. Under no circumstance, under no circumstance, should I have the dirty save be the manual. I mean, be, be the clean. Gosh, I'm confusing myself already. <laughs> what well, sounds weird that like I would want my manual save to be dirty, but that's just, that just makes it so that we can't lose it. Because we, we really want to keep that save. That save carries us. Just a little bit. Not that much. Alright. We're going to walk in the shrine. We're going to get the auto save from going into the shrine. And then we're going to TB back to our manual save, which is dirty. We're going to go to the shrine. We're going to slot the hover bike. We're going to make up so much time here, guys. We're going to make up all the time we need. We've got 13 minutes left in a dream. All right, tears shiller, tears shiller. Mm 
You're now nine minutes ahead of first run. Oh, we take that. We will take that. All right, all right, all right, all right. Raru, stop talking to me. I need to go. I don't want to take your old. You can have it. I'm never going to use this ability, dude. At least Todd's here with me. Todd keeps me comforted. Plus, no more time loss from the contract battle. True. That's a big time save right there. Oh, gosh. Okay, sorry. I want to turn down a little bit. Okay, wait. We have the manual save now. So now we go to... Let's go to this one. All right. As soon as we load, we TP to Ultra Hand. We do Zonai Storage. We go in Ultra Hand. Two fans, one steering stick. Slot them all. Build the hover bike. Load back to save. Boom, boom, bang. Like that. Like that. What am I doing? Not like that. Okay. <laughs> like that. Do -do. Do -do. Do -do. Is it really you using the ability? Maybe it's Todd. Debatable, right? Okay. Get a fan out. A, B in the same time. Go in the shrine. We rely on your knight and that legendary sword he carries. Our last legendary sword? Let's legendary? I don't know about that. I think there's something a little more legendary at the sword that he carries. And Todd. They always forget about the middleman. And Todd. Do, 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 do. All right, we're cooking, we're cooking, we're cooking. Zuggle this. Unequip it. Zuggle this. Unequip it. Zuggle this. When I leave Ultra Hand, can someone tell me what my time's looking at in comparison? Like how far ahead we are? Speed running the bike building. Let's go. Oh wow, we kind of timed it at the same time, Tulin. W Tulin. Tulin knows what's up. Tulin gets it. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Right there. That's so janky. That's such a janky bike. I'm going to fix it. I want to fix it. I don't want to make it that bad. It's, it can be a little better. Like there. I'm happy with that. I'm fine with that. Okay. Uh, this is our good save. This is going to work. This is going to work. You must find me. You guys see that with my stamina bar? Wait, somebody clipped that with my stamina bar. Has anyone? S Did you see I had full stamina? Did somebody see that? I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. Anyway, we got we got the shrine. We got the shrine. I'm not crazy. I had a full bar of stamina when I shouldn't have. Zuggling stamina? Question mark? Doesn't exist. But that was a weird glitch. You have an idea for the apple shrine? I've tried a lot. I'm skeptical. All right. Guys, we're doing well on time, right? Okay, wait, wait, we have eight minutes. Okay, eight minutes just to get to fuse. Eight minutes to get to fuse and we're good. 
That's plenty of time. That's plenty of time. We need to not fall. We need to not fall when we get to the, the rail. We need to get the rail first, right? We just need to beeline it. We're not going to mess with the enemies. Oh, we need to get the bomb. We need to just lock the bomb. Okay. We just got to smooth. We got to smooth. Let's do Bowser's Castle. Twelve minutes ahead. Oh, we're making time up. We're making so much time up right now. No, Robert is gonna talk to me. Hi. Cool. It's like when an adult comes over and is like, hey, like, how's life going? And you're like, good. I'm going to go back to my room now. <laughs> Oh, I shouldn't have jumped there. I shouldn't have jumped there. Send it, send it, send it right now. Nice. Okay, we gotta go fast. We gotta go fast. We don't have time for this. We don't have time for it. We just gotta go. Lock in, lock in, lock in. It's easy. It's so easy. It's so easy. It's so easy. It's so easy. Sub 30. Sub No! Time loss. No! No! How could that happen to me, dude? I was an inch away. I'm playing it safe. I'm playing it safe. Okay. We're gonna light Todd here. Does this give us an auto save? Wait, maybe we should maybe we should rest here. I think this will give us an auto save. We rest here. You can pass time by fire. Yeah, let's rest here. So we'll we'll get the auto save here, and let's let's lock the bomb now. If we lot yes, this will save us so much time. This will save us so much time. We just lock the bomb now so that we don't have to walk there twice. Go back to our manual save. 14 minutes ahead. Okay. Oh yeah, my webcam did freeze. Wait, why? Why did my webcam freeze? And such an un- Why did it? What? Okay. Guys, there's no time to fix the webcam right now. <laughs> you guys gotta just go without for a second. I'm, I don't have time. Or should I just pause the timer? No, that didn't. Okay, shit. I deleted the timer. What was the time at when I stopped it? What was the time at? What was the time at? webcam difficulties like this before. I'm sorry, guys. Let me try turning it off and back on. Twenty-five forty. Okay. Let me fix the timer. Damn, 25.40? I don't know if that's enough time. Oh, sick. Thank you. You don't gotta let me know, though. Okay. Is the webcam gonna work now? Why is the webcam not working?
Okay, 2540 is what we were at. Right? Hopefully this is right. Oh gosh, is that ours? That's ours. <laughs> Shoot. I think it's fair to stop the timer right now just because we're not actually doing anything. 2540. Okay, that's correct. That's correct. Now it's just the webcam. Guys, I think I solved it. I think I might have solved it. I might have solved it. Wait, Prage? Prage? Maybe? <gasps> okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> you guys know what happened? You guys want to know what happened? So, real quick. I was so gaming that I was, like, kicking my feet like this. And I kicked the port. So when it was like in my PC, like the USB cable got dislodged. It was like to the side a little bit, but we're good now. We're back. We're so back. Okay. Timer is starting right now. Oh gosh. Why did I do that? I didn't mean to do that. I'm dying. Okay. What am I doing? I got, I lost my train of thought. I lost my train of thought. I have three minutes. I have four minutes. Uh, Anisa, Anisa, Anisa. Can we see your painting? Wait, what painting? Who are you talking about? Oh, someone else is painting. I apologize for the frozen camera and you having to stare at me going like, like that for like five minutes probably. But we're back. Oh gosh. Okay. This is actually intense. This is actually so intense. We're down to minutes. No, I need to break this. Bomb, 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 bomb. What did that happen? Oh, cause I have the torch. I have the torch, and I can't. Okay, I just have to take the damage. I just take, take, tank, tank the damage. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. fine. Guys, we're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. No. There's no time. There's literally no time. There's literally no time. I need to get here in like three minutes. There's no time. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Three minutes to run to fuse. Three minutes to run to fuse. Put that song back on. Put that song back on. Link, you gotta run, bro. You gotta run. Come on. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. There's that stamina glitch again. Go. We just have to get infused. We just have to get infused. We just have to get infused and we're there. Go a little faster, Link. We don't have time for this. We have like two minutes to get there. Can I make this fall? I don't have time to think about it. We just gotta go. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I need to pick up that bomb and throw it so quickly. How long does the time bomb take to explode? Go! Oh, if the time bomb's not there, we're so screwed. We gotta pray to the time bomb's there. Come on, time bomb. Where is it? Please load in. Please load in. Please load in. It's there. It's there. It's there. I, see, I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. Pick up. Throw. 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 Perfect. 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 Now, go. We're gonna make it, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it. No, stamina, 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 stamina. Oh, we're, we still have it, we still have it. What did I say, chat? What did I say? Did you think I was lying when I said 30 minutes? Did you think I was lying when I said 30 minutes? Get these people their points. Whoever voted for me, thank you. Thank you for your trust. That's the sub 30 entry right there. 
with a minute to spare. You cannot make that shit up, dude. I don't think I could have saved an extra minute, honestly. I guess I could have saved like time by climbing better. But like everything else about that run was snappy. I can't end vote. W frozen camera. Please don't scare me with the frozen camera, guys. I can see that the camera's not frozen. You cannot trick me. Oh, it feels good. It feels good. We're back. We're so back. It took us 30 minutes to just do it again. All right. So now we go back to this save. <laughs> From that one video of where you have to look at a rupee and then it like clips you through. That's an interesting one. If you guys don't know what he's talking about, in Twilight Princess, there's this like weird, I guess you could call it a bug, where if you grab a rupee and you're like standing on next to a wall or something, the animation for like holding a rupee like isn't a perfect loop. So instead of looping what like it's supposed to and like ending the animation where the animation starts, it's like a holding animation where you're supposed to just like keep doing this. At the end of every animation, it's missing one frame where he goes back to like the center, which means he like moves by like a few pixels to the left or to the right. I don't remember which one. So if you just like let your game run like that for like a day or so, he'll like actually travel like a couple inches into walls, which is like very, very little, but it, it can like clip you through things. So it's used for like lowest percent. It's pretty neat. It's pretty cool. Anyone want to hear a specific song? Okay. Actually, let me focus for this part. Let me focus. So we have what we need now to slot in whatever we... Oh, wait. I didn't do zone storage. But what are we going to build? I guess just a hover bike and then try to get it through. Oh, yeah, the cannon hover bike. That's what we we're going to do. Okay. It misses two frames that put Link... Oh, it's two? Damn. Animation screw uh animation crew really screwed up, didn't they? They goofed. Okay. Let's do Fan B A. Go back in the shrine. You can't even see pole. Actually maybe I can in the poll. I gotta get these people their points. Whoever voted for me getting the sub thirty. The true goats. Um, pull. Man, it's pull. Oh, it's over. Okay. It's already ended. Alright, so we want two fans, a steering stick, a cannon. Do we want anything else? Is, it, is this the setup? Maybe a time bomb to break the wall? Let's start with this. Yeah, let's start with this. So, fuse entangle fan A. Drop the shield. Oh. Hi. <laughs> I forgot that I was suckled still. <laughs> um Okay, I got to I got to go back out. It always confuses the heck out of me because it does like a really weird thing where if you drop your shield after you fuse entangle it and you're zuggled, like all the shields that I just dropped are all like also fuse entangled to the shield or to the fan. It's so weird. It's so weird. I don't even know, man. I'm trying to explain something that I don't understand, but I don't understand it. So I don't want to continue with it. I want to keep it so that I understand things because that's how you don't get lost. And I was very lost. You haven't gotten your points yet? Can I just send people points? 
Why can't Twitch just let me do that? All right. Fan, fan, steering stick, and cannon, right? Yeah. I'm not gonna get the, the time bomb. I don't think we'll need it if we have the cannon. Okay, fuse and tangle, drop shield. Fuse and tangle, drop shield. Fuse and tangle, drop shield. And, oh. Crap. I don't think I can do it with only one fan. One second, guys. One second. Technical difficulties. Oh, wait, we're not gonna overwrite our, our auto saves, are we? Wait. I'm terrified that we just lost our clean save. Do we still have. Are we making auto saves by doing this? We are. Okay, we still have a clean save there. We have two clean saves. This one is dirty, this one is dirty, this one is dirty, this one is clean, this one is clean, this one is dirty. Okay. It's not like, it's not threat level maximum yet, but it's like DEFCON 1, you know? It's like, it's, it's time to be a little concerned about my saves. Because I think this is going to put it down to the last save. Does this make an autosave? It does, won't it? Oh shoot, I goofed up again. Yeah, this makes another save. I mean, okay. What we could do... That's gonna be fine. That's gonna be fine, guys. It's gonna be fine. If you're not risking it for the biscuit, are you living? If you're not risking it for the biscuit, like, what are you doing? How you got all these on GSI? Oh, this is, uh, th that's the alt save. I have, like, everything unlocked on this save, if you want to look at my map. 72%. I've done, like, almost everything on this save. All right, Let's check our saves real quick. We have two clean. Two clean, two clean, two clean, two clean. We still have a backup. Burrito percent win. I don't have a plan for win, but probably like... Next week? I gotta figure out what I even want burrito percent to be and like what the rules are for it. All right, let's Ch let's check our saves. Actually, no. Let's first do this: fan, fan, steering stick, cannon, drop. Let's drop our shield first. Okay. Let's check our saves. Make sure we have backups. Okay, we have two clean saves still. So it's not making any more autos. We should be we should be safe, guys. We should be safe. Nobody panic. I think we're fine. This is gonna be so awesome if it works. I lost the steering stick. Did I not drop it? One second. One second. This this is the one, guys. This is the one. <laughs> Why am I so bad at this right now? I'm struggling. What is burrito percent? It's uh the timer starts when you start a new game, and the timer ends when you make a burrito. Check the saves real quick. Oh gosh, oh gosh. I'm not risking this. That's terrifying. That's terrifying. That's our last clean save. We have to we have to get auto saves now. We have to make auto saves. This is threat level maximum now. 
If we lose this save, then there's no more clean saves. So let's let's just leave this shrine and enter it a, a few times. That way like, we would just like spam the game with like, hey, you should make an auto save because we're going back in the shrine and then we leave and then it's like, oh, we should probably make an, another auto save because he just left the shrine. We're just like juking out the game. We're basically breaking the game's ankles right now by like skirting in and out of the shrine. <laughs> Is it gonna auto save? Please auto save. Maybe it'll auto save when I go back in. How do you make a burrito? I don't know that I can. Damn, I just realized Restream's only reading the chats from Twitch. I feel terrible for the YouTube fellas. Hold on. Let me get the YouTube chat open. I've been giving Twitch all my attention. I'm going to start being a, a YouTuber now. Do, 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 do. Let's see how YouTube chat's doing. It's weird that I, I usually it's supposed to show both. I, I did hear that. Um, that's so strange that it gave me the fuse ability even though I already had it, I think. Anyway, we got our save. Let's see if we can make another one real quick. Try to get another auto save just to be safe. Okay, I see YouTube chat now. Let me pop this chat out. I'm sorry, YouTube fellas. I'm trying to be Breath of Wild again since I played way too much tears, but it's hard since all the mechanics are different. Yeah, I gotta go back and try Breath of the Wild. What's up, Razor Leaf? Twitch, we can see Restream. Yeah, re Restream's really nice because it lets me see YouTube and Twitch. And for whatever reason, it just said, you know what? YouTube people just don't get seen. And that hurts my feelings. And your your feelings are probably hurt too because I'm just ignoring you this whole stream. But I'm not anymore. I've got two chats open. So fear not. All right, did we get an autosave? We only have one? I don't know about that. All right, hey guys, here's my backup plan. Here's my backup plan. I think we should pivot and go to ascend. Hear me out. Hear me out. We go to ascend. Let's try to ascend first, then come back to fuse. I think ascend's gonna be easier and we're going to get a bunch of autosaves on the way to ascend. I think that's what we should do. Man, I've suggested the crab rave three times. I know. Yeah, that's why. I'll, I'll play crab rave. I'm sorry, Prism. Technical difficulties, am I right? Oh, gosh. We love technical difficulties. All right. Let's give you some crab rave. Look at back at Venus. All right. So we're going to we're going to ascend now. Oh, and our torch is on fire. Love to see it. Oh, wait, I have two songs playing. There we go. Can you play? Can you feel the sunshine after Crab Rave? Yeah, I'm down.
do 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 Oh no. Damn, I keep like forgetting that you just need like runes for so much in in this place. How are we gonna get over the little like lake, guys? A little pond. Can we swim that? No, right? We send it though. We send this. I believe. No, I don't believe. I don't believe. I don't believe at all. Oh god, that was stupid. Okay. No, we don't lose. We don't lose Todd. Climb the fence. Can we climb this? Hmm. I don't think we can climb on the fence. Can I swim on along the side of it? Wait, maybe we can just swim, guys. Although I don't know if we have enough stamina to make it. I don't think we're gonna make it. I don't think we're gonna make it. Hmm. Yeah, it's not that close either. Timer stopped. Oh what? no! Why did it stop? What did it stop at? I'll fix the timer real quick. Thank you for letting me know, guys. Oh, live split just crashed. It wasn't even my fault. It's not even my fault, I promise. Live split actually just crashed. All right, I'm guessing it's at like two minutes behind. So put it to 45. Okay, I got you. All right, I don't know if we can actually do this. Just put push log. Oh, we can push logs. Wait, can they just like drift across? That might be a really good idea actually. Cause this log is like perfect for that. Or at least we could stand on it to regain some stamina. Get on, get on, get on, get on, get on. We'll just ride the log, we'll ride the log. No, keep going. Okay. <laughs> this is not gonna work, is it? I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> I'll try it though. Believe! What's up, stair gums? Don't they sink? No, the logs are wood, so they don't sink. Wait, this actually might be doable. We're actually really close. Hold on. Oh, come on, Link, please. Swim. 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 No. <laughs> you were right there. Okay, I think if I perfectly time the dash, we ain't gonna make it. Look, if I perfectly time the dash, maybe. And I gotta get a really, like, good log. Wait, can I push a log into another log to make it, like, go even further into the water? What if I pick up a fan and throw it at another fan to turn it on? Oh, I don't have a battery cell. So it's not gonna turn on. But what if I push this log into this log? And then they both go in the water. Use Ultra Hand. Bro did not read the rules. I can't use any key items. If I could use my runes, yeah, this would be a piece of cake. Do fans float? Can you just throw them and stand on it? I don't think they float. I'll try it though, it's a good idea. 
They float? Fans just float? Wait, I can't get on it? Are you kidding me? No way, dude. Come on. Come on, game. I can't get on the fan. It's right there. You cannot tell me I can't get on that. Okay. Here's what we have to do. Here's what we have to do, guys. We have to throw a fan that's not that far away so that we can still jump on it from the furthest point. What's the furthest point we can get to? I think over here. I think over there. So we're gonna get a fan. We're gonna bring it over to like the, the spot that's closest to that side of the water. We're gonna chuck it in the water, but not too far. And then we're gonna try to jump on it. And let it like carry us as far as it can. So let's toss it like, like here maybe? Oh, that'd be too far. Gosh, that went so far. Okay, we'll toss this one from a little bit further back. Wait, I could like hopscotch this. If I can jump from this one to the next one. No. Oh, it's still, it's still too far, dude. I need another fan. I could like build a platform though. Could you imagine? Do these float? Hey, what's up, Tim? Or time? I don't know where this Tim. <laughs> This says time when I said Tim. Do these float? Please tell me I can get on this. Oh, Link. You can do better, Link. You can do better. You're the hero of time, dude. Alright, alright, alright. Are there any more fans? What about... Okay, let's try let's try throwing it from like really far back so we can definitely jump on it. Cause like we have a bit of a path. Like I feel like if we could get on one, then we can get on the next and like continue it forward. Line it up. No, okay, these definitely won't work. I can't believe I can't get on this. Cryonis would be useful. Oh my gosh. The one time I would actually use Cryonis, dude. Cryonis was like, I, I don't think I ever used that ability like once besides like a single shrine. All right, let's try reloading the save. Let's get our fans back. Can you just climb the wall to the right and land on a fan? Oh, wait, that's actually... An interesting idea. You're saying throw the fan like close to the wall on the right and then climb down onto it? Maybe. But it's it's, it's always drifting this way. Okay. I'll give it a shot. All right, let's try let's try throwing it from behind this. this should be really far back. Dude, that's still so far. Link and throw, like, jeez. From here, surely. Oh my gosh. How do you throw it so far? Here's what I'm thinking now. Let's use, let's go back to the logs. I think the fans might be a dead end. But let's try to push this log in from this side. Cause this is closer than the other, than, than we did before. It's just hard to get it in though. It, it isn't like moving very much. Oh? No. <laughs> it's just going in a straight line. You gotta turn. You gotta turn to the left. Turn. You think of the follow time? Alright, that's not gonna work. Let's go back to basics. Let's give this a second try.
You know what? What are the chances we make this? None, right? But how sure are we? How positive are we that we, that we don't make this? That was some dubstep, dude. Wait, try what? Try it, try what? Just let the current take you? I think the current doesn't push me any further that way. Does it? I don't think it's pushing me closer to this. I can smell the flowers on the other side. I can hear the birds chirping. We're not gonna make it. <laughs> we need like one log of distance. We need one log. We actually just need one log. What flowers? The ones in my in my head. Hmm. Oh wait, that's the one. That's the one. That's the one. We need to get on. So I sprint jump off, or was that a waste? We need to get. This is the run. This is the run. I need to be perfect about my stamina here. I need to be perfect. Wait. I think this could be it. I think this could be it. That was a perfect launch off the log. I'm just letting the current take me. Just keep holding forward. Just keep holding forward. Oh, it's so close. It's so close. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Swim, 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 swim. What's pushing me? It's pushing me back. <laughs> I got I got scammed there, dude. I got pushed back. Delirium is a beautiful This is not delirious, okay? This is possible. This is so possible. For the golden apple side, my idea is you get in the, with the dirty save, two low to clean save, die, save three, die four. I don't know if it would work. So that's me on Discord. I'm not going to think about that right now. Mm -hmm. I'll test that another time. I feel like the log is the way. I'm a log believer personally. What if I swim into it to give it more propulsion? Okay, wait, wait, wait. If I have the log in the water and I toss the fan. I need a fan that's closer. Maybe the fan's what I need. That's the one, that's the one. No, it just, it just flips when I jump on it. Stay on, stay on, stay on, stay on. hard to stay on it. <laughs> no. I 
if I could get on that one over there. Wait, maybe this log will... Tilt when it gets hit. Can I make that? Come on, get on it. Get on it, Link. You can get on that fan. I know you can. Just swim. <laughs> Just swim and get on the fan. <laughs> I spent like 40 minutes trying to get into the Discord and succeeded. Let me send the Discord again. It's when he believes. It's when he does believe. He do. Alright, let me put the Discord on uh, YouTube and Twitch and I'll just pin it. Do we have any other thoughts? Any other plans? I feel like I'm the definition of insanity. I keep trying to log and the log's not working. It's like so close, but it's like just out of reach. What if you pile up a series of logs on the left, pushing them onto one another? Yeah, I kind of want to try that. Like, if I can, like, angle these two, like a rocket, and then send this one into the other one. Okay, so I can't push this unless I'm moving it like that. How can I get it to go the other the way I want it to? It just doesn't really have, like, much maneuverability. Maybe I could get it to tilt off of this tree. No, it's like, it's so stationary. I need to like, have a fan and like, just get the height from it for like one second. Just like jump off of it, refill the stamina a little bit. Maybe I'm huffing the copium though. Maybe I'm so wrong. We make this. We don't make this. Oh, roll the log into the water. Throw fans into the log to bump it slight. Oh, wait, that's a great idea actually. Throwing the fans at the log to get it to go further. Let me just try this one more time. No, he goes under. Okay, let me kill myself. End game. <laughs> Climb and swim, because when you run out of stamina and get in water, you get bits of stamina back. But isn't, it, isn't climbing way slower than swimming? Like, I won't get all the way across, right? It's an interesting idea. Let's try it. It seems like really far though. I think it's too far to be honest. Cause it's also like not a straight line. It's like curvy. Wait, but maybe we can, wait, wait. Can we refill stamina on one of these ledges? Oh my gosh. Shoot. I, I guarantee you dude, did that ledge right there is good enough to stand on. Guaranteed. Guaranteed we fill our stamina bar here. Guaranteed. Okay. Let's continue. 
Let's hope that we find another spot that we could stand on. Like maybe that ledge over there on like the far left corner of my screen right now. Maybe. I believe this could work. There's not really a great, I mean, I guess we have to just pray that this spot works. I don't know if this spot will work. It doesn't look terrible. Maybe it will. Please, 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 please. This is a, this is the solution. Who gave me this solution? Who, who told me to climb? Thank you. True goat for telling me that. Alright. That's hundred percent making it now. Like we could even swim there. Do we just swim? Bro, let's just swim. We're swimming that. Zuzel. I salute you, my dude. I salute you. me 10 times <laughs> look I'm not reading every trap I'll try to read most of them I also just didn't think that would work I mean look at the wall dude like when you look at the wall like this it does not look like there's anywhere you can like get stamina back right Alright, surely the rest of us ends easy, right? Oh, we do need to get our fire back, because we're going to freeze to death otherwise. I think there's a campfire around here. There's probably a campfire around here. We just need to get fire. Thank you, the follow. Let's see. Oh, but it's not lit. Hmm, can we light this somehow? If we threw, like, a rock at the flint, would it light it? No, right? I guess there's, like, a chance. Oh, wait, there's rocks over here. Let's try that. Let's try a rock. Hello, Emma. How are you? Avocado. I'm not an avocado guy, but I like guac. Right? Guac and a burrito can go hard. There's like no shot this works, right? Okay, I missed. Let's make sure we don't pick up the flint. <laughs> if you ever want to make a fire, guys, this is how you do it. <gasps> that works? Bro, that's so sick. I can't believe that actually worked. You can make fire by just throwing a rock. Okay, that's, that's pretty awesome. I had no faith in that working, dude. I had no faith in that. Dubs and chat. Todd's lit again. Todd's back. Todd is at full power. We're going to ascend now. We're making it to ascend, baby. Because we lost our water when we went into the water. Uh, wait, did I say we lost our water? We lost our fire when we went into the water. Wait, can you see us? I can see you, Prism. Yeah, that's a huge W. Please wait. Bright Bloom Seeds, I know about them. Oh my gosh, if you give me Bright Bloom Seeds, I will murder you. In game. Todd is lit in both ways. Yup. He do be. Oh wait, I'm going down. I need to go up to get to Ascend. I don't know if I should be going in this cave, to be honest. Like, we're walking towards Ascend, but we're going downwards when we should be going upwards Ooh. do i ride the railway with nothing 
This is gonna be tough. And probably stupid. Sounds like the thing for me. Okay, this is not gonna work. This is not going to work. <laughs> this will work. This is gonna work. Wait, wait, wait. This is actually such a great plan. Hold on, hold on. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Okay. 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 He's moving. He's moving. We're going. This, this is so scary. No, why is he stopped? Why is he stopped? No, 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 no. Oh my god, this is terrifying. This is terrifying, dude. I have to go. Oh my god. This is so unnecessary. I was right there. I was right there like a minute ago. We're making it. We're not making it. Holy, please. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. How am I still on this? It is so unsteady, so unsteady, so unsteady. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Slow and steady. No, 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 no. Not to the left. Just nice and smooth. Nice and smooth. A little bit forward. A little bit forward. A little bit forward. Just keep it nice and steady. Just hold the stick perfectly straight. And tilt the camera a tiny, tiny bit. Not too much. Not too little. But just a tad, every so often, and don't lose focus. Just keep your eye on the line and keep walking forward. You got it. You got it. Doing wonderful. Almost there. We're so close. Look, that was where you were like a minute ago. Why? Why does the road tilt like that? Why does it bend? We can go a little faster. It's nice and straight now. It's nice and straight. Speed her up. Speed her up. Okay. Recenter it. Recenter it. Recenter it. Recenter it. It's okay. We don't have to go fast. We don't have to go fast. We're taking our time. We're taking our time. We're enjoying the views. Look at the trees. Take in the fresh. Take a deep breath. Smell the trees. Smell the rock. The air. The torch burning beside us, keeping us warm. Keeping us warm. Okay. Just look at this. Look at the. We're right there. Raru is right there. He's waiting for us. He's got a gift for us. We just gotta keep moving. We just gotta keep moving. No, 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 I'm sorry, I'm Serenity. Yeah, that's just the, the feeling of peace right there. Ah. Just that good old feeling of tranquility. Alright, we should be good. Ascend should be easy, right? I mean, we could do the same thing we did with the Ultra Hand for Ascend. So I think we're pretty set. As long as we don't die to the bats. Who dies to bats? Not me. Seriously? Do you want this fight, bro? Do you actually want this fight? Okay, let's fight. No! My torch is dead! I'm gonna freeze! I'm gonna freeze! I'm gonna freeze! That was stupid. 
Why did I do that? A choo choo killed me. A freaking choo choo killed me. Where's the fire? Does he want the smoke? I, I didn't want the smoke, bro. I got too cocky. Oh wait, we have full hearts. We have full HP. Can we just make it? Can we just run? I think we won't freeze before we get there. Go! Okay, not that way. Not that way. If we can get in the cave with a, ha a heart and half, it's possible. It's possible if we can get in the, in the cave with a heart and half. How many hearts do we have? We have two hearts. We should be fine. We should be fine if we have two hearts. Wait. Could we throw a rock at the bomb to relight Todd? This is what happens when you use a hundred percent in your brain. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so smart. I'm the smartest human on earth. That was the perfect explosion radius too. Because if it was a little bit closer to me, I would have gotten damaged and died. And if I was too far, it wouldn't have lit Todd. That's a W. Dubs and trap, please. Can we get some Ws? Is saving allowed? Yeah, saving is allowed. I can switch between saves. In fact, I do it quite often. Basically, like, everything that I have, like, I, I can't pick up anything. That's the main thing. I can pick up key items, but I'm not allowed to use them. So I've never used Ultra Hand. I've never used the Pure Pad. And now we have to do Ascend without Ascending. Thank you for the dub spam, Bubba. Always appreciated. <laughs> I'm hearing some TTSWs. Oh my gosh, that's so many Ws. I'm W'd out, okay. Let me... You guys can't hear TTS, correct? You guys can't hear it? I'm gonna do something so you guys can hear TTS. This should make you guys able to hear it. Oh. We cannot? Okay. TTS should be like enabled for you guys to hear as well now. <clears throat> Todd the torch. Ascend! We love Ascend. We hate Ascend. Ascend's not that useful. Ain't working. Very unuseful for this one. But we got it. We got to ascend. Remember when we thought ascend, getting to ascend was like a difficult testing, thing? Testing, testing, Todd is God. Mm. Can you hear it? Did that work? How do you do TTS? It's actually only on Twitch. I'm sorry. Mr. Fair, Fair Lord. Okay. So we have an auto save in here, right? Yes. Let's go back to our dirty save. So if you do want to use TTS and like other channel points rewards like uh, music redemptions, and if you get there enough, you can like make me do a backflip on I love stream, men. or you can end stream. And sometimes I have a channel points reward that like does a full speed run of, the, of this game. I just like stop whatever I'm doing and I just speed run this game. But I disabled that one for this stream. Because it's very disruptive. <laughs> it's very disruptive to be like, alright guys, so I know we're doing this challenge, but like somebody just redeemed Let's Beat Tears in an hour, so we're going to beat Tears in an hour. You know? Okay, we're going to Gutenbach. This is going to be the same as how we beat Ultra Hand. We're going to slot in a hover bike, we're going to zuggle in our shields, uh, and do zone as storage, and we'll, dude, look at his split. Look at his split. We're gonna be Great Sky Island in like under two hours. Fuse might be a little tricky. Recall should be easy though. Recall is like also you can just fly over it. Reapers are useless. He is doing it only with glitches, meaning he can't use any items. Yeah, I mean, I would I would allow myself to collect rupees if I needed them, but like I don't think rupees would even matter because like what what would I do with rupees? Usually, you just buy other items with rupees. Right? Wait. 
I have a good idea, guys. I have a very good idea. We could walk back to Fuse. That sounds boring, doesn't it? Let's not walk back to Fuse. Let's fly back to Fuse. Oh. I can't ascend up to there. Let's walk to Fuse. <laughs> Can I get to the wings? Can I, like, jump it? Hmm. Oh man. I really wanted to get a wing. Cause then we can get the wing from over there and then fly all the way back to Fuse, which is over there. I really want to get the wings. Can I get over there without ascent? How am I wearing armor? Oh, wait, what? Oh, dude, I'm so stupid. I didn't do ascent. Holy shit, my brain's so turned off right now. <laughs> oh my god, I just didn't do ascent. I'm in my alt save. I'm so stupid. I'm so brain dead right now. You know what happened? I like teleported to ascend and then I'm like, I'm out of ascend. I guess I did it. And then I was like moving on. And then I just forgot that like the whole point of coming here is to like do the whole lotting thing. Okay. Wait, oh, that didn't work. It's fine, it's fine. Yeah, idi idiocracy, dude. Brain hurt. Brain numb. Yeah, but this is a different save. This is the alt save. This is the save where I have, like, everything on it, and then I'm going to traverse through the saves stuff. You'll see that right now. So I take out a fan. I click DNA at the same time. I go back in the shrine. Say chicken, but I won't give the context why you should. Chicken. B and A? Yeah, B and A. I think it's a 1.0 thing. Okay, so it worked. So now we can spawn zone devices inside the shrines, which is normally not allowed. Everyone ignore the fact that I voted pink. Steering stick. I guess just a cart. Thanks for the follow fair. All right, let's, I think this would work, right? Just a cart and two fans. The reason I'm not doing a classic hover bike is because I need to go like mostly vertical and not horizontal. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna drop our shields. Okay, we only have one, perfect. Fuse and tangle this. Why? Why? Fuse and tangle this. I guess we'll try it with a, a normal hover bike. I'm a little scared, but it's fine, I think. Okay, I think I think we'll be able to pull it off with just this, right? If YouTube viewers want to have TTS come to Twitch. Yeah, that's true. If YouTube people are watching this on YouTube and you wanna like watch more of my streams, basically what I'm gonna do, I've told the people on my Discord server this, but I'm not gonna stream on YouTube. I'm only gonna stream on YouTube for like bigger type things. If I'm doing like casual streams, where I'm just like kind of hanging out, talking to chat and like just like not really doing anything big or like significant, I'm probably just gonna stream on my Twitch. I'm gonna keep YouTube for like bigger things. Like this is like a bigger challenge that I've been working on for a while and like thinking about. So this is something I wanna have on YouTube and Twitch. But if you like, if you're enjoying the stream and you wanna have like chill streams, more like laid back, then yeah, follow my Twitch. That's my Twitch plug of the day. All right, let's, I think that should work. Let's load back to our clean save, which is this one. If you're curious how I know which save is clean and dirty, if you look at the picture, they're like very, very similar, but you can see on the one below it, he has no armor on. Yeah, I'm, I'm scared that streaming on YouTube affects like uh, video performances and stuff. 
Okay. So I just gotta I just gotta get on this and hold back. And again, this does not use my battery cell because we're in a shrine and I don't even have a battery cell to be using. So this is not using a key item. Okay, steady, 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 steady. Steady, 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 steady. This is such a bad hover bike. Okay, we're fine. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. <laughs> That's so easy. Like, we're actually like getting the world records for beating the shrine so quickly too. Easy. Okay, now I want to figure out how to get to that wing. How are we going to get to that wing? It improve or not trimming on YouTube? Oh gosh. Oh wait, this is when you get the battery cell. Again, we can pick this up, we just can't use it. We just gotta be careful. So if you guys ever see that my battery gets used, just tell me so I can reload the last save. The game forces you to pick this up. I have an associate working at the river near the base of the mountain. They can teach you how to use this. Why would I care? Isn't that like to get up here? All right. Dang, I really want to get to the wings. I know I'm being a crybaby about the wings, but it'd be so fun to ride a wing right now. You guys will understand, like, in my opinion, the wings are the most enjoyable part of this game. Like, this is my favorite game, but riding a wing in this game is so fun. And especially when you, like, can't interact with anything. Like, like I said earlier, there's only, like, two buttons on my controller that do things. It's like I have a joystick, I have a camera. And I can like click pause and that's like about it. Um, but being on a wing makes you feel like powerful again, you know? Can you use glider? For that like 20 seconds. Well, like, yeah, we could stand on one. We just can't spawn one. We can use a glider. A glider is not like in your inventory and it doesn't use battery. So if that's your question, if it uses battery, it does not. Hmm. I don't think I can climb across, but I'll try it anyway. Oh my gosh, it drains your stamina. Yeah, that won't work. Oh man. Man. Wait. Wait, guys, I have an idea. I have an idea. I have a really bad idea that might be stupid enough to work. This idea is really stupid, a but glider. hear me out, guys. Hear me out. We use a lot of spring, which does not use battery. We use a lot of spring right here. And we use a lot, like, is there, like, a barrel over here? We use a lot something to the spring so that we could bounce ourselves up. And then we pick up a barrel. We throw it at the thing it's fused to. Okay, okay, hold on, I'm cooking. Hold on. It's so unnecessary. It's so unnecessary, but it'll be so fun if it works. Please. What's up, straw hat? How you doing? I'm just gonna leave. Don't you have to hit a spring to use it? Yes, you're right. But we have one way to we have one way to hit a spring. We have one way to hit a spring. You'll see. You'll see. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get a spring. And we're gonna get What would be like a good thing to fuse to this? Wait, would a steering stick work on it? No, because it wouldn't... It would keep me on the spring then. I need to actually get height. A cart, maybe? Hmm. If I... Is I gonna fall over? No. 
I should probably like balance it out though and put one on the other side. And then I would need like something to get onto it. Like a wing. Actually, I could probably just lot a wing like that. That's boring though. <laughs> we we don't take the boring solution. Listen, listen, listen. This is the god solution, okay? Hi. How are you? Oh gosh, not like this. Yeah, I hate when the shields drop like that. It's fine. I gotta be real careful with the saves now because I don't want to lose the clean save. So, this saves clean, this saves not, this saves clean, this saves clean, this saves clean. We have like almost all clean saves, so we should be safe. At least for a little bit. Okay, drop that. Fuse entangle the spring. Why does it break? Okay, get a new spring out real quick. It just breaks. Oh man. Why can't I fuse entangle it? Is that just, does that always happen with springs? Okay, no, we got it, we got it, we got it. Guys, I'm operating on a whole other level of consciousness right now. I know not, like nothing that I'm doing makes any sense. You just have to trust me. You just have to like sit there and just trust. I'm gonna hit you with the trust me bro right now. Okay, I'm sucking at this, hold on. Wait, what would be better than a cart? A sled? Maybe. I think this is enough. Let me try to zuggle the shields now. I say let's bring the shields over here to make it a little easier. <laughs> Try having your back off of the ledge so it doesn't clip into the floor. Yeah, I don't know what's causing the clipping, but you're probably right, that might help. Okay, pick up that, pick up that. We're juggling the shields now so that those objects transfer through saves. This is called slotting for the uninitiated. It transfers objects through save files when it's not supposed to. So now we gotta build our contraption. Hear me out. We get the spring, we're gonna have it right here, right next to where we need to be. Then we're gonna have a sled attached to the spring right, let's put it right here. Perfect. And then we're gonna have a wing It's beautiful. This is beautiful. We go back. Is this the clean? This is the clean, right? Goodbye, Emma. Try to beat Tears of the Kingdom without moving at all. Hmm. That sounds very fun. I'm a pass. Why the slud? You're gonna see. You guys are about to understand everything in like a couple seconds, okay? You guys wanna know the one way that I can hit something? Burritos, why are you walking right past it? You walked past it, didn't you? No. Well, yes, I did walk past it. But no, I meant, oh shit. Oh gosh. 
I need the torch to not be on fire. The plan is simple. We pick something up. Wait, can I pick up this? Oh, this will work. This will work. We pick this up. We throw this at the sled. The sled's activate. The sled's connected to the spring. So when we hit the sled, it activates the spring, and the spring throws us up in the air. Let's freaking go, dude. Oh, it feels good. It feels damn good to be this smart. That was like five IQ, but still. That's a W. And you know what? Maybe that was a waste of time. But God damn it, I get to ride a wing right now, baby. And that's what I want. But burritos, how are you going to cut the icicle? I don't have to. My torch is on fire, dude. It burns the icicle. 9,000 IQ! Divided by a thousand. Alright, we're going back to Fuse. We're going back to Fuse. Oh, we're going back to Fuse. And we have a wing. I'm so very happy. I love convoluted and unnecessary solutions when you found a better one five minutes ago. <laughs> can we not talk about the fact that you can just angle the wing on that? Can we just pretend like we had to use the spring there? Look. If we ever need to get, like, a stupid height for whatever reason, now we have the solution, okay? Now we got it. Also, I'm gonna go straight into the East Trend. I'm not even gonna land. We're going straight in. We're not messing around. Kinda. A little bit. Hmm. Make a flying machine, like, in the shrine. That's what I've been doing, isn't it? I've seen this cutscene. Oh! Wait. Excuse me. I just realized something. If you go in a shrine, the game gives you the ability, right? So, like, let's say you go into Fuse, you get Fuse. Even if you're on the same save and you leave the shrine, you also lose Fuse. Even though you already got it. Because I've already been in the Fuse Shrine like seven times on this save. It allows you to Fuse something. Mm. And like normally you'd get the Raru dialogue there, but I didn't because I already got it. Okay. So we have the autosave in here again. We're going back to our manual. This is a dirty save. Let's just blow back this one. All right. To in Isra. For this one, we're gonna do a cannon hover bike. It's, it's awfully convenient that like every shrine in the GSI. Hey, can you check DC also? I like a hair Xander. Thanks, Jumpy. It's kind of surprising that every shrine on Great Scott Island, you can just cheese by having a hover bike. <laughs> it's almost like you're not supposed to have a hover bike in these shrines. Ooh. You also don't need to guess which is dirty or clean. The dirty save has a star in the right corner. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's a good point. I didn't even think of that. But that's a good tip. I appreciate that. Oh, I didn't do the zone storage. The zone storage, by the way, guys... If I try to spawn zone devices right now... See, I can't. Because the game doesn't like when you spawn zone devices in shrines, because you can cheese them then. You can, like, really cheese them. You can cheese most shrines anyway, but... If you could bring out zone devices in shrines, oh my god. It would make them... stupid. But yeah, the glitch that I do outside of shrines is the one that lets me bring stuff into shrines. Bring zone devices, specifically. The star appears after beating the game. Yeah, I'm aware. BA Sub 2 hour GSI? I think it's possible. 
I think we could get off the tutorial island in under two hours. Without using any key items. Or normal items. Alright, so pause. We want two fans. We want a steering stick. We want a cannon. We want... That's all we want, right? I think. Let's try this. Let's let's make like a little like one of extra of everything just in case things go wrong. Bing, bing, bing. Let's get rid of this yield, we don't need it. Alright. Use entangle the fan. Drop the shield. Pick up a new shield. Fuse entangle the cannon. Drop the shield. Pick up a new shield. Fuse entangle the steering stick. Drop the shield. Get a new shield. Fuse entangle another fan. Okay. That's all we need, right? That should be enough. I'm not going to do all of them. I don't trust that. You have to be facing like you're back against the wall. It's kind of weird. Because it tries to take the shield out when it can't, and that's what causes it to zuggle. Yo, what's up, Yuri Pineapple? How do the rules work? If you do exclamation point rules, I believe I put a command in, but I can explain it. Essentially, right now we're on dirty save, where we did pick up like a plentiful supply of items. So on this save, I'm able to do a lot of things. Like right now I'm doing a glitch called Zlotting. And Zlotting allows you to have objects traverse through saves. And basically, all these objects, or at least some of these objects, are connected to the shield that's on my back. And even though it looks like I only have one shield, if I actually equip a shield, you can see I have more than just one. And you see how when I when I activate my shield like that, if I activate the shield, look what happens. It turns on these two fans and the cannon. And the steering stick, but you can't see that. So that just shows that they're entangled to my back, which is zuggled. And or the, the shields are zuggled. Anyway, the ending effect is pretty simple. Actually, I need to connect these first. The idea behind everything I'm doing is so that I can make a hover bike on the clean save. So that I can fly over the shrine. Without using any key items, like fuse. Because we don't like items over here. Alright, we want the cannon to be facing straight ahead, I guess. So we can break the wall. Oh gosh, that's gonna kill me, isn't it? That's a terrifying spot to have it in. I mean... I don't know about that. I don't know about that. That seems... I feel like we'd rather have it going straight up, right? Is Song a quiet moment from Mayok? Yeah, it is. It is. Alright, let's go back to our save. So now we're entering our clean save. This is the save where we haven't used any items, any key items. We've never used anything in this save. In fact, if I look at my inventory, I can only see the key items. We're allowed to pick up key items, we're just not allowed to use them. And you can see we successfully slotted. I fused the wrong cannon to the hover bike. I only slotted one of the cannons. Shoot. Can I do this with just one hover bike? I guess I'll have to. Oh gosh, if this flips, it's over because I can't use Ultra Hand. Oh gosh, this is scary. <laughs> oh god, what is happening? No. <laughs> what happened? How did it catch on fire? I'm so confused. 
How did it catch on fire, though? Todd? Oh, because we have Todd. Yeah, our torch doesn't look like it's on fire, but it is on fire. I keep forgetting that. Okay, well, I think we're softlocked now. Not softlocked, softlocked, but we have to restart because I died, which is stupid. It, w it was happening so fast. I wasn't prepared, okay? Okay, I'm probably going to end up losing. All right, let's, let's give it another shot. Todd is cool. Maybe the torch was zuggled. Yeah, the torch is zuggled. What's up, Mr. Sword? You don't even need the cannon. I guess I don't. So, let's drop all our shields. Actually, we don't need to. We already have the thing built. I shouldn't have dropped them. We don't need that. Because the sled shield, we don't know the sled shield. Because the hover bike's still over there, even though I loaded the save. Since it's still entangled to these shields. So we don't need to rebuild the hover bike, we just need to bring it back over here. Which is not hard, because on this save we have items. So we can just ultra hand it back over. Can't carry any more shields? Yes, I can. Alright, there we go. Um, let's just pop this cannon. Let's break that real quick. <laughs> A little unnecessary, sure. I'll give you that. Did the Kakariko is it Village Kakariko theme? Village theme yeah, it is. What version is this? 1.0. 1.0 is my favorite version. Easily. Yeah, the hover bike's still here. Okay, I'm gonna try to do the cannon. Cause hear me out, we don't need the cannon, but ideally the cannon lights the the, the leaves instead of the torch so that we don't have to get near it and burn. So I am gonna fuse the cannon again. Hylian shield, sled shield, okay. Let's go back. We should be good, we should be good. If it's allowed, you turn on motion controls and grab the boulder with ultra hand and slam it into the rock wall and recall it to break it. I can't use Ultra Hand in this run. I can't use anything. This run is solely relying on glitches for everything. Oh my god, I fused. I can't use this. Can we not talk about this one? Can we just pretend that didn't happen? Let's just ignore that run. I'm gonna pretend like nobody chatted that that's not gonna work. Easy fix, though. Easy fix. That's as, that's as easy as it gets. That's all we gotta do. Well, the stamina wheel did a thing. Yeah, look, if I... Wait, I'm gonna hold B, and I think it's gonna be full three wheels. Watch this, watch this. Yeah, you see that? If I hold B when I'm entering a new save... That's weird. Okay, anyway. Alright, let's... Just hold back. Just hold back. Okay. <laughs> it's working, kind of. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I can't control it. I can't control it at all. Oh my god. Wait, no! It's a little hard to control. It's Todd. Okay, the hover brake probably isn't the best plan. I don't know. I think maybe the hover brake isn't the way, guys. The cannon might be a bad play. Yeah. Listen, I'm a cannon believer. Personally. 
I want to see something cool, guys. Go, bada boop, bada beep. All you need is recall and ultra hands. Isn't that crazy? I didn't know it when I did the last run. I guess it wouldn't have helped because I didn't have recall on the last run either. I think I want to rebuild this hover bike slightly differently. Because right now it's very, very hard to control. Does Aero Smuggle work through saves? No, it doesn't, unfortunately. Not in a useful way. Like, technically it does, but it doesn't, like, you can't pull out a bow, so it wouldn't help. I want to get this, like, really nice and centered. I think that's solid. What about the front? Let's have it start back here. Do magic so get so nigh bomb. Trust, this is the one. There's no shot this doesn't work. There's like a 0% chance. There's a 0% chance this doesn't work. Music's going off. This is the one. Just hold back at first. Look, all the walls broken. No! We got the walls broken. <laughs> is you just can't do anything else. There's no way to get that chest now, right? I could do it one step at a time. I could do my stupid spring method to get the, to get the, the reason chest. why you can break it with ultra hand is because you can't break anything while using ultra hand. So when you recall, it breaks. You can't break anything while using Ultra Hand, so when you recall... Oh... So, like... That's interesting. So it should be breaking, but Ultra Hand, like, disables things from breaking. Let's give this a shot. This is the one. Zuggle cannon shield, you could stack the rockets and light the leaves from the top of the rocks. Wait! Wait, that's actually such a good idea. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Guys, I think we have such a better solution. I have such a better solution in mind right now. I don't know if this is exactly what you had in mind, but I'm... I've got something on my mind that's going to work. Okay, here's what we need to do. We're going to go to a dirty save. We're Screw the slotting. The slotting's done with. I'm not slotting shit anymore. I have another plan that I think is going to be way better. Okay, we need to go to lookout landing. We're going to gas a cannon onto our shield. And we're going to zuggle that into our clean save. That's all we need. That's all we need. Because when you stance with the, like normally if I turn around while the cannon's gassed, it'll shoot cannons in a straight line. But if I stance, his back angles upwards. So maybe that angle is going to be high enough to break, to hit the wood. I, I might be cooking, I might just not. I might just not, I might just be stupid. But like, it'll make sense in a second, trust. I have a theory. I have a game theory. All right. We do... Where's the cannons? Cannon, 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 cannon. Cannon? Okay, let's drop our shields first. Let's get rid of these two. We don't care about them. Let them be alone in life together. Okay. Fuse and tangle this. Drop our shield. We're going to put this shield in the hole so that it deloads. We're going to fuse... A new weapon to- or no, not, not a weapon, not a weapon, not a weapon, not a weapon. We're gonna fuse the cannon to our shield. We're gonna walk away. We're gonna use the shield. We're going to pop a... What is it? What is it? A large zone of charge. Where is it? Large zone of charge, large zone of charge. Here it is, here it is. Pop this. It's gonna immediately activate right now. Trying to get hit. 
Okay, let's juggle it. Right now. Okay. Nice. And now we juggle this shield. And then we load the save. And we fridge. Maybe? Maybe? Watch the key items, only the Fire Temple cinematic was epic. Dude, the Fire Temple was awesome. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. He doesn't even, dude, he's like Michael Bay, just like walking away as the things explode. Oh wait, we're gonna die. We gotta be careful, cause it will kill us. Oh my gosh, I'm so... I said it, I said it. I said it and I just let it happen. I just let it happen. I just, I, dude, I thought I would thread the needle. If I walked in a straight line, I thought it would snipe right between the two rocks. But his movement's very infrequent. It's like, he walks like this. Okay, it's fine. It's fine because it stays gassed. It stays gassed. We have infinite tries. You gotta hold ZL or something. Let's just clear it up. Let's clean it up. <laughs> Let's get rid of all of them. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. That is lovely. It's kind of terrifying, though, because I feel like I'm going to die. Wait, did we get it? Oh, we're hitting the leaves. Wait, wait, wait. Angle it, angle it, angle it. Yes! Look at that angle. Look at that angle when I hit ZL. Look, normal, angle. Normal, angle. Do the spring wing thing. Oh, sh whoa, 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 whoa. I gotta be careful, I gotta be careful. You should not die now. Try crouching. <laughs> this is so cool, dude. This is so fun. And we can actually kill the uh, the shrine guy in here too, just for bonus points. Can we kill him before he's even on? Oh, we're cooking. We're cooking, fellas. You could have done flame meter and steering stick. Okay, this is more fun though. I'm perfectly happy with this solution. Come here, boy. Come here, dude. What you want? What you want? You want the smoke? Come here. Wait, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Oh my god. Hard aiming is just kind of hard. Come on, Link. Come on. You can do it. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, aim it, aim it, aim it, aim it. No. Okay, we gotta hit it. We gotta hit it. Oh, we got another hit. We got another hit. Yes, third hit, third hit. Come on, another one, another one, another one. Yes, come on, come on, come on, come on. How is that not hitting you? How is that not hitting you? Yes. Come on, one more, one more. One more, dude. This is terrifying. I don't like this. Please, 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 please. Yes! I've never been able to kill him in the key item playthrough, but I can kill him in the nothing playthrough. It was worth it. It was worth it. GG's. GG's, fellas. That's Fuse. That's three shrines complete on the Great Sky Island without using a single key item, without using a single item, Welcome back, Apollo. What did you miss? Mm, we did a lot of shrines. 
you missed how we did uh how we did ascend and you missed me failing at fuse for a while and you missed me getting a wing which was kind of fun raru i don't even mind that i'm talking to you raru i'm in a good mood mm. tell me about the temple of time bro teach me so oh no we just used the battery cell. Oh gosh, I sort of... Wait, did I get an autosave before I... Okay, wait. This autosave is before I used the cannon. It was before I used the battery cell. So what I need to do... Is I need to number load one, to... Number one, number one, number one, number one, number one, number one, number one. Thank you. <laughs> what I need to do is I need to go back to my dirty save... I need to drop the cannon shield and then reload back to the autosave before we used our energy cell. Because like I said, we can't we can't use the key item. We used our energy cell for a second there. That's not allowed. Unacceptable. I should be ashamed. Disable gas, then load it. It's not like there's a button to disable gas. Actually, there literally is a button to disable gas. But I'm just going to drop the shield. We don't need it anymore. Okay, we're going back. I don't know either, but he called the he called the key a key item and his key items play through. It's not. I lied. The key's not a key item. If it was, it was it would show up in my key items inventory. I just thought it'd be a funny bit to say it's a key item. But it's technically not a key item. Okay. So we gotta go back to the Temple of Time. So, oh no, I, dude, it's so hard to like get rid of the muscle memory of like, oh, I need to go to Temple of Time. Let me just teleport there. I can't. I'm not allowed to use the Pure Pad. Stop trying to do things that you can't do. I need to walk there. I need to walk there the old fashioned way. If anything, it is the most key item out of any key item. True. Hello, Jonathan. All right, so we need to get back. I guess we'll just walk there. I mean, we have we have the route opened up to us now because these rocks should be destroyed. So we should be able to take this. I'm trying to, to 100% Totkins just finished my 71st shrine and have 32 hey, split nice. orbs. Let me tell you, finish the shrines, don't bother with the Koroks, dude. It's not worth it. Speaking from experience, speaking as a man who's collected over 600 Koroks, let me tell you, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. Do like some self-care or something instead. The Koroks will drive you insane. 31 spirit orbs. 31 spirit orbs. Wait, what about 31 spirit orbs? How do you give the fake decayed mass sword to Zelda without opening the door without getting the heart container? Yeah, that's the one thing I can't avoid. It is unfortunate. Can we climb this? Yeah, I wish I could not give in the spirit orbs. The only thing I can always say about that is that I'm going to I am going to turn in the spirit orbs for a heart container, and then to make up for that, I'm just going to never get hit. <laughs> Because the way I see it is like, if I never get hit, that fourth con that fourth heart container never gets used. So that fourth heart container needs to be full hearts the rest of the run. Which means it's gonna be it's gonna be hitless pretty much. <laughs> Not like fully hitless where I restart the whole game if I get hit, but like hitless to the point where if I get hit. I lose that fourth heart container. I need to reload the save to back when I had four hearts. Which means I have to beat Army, Bosphorus, and Ganondorf with, you know, gassed stuff and a lot of luck, I guess. It's gonna be brutal. This is this is how these challenges end up going, by you the way, guys. Climb around the, temple the Great of time, Sky Island you can't give the generally sword ends up to being her. like kinda easy. And then the end of the game is absolute hell. 
That was an understatement. The end of this game is so hard. But I don't think I need to, like, paint that out for you guys. If you've played the game, you know. Okay, I think we have to walk back. Can we climb back? Is there, like, a... We could climb back. You know what? Let's sprint back. I believe in myself. I'm so believing in myself. Dude, my abilities of running on lines... Oh. I'm... Never mind. Damage list on top of this is intense. Oh, bro, is it? You think? <laughs> okay, maybe I won't sprint. No sprinting, just casual. As I was saying, my walking in a straight line abilities have drastically improved since the beginning of the stream. You see this? You see this? I'm holding that middle edge. I'm holding that middle right edge. You can't compete. You simply cannot compete with the burrito. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm fine. Good night, Skylink. Thanks for tuning in. I'm gonna put some songs on real quick. Wait, why am I going to Ultra Hint? This is what happens when I get distracted. <laughs> I need to go to the Temple of Time. There's no reason to go to Ultra Hint right now. Army is basically damageless for this challenge? Yeah. Yeah, not just Army. Army, Boss Rush, and Ganondorf have to be damageless. So, yeah. I, I, there's, there's nothing I can say about it, guys. Nothing I can say about it. Yeah, I'm already my time. Well, let's take this victory of getting through GSI with, depending on how you look at it, one key item used. Is it possible to avoid picking up or using the key item here? Technically, yes. Although, in order to do it, you have to do GSI skip. So why am I not doing GSI skip if I can you avoid this? Sense. Because if I did GSI skip, and I died army, which is so likely. It's very likely that I died army at least once. You don't get any auto saves when you do GSI skip. So the game loads you back to the beginning of GSI, not the beginning of GSI, but wherever you were when you started to do like the crazy thing to skip GSI. So that means it basically takes like two hours to set up the GSI skip probably a lot longer for me since I don't know how to do it. But I'd take two hours to set it up and then I would have to immediately first try army, first try boss rust, first try Ganondorf and not get hit at all without picking up any items, without using any runes, without any key items. It's just... I'm okay. I'm okay. You use ascend. Oh my god, I used Ascend. I used it. You're so right. Thank you. Thank you. I used Ascend. I used Ascend. Guys, it's so built into my head that I'm just like using abilities. I used Ascend. Thank you for letting me know. Alright, we're reloading. Quit yapping. Alright, I'm done yapping. I'm done yapping. I just wanted to give my reasons. Alright, let's go back. Load save. Oh, okay. We have to load back to this one. That's all right. This is the save before we walked across the the little the little line. 
No, you don't need it. I did before. It's just tricky to get to the end without using recall. You do need to turn in the spirit orbs to get off TSI. If that's what you're saying. This is so satisfying. Am I the only one, like, getting real satisfied by seeing Link run on this? It hits a nerve in me. Alright. This time we will not use Ascend. Although, to get up there, we need to find another way. Because we can't jump that. I guess, no, there's the stairs. We just take the longer way. Don't want to watch that cutscene again. We can skip it this time. We'll skip the cutscenes. Hey, look, it's Zelda. It's a dragon. Forget what I just said. Please. Sorry. Are you gonna... Go for any temples this run. chat works on new MC server W. It's a very interesting idea that you just posed. Do I go for temples on this run? I was thinking no. Because I'm not allowed to use key items. So even if I finish a temple, which I haven't thought about, I don't really have a reason to. Because I'm not allowed to use sages in this run. But like, if I could, I do temples just for the hell of doing them. I don't know. Like, what what temples would be possible? I think wind temple would be pos. Wait, I don't have a paraglider. Can you do wind temple without a paraglider? Would spirit temple be possible? Spirit temple, you need. I mean, without fuse, you would be you would not be able to fuse anything to Minru. But I think it'd still be possible. You can still beat the boss without fusing anything to her. Fire Temple would be possible. I think Fire Temple and Spirit Temple would still be possible. Actually, no. I take that back. Because you need an Ultra Hand for so many puzzles in both of those shrines. Like, with every puzzle, you, you almost need Ultra Hand for it. Oh gosh, I almost used recall. Oh. Have you done Rasitaki Wax Shrine next to Tarry Town? It is so fun. Wait, how are we gonna do this? We don't have recall. I guess we need to slot in another spring. Can I jump this? Oh, I can so jump that. Oh, we're making that. You'll be able to beat Wind Temple, except you can't use batteries. Yeah, I don't know, man. That'd be tough. <laughs> we don't need recall. Recall who? I love how Zelda's like, she's giving me the Master Sword. She's being all nice, trying to give me all these things. I just don't really want them. Thanks for the offer though. Oh, this stupid door, the bane of my existence. Use the travel functionality. Cool. I got gotcha. you. All right. This is a much bigger problemo. We need to get to recall without teleporting there. And recall is a little bit higher than us. It's a little... It, we, we can't quite walk there. Um, and we can't use our battery. So... Hmm. Unless wrong warp. Hmm. 
Use infinite height glitch. You need weapons for that. You need items. Is this the torch from the no weapons run? Uh, it was only key items run. And yeah, I mean, it's technically the same torch. Okay, let's think. How do I get up there? Use the discount gas lodge. I guess that's the only option. Discount gas launch it is. Discount gas launch for the uninitiated is the stupidest launching thing, launching method in the game. It's, it's yikes. But let's try it. Use a hover bike with a big battery on it so you don't use your battery. Oh. Wait, if we use a big battery, and does it show that the battery symbol comes up? Water break? Thank you, Quinn. They sort of had a phase mechanic. So you can just walk no. through walls, but it's like a send you can only use on certain walls. Wait, no, so then we could use a big battery. We can use big batteries and just fly up there. Damn, wait, so we can use Zona devices then if we slot them incorrectly. Okay, wait. I mean, it's a, it's a long flight, but we just need to slot a lot of big batteries. All right, here's what we should do. Our dirty save, okay, this is our only dirty save. Let's build a, let's build a big ass hover bike. A big ass hover bike with a lot of big batteries. And like, pray to God that it doesn't show the battery symbol. Like, just to be clear, does anyone know? I guess nobody would know this for sure. But if you get on a, a hover bike and you don't have a battery, battery cell, but you do have a battery on it, will the hover bike move? Since you have a battery attached to it? Is that how that works? It doesn't show the battery? Okay. Then we should be good. It will, I think. It should work? Okay. Do the infinite height with steering stick glitch? Wait, what is that? Infinite height with steering stick. Oh, are you talking about auto build canceling? I can't do that. I don't have auto build. Skip Great Sky Island and go straight to Ganon Daddy. Oh, David. Oh, David. I'm very not prepared for that. I'm so not prepared for Ganon Daddy. So we left the manual save, or we left our autosave. Where is our autosave actually? Where's our clean autosave? Where is this? Right next to the water? I think I'm looking at that water, right? Or maybe it's over here. I think that autosave is like right here. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. No matter where it is, we can just walk over to it. All right, so we're gonna get fan, fan, steering stick, and then a bunch of batteries, right? Just a lot of big batteries. Let's do one, let's do two. I think two is gonna be plenty. I feel like we won't need that many. Fuse and tangle. Drop shield. Fuse and tangle the battery. Drop shield. 
confuse and tangle with the fan. Who do you think is going to win for the Super Bowl 49ers or Chiefs? Uh, I don't really follow it to be honest. I'll say 49ers. Just throw a random guess out there. Okay. Do we need two big batteries? Let's send it with one. Let's send it with one battery. I trust. I feel like batteries last a long time. Let's go, baby. Oh, shoot. That did not juggle correctly. No. Will the hover bike design support the weight of two big batteries? Actually, maybe I should do it like... Let's build the hover bike right now, actually. That's a good point, actually. I did not consider the correct weight distribution. Maybe we want two big batteries so that... Let's make it on flat ground so it's a little bit cleaner. So, right about here. This is for chat one for 49ers or two for Chiefs. Ah, uh, it's still kind of off center. Let's go like that. Okay. And then for the batteries. I'm thinking one on the back. Well, like, can I still get on it? No. Maybe like one on the very back here. That's very awesome. Okay. I don't know if this will support the weight. Maybe we should try flying it first. See, that would be the smart thing to do. The problem with that is, I'm not very smart. I'm not going to test it. I'm going to let it ride and hope that it works. Because I trust and I believe. Do you like croissants? Croissants? Yeah. I don't love croissants, but I like them. I'd say I... Yeah, I like croissants, but I'm not going out of my way to like go eat the croissants when I don't have to. But if I get a croissant for breakfast, I'm not going to throw it away. I'm not going to complain. It is an adequate food. Dang, the shields keep dropping here. Okay. Ooh, and I lost one of the fans. Okay, I'm getting a little confused broke. now. Let's just restart. Let's build it somewhere a little easier. I guess this would be a better wall. Let's build it here. And let's not do a hover bike. Let's do something a little different. Let's do a, a cart bike. So like two fans. Let's do four fans. In loving memory of Todd, you will be missed. Let's do four fans, two big batteries. I think this is the play. Okay. Fuse and tangle the cart. Why does it do that? <laughs> well, since when does it break when I fuse and tangle? That, like, I've never seen this before. I'm not even joking. I've fuse and tangled so many times in this game, and I've never had it just, like, disappear. Like, uh huh? I think it's because it's, like, trying to spawn it inside of me or something. Maybe I should just do it closer. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's going in the ground. Wait, so maybe if I do it on flat surface, it'll be better. 
Maybe it doesn't like that it's like on the flat. Okay. Maybe like a wide open spot, surely like this. This is like a nice, hefty, wide area. Okay, maybe carts are just not the way. What about wings? What about sleds? Sleds are like the same thing. Watch this work first try. Hey! Dang the chiefs are up 12 to 10 on the Niners, everyone. Hey, that worked. Okay. Drop that. I'm just gonna bring all the stuff over there. I like that spot better for the launch. I think it's a better launch spot. Chiefs are up. Damn. I'm guessing you don't want the Chiefs to win. Alright, let me put on some music so I can focus. Do it over the edge of the island, then recall. Oh, that's that's actually kind of a smart idea too. Although Slud works fine as well. Okay, so we got the sled. Let's get fan one drop. Okay. <laughs> Maybe doing it off the side of the island has a few downsides. Alright. Equip a new shield. Fan 2. Drop. Fan 3. Drop. Fan 4. Drop. Battery 1. Drop. Battery 2. Drop. Okay, actually, we don't need to drop this one. Let me put some music on and then we juggle. It's a good spot to zuggle. <laughs> this spot right here. This is the god spot. No shot, this doesn't work. Okay, one. No, I don't want you. I want the shield. I gotta remember to build it too. Put Totk music final trailer music hits a banger. I played it earlier. I'll play it again in a sec. But give me a second. <laughs> I think this will work. I got faith in this. I'm feeling pretty good about it. I like our design too. I'm not great at building things in this game. I'm like aggressively average, but I think we'll get by with this. I think the maybe thing that will get us is the battery life. I don't know how long big batteries last for, but I feel like it's a good while. I feel like it'll be enough to get up there. Alright. Why is everyone obsessed with the saxophone in the top trailer? Bro, what? You did not say that. You did not just say, why is everyone... Hold on. Who, who said that? Who said that? Okay. Stop, 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 stop. Everyone stop what you're doing. Stop what you're doing. Stop what, you're, stop what you're doing right now and listen to this. Stop what you're doing right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do 
Do you listen have up, ice listen cream up, listen in up, a listen freezer? Up, listen up, listen the up, drum beat in the end of the top trailer is the best. Everyone quiet, everyone quiet, everyone quiet. Listen to it. I don't know why I'm repping Todd, but you know what? We love him. You can't. You you can't listen to that. Bro. Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But, like, you can't come in my chat. You cannot expect to come in my chat and say that that sax is bad. Why are people obsessed with the sax? Why? That's why, dude. That's why people are obsessed with the sax. It's a very straightforward answer. I just wanted answer. to put on that part. The drums at the end of the trailer are superior along with the sax. That is the most majestic sound I've ever heard. Right? Look, Nintendo is not a perfect company. They do a lot of bad things. In Red. fact, I don't think they're even a good company. No, I didn't make a steering stick. Oh, that sucks. Although, the one thing I gotta give them credit for is that sax in this game. Because holy does it slap. Alright, I hate to do this to you guys, but. Did you know they rejected no Elon choice. Musk? I have no choice but to do that. <laughs> no, 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 it's all fall. Okay, it's fine. Did I know they rejected Elon Musk? Who rejected Elon Musk? What are you talking about? Alright, we'll listen to that trailer now. Because we gotta educate. Mister. Rejecting Elon Musk is plus respect. Yeah, I agree. I like when super rich, get, super rich guys get rejected. Okay, I have so many shields. I need to drop a lot. Oh my god, my ears are having a very nice time right now. It's like hard not to hum along with it. I wish I could whistle, dude. I'm embarrassed, but I cannot whistle. Fan shield, fan shield. Okay, we want the fan shield, not anything else. Can you not bother me right now, Mr. Choo Choo? Okay, this one's a slide, this one's a Hylian, this one's a fan, so we care about this one. And then there's like two more that we got to juggle, and then we're good. Who watched this trailer the moment it came out? I was there. I was one of them. I probably listened to this trailer at least like 20 times before the release. That's not a made up number. I mean, it, it is a made up number, but like. Nintendo rejected Ellen it's Musk not an exaggeration. He to be able to play Mario Kart in the Tesla and the wheel is the controller, but Nintendo just wanted Mario Kart on mobile and on Nintendo consoles. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. defense will be Link. Pause. I love the drum beating Link. along with the sax at the end of the trailer. I was there live at the trailer too.
It's so good, dude. All right. Let's toss a battery on the back and on the front. Here's how we're going to design this. All right, it's the drum part. I'll turn it up a little bit for the drum part. The drum part does deserve some recognition. Hey, it's looking not not half bad. She's not half bad, guys. Right? Look, it's, it's a janky build. Okay, I'll admit. It's a little janky. Imagine we lost our autosaves. I don't think we lost any autosaves. Oh, wait. No, we did lose one. Did we? This is... This is a clean one. Welcome back, Bubba. How you doing? Okay, I legit hate that I happily spent my life up to this point not knowing Elon tried to get his grubby hands on Mario Kart, but now I have suffered. Thank you for the follow, Spider. Spider morale. Um, wait, he tried to buy Mario Kart? Elon Musk? I had no idea. Whoa. I goofed up. I goofed up. I goofed up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I goofed up. Oh, I'm so silly. I saw the sled shield and I was like, oh, sled on a shield? I don't need to juggle that. Like, why would I juggle a sled shield? That's a waste of my time. And then I forgot that the sled is the base of our machine. I need to juggle the sled shield. So if you're curious, like, oh, what the hell happened there? It's because I didn't juggle the sled shield. So when I loaded the save, the shield on the floor got despawned. It doesn't matter. At the end of the day, it just means I have to rejuggle everything. But why don't you just juggle the one sled? You already juggled everything else. Cause wait, what? There we go. Because uh, when you fuse something, when you have all those fans on your back, it destroys the fuse entanglement of everything else. That's fine. <laughs> That's perfectly fine. I hate the saxes too. They are just a repetitive noise. Look, sax in general is not the greatest instrument. I think most people can agree on that. But I would say... Nintendo proved a lot of people wrong. The sax can go hard. It can go really hard. I want to know who was on the sax. I hope that guy got a hire. Because he deserves a hire, man. Or a hire, I mean a raise. I don't know why I said hire. Okay. Let's settle down. Let's rebuild our thingies. Actually, let's juggle everything first. So, rocket shield. I don't care about that. Right now, we have the sledge shield. Let's, like, count everything as we do it. So, this is one. That's the sled. Fan is two. Steering stick is three. Battery is four. I can't believe Elon Musk tried to buy Mario Kart. Why the hell would Elon Musk care about Mario Kart? Does he game? Is bro a gamer? Can't carry any more shields? Okay, we need to drop a few shields. Okay, this is four, right? Battery shield's four. I've already lost count. This is four though, right? I think it's four.
fan shield, five. Fan shield again. Need to drop more shields. Six. What's left? Batteries? Did I get both batteries? I think there's still one battery left. What is this? Hylian shield? Don't care about that. Hylian shield? No. Hylian shield? Hylian shield? Rocket shield? Don't care about that. Fan shield? We do need that. Is there anything else? The shields like got scattered. This is like seven, right? Okay, did any shields go over here that I missed? I think we got everything. Alright, let's build it. You're good? Okay. Let's hope that I am. Let's hope that this thing flies. I should've... Actually, I did say I wasn't going to test it, so I'm not going to test it. I'm a man of my word. Why is it not fusing? Do you have to go on it? There you go. Wait, where's the fourth fan? There it is. Okay. That's a janky build, if I've ever seen one. It's not even like that even either. Eh, it's pretty even. That's pretty even. Alright, let's just check our inventory. Steering stick, battery, battery, and four fans, and a sled. That should be everything. That should be everything. We should be good. Where's the fourth fan scared me? <laughs> Me too, a little bit. Just a tad. This is one of my favorite video game trailers. Oh, dude, it's probably my favorite. Okay, I think we got it. I think we got it. It looks like everything's glued together, which is a very good sign. As long as this guy behind me doesn't break it or kill me. Go up, go up, go up. And it's not using the battery. It's not using the battery. It's not using the battery. We're good. Okay. It's very slow, though. Maybe I should have put in more batteries on it. Is it gonna make it? Dude, I sort of started from like a different area. We have to hope that we get all the way up there. Oh my gosh, the batteries are draining fast. I don't know if we'll make it the whole way. The good news is we could try to land on like a meteory island and then go up from there, which would be a lot easier. But we would have to rebuild a little hover bike or something. What can we try to land on? Wait, let's try to land on this island right here, if we have to. Because our first battery is dead, or it's about to die. Dude, I should have done like four batteries. Four batteries would have done it. Come on, keep going, keep going, bro, keep going. Come on, that little bit of juice, let it last, let it last. Ride the tank. Ride the tank a little more. You can do it, you can do it, battery. Come on, you got- okay. You don't have an hour left. Honestly, that one battery got us a good- a good ways up, though. I think we'll definitely make it to this island. I don't think we'll make it all the way up, though. We'll get damn close, though. Dude, a third battery would have been it. A third battery would have been it. Oh, do I risk it? Like, I could try to go straight to the top island and play it risky, but I could also try to play it safe. Do we play it risky? Guys, quick. Do we play risky or safe? Risky or safe? Don't risk it. It's so close, though. It's so close. It's so close. You definitely won't make it. Come on. We're risking it. We're risking it. We have to risk it. We're making it. We're absolutely making this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. 
Oh no, it's not gonna make it. Please. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, it's got nothing left. No, we use our battery so What's your favorite bread? A third battery was all I needed. A third battery. I shouldn't have risked it. I shouldn't have risked it. Oh, it hurts. Well, now we know. Two batteries. This is, is an not image enough. of a man realizing he screwed up and is a dumbass. We were like so close, though. Why did I unzuggle? I could have just gotten it again. I hate when I do that. Okay. Well, let's just get rid of all these shields. I'm gonna build a new design. I'm gonna build a simpler design. Screw the four fan layout. Actually, maybe we should do four fans. It just drains our battery very fast. Here's the new layout. This is the new layout. Stupid? Hmm. Some may say that. Some may say that. There's no shot that it's gonna carry the weight of two batteries. Let's test it though. Guaranteed. It carries the weight of both of these batteries. Look at this, one on each end. Oh my god, with ease. With ease. With ease, dude. This is the setup. Cause we can make this so much faster too. Fuse and tangle the wheel, I mean the fan, drop it. Fuse and tangle the battery, one, drop it. Fuse and tangle the battery. Do the steering stick, it doesn't matter. It does not matter the order. I just like to keep a mental note in my head of what I'm fusing tang fuse and tangling, so I don't try to do the same one twice. Okay. The speed. We're gonna be back there in no time. <laughs> this is one of my favorite game video games. Oh, I already read that. I'm gonna scroll down. What are we trying to do? I wasn't listening and said drawing. Uh, we have to get to the Ascend Island, which is very, very high above me without teleporting, so we can't use the pure pad. This is an image of a man realizing he screwed up. Yes. I did kind of goof on it, but it's fine. Get a third battery, get a third battery. No, two's enough. Two's plenty. Because we're not using four fans with this setup either, so we should get like twice as high. Think about it. We used two batteries last time, so... But we also used four fans, so our power consumption was much higher. But this power consumption is gonna be half that. Wait, is this battery dead? No, it's not. It should be fine. I'm gonna test that this flies. This flies quite well. I think it'll work. I think this will work. This is gonna be the one. 
Two is enough. Two is enough. Trust me, guys. Two is enough. If two is not enough, I gift you all a sub. Hopefully everyone leaves. <laughs> okay. The bike is there. You guys want to put the orchestra construct on? Or the, the orchestra concert? The one that Nintendo's dropped? Wow, we wait. Let's go! Oh gosh, it's kind of hard to control. It really wants to lean to the right. Also, Link's hands aren't actually on the steering stick, which is interesting. He's kind of like... He's, he's kind of like holding in front of it a little bit. And his feet aren't on on the platform either. You know what? Let him do his thing. He's going to do some 360s as well. As long as it doesn't flip, we're fine. I think this also goes up a lot faster. I feel like we're going up very fast. Because it's less weight, I guess. I haven't listened to the new Nintendo concert, but I would wonder about the copyright on that. Eh. I have... Uh, th this video or this live stream isn't monetized. It should be fine. Yeah, we'll easily make this. We got plenty of juice. Oh wait, you're so right. When one when one of these batteries disappears, it might get super weird. Like the it might like lean super far to the right. I didn't think about that. Bubby, you might be actually onto something. Hopefully we get there before that happens. Are you flipping with a real coin? No, like with my with my body. Guys, you know the best part about this? Flying all the way up here? We can fly straight to recall. We don't have to go through like the normal way. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, it's so tilted. Oh my god. Oh, it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's hard to control. I think we're fine though. I think we're okay. It's, I just gotta really hold left. I'm holding max left right now. <laughs> I'm holding max left. Oh, it's so... It really wants to fall forward. Oh, no, I can't turn it. I have to lean it forward to turn it. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, 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 come on. Go, 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 go. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Get off, get off, get off. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Imagine if that killed me, dude. <laughs> If that killed me, I'd be so mad right now. My idea worked. W. That's awesome. Thank you, Zaya. Oh, I feel so good with this music too. It's winning. Like, you want to see my flip? There it is. We're at the recall shrine. We're at the recall shrine, fellas. Nacho, yeah. That was scary with the battery, dude. That was really scary. I thought it was going to instantly flip. All right, we got the auto save in here, so we're gonna go back to our dirty save. We're just gonna build another hover bike inside of the shrine. Same plan, different story. Whoa, dude, calm down. That flip was crazy. You wanna see it again? I don't mind doing it twice. Here it is. Oh, that's a side hop. There you go. All right, Nacho, yeah. Do the Breath of the Wild 2017 Switch presentation trailer. I, 
I'm just going to let the concert play out. I th it's going to get to that eventually. I actually used, I believe I used the concert trailer music in my latest video at the end. I actually ended up changing the music right before the video dropped. I don't like the music as much as it is as it is currently for the ending. But I got a copyright claim on it. Which would have been fine. I'm not monetizing that video anyway, so I could have kept it. Oh wait, I didn't do the Zenai nice storage. But down the line, maybe one day I will monetize that video. Oh, a lot of the goddess is great. I love your latest video on the ending with the build up, dude. It was whack. In a good way, though. Like, you can't script that. It was such a genuine moment at the end. I loved it. Glad to see some new people here, too. Alright, so we pause. Fan, fan. Steering stick. That's all we need. Right? Thanks for the follow. That should be all we need. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's drop our shields first. There we go. No, thanks for follow up, Bubby. Appreciate it. Oh, this might be... This is probably like top five songs in the Zelda. At least for me. I love Ballad of the Goddess. Ballad of the Goddess. I don't know if I said Ballad. Okay. So those are all fused and tangled. Now we just... Zuggle them up. And let me just build it. Oh! Wait! Wait, guys, I just realized a really big problem. Oh, shoot. There's a gate at the end of this level that's locked, and you need to use recall to open it. Ooh, I don't know. Could we try to fly the hover bike through it when it opens for a second? I know the gate opens for like a brief period of time. Hmm. I did, I completely forgot about that with this shrine. It literally just hit me. Okay. I mean, we just have to try it, I guess. Let's like get over there and like come up with a plan once we get there. The hover bike's ready. Let's go back to our autosave. This is not my autosave. This is the right autosave. I think it can be bypassed without recall, but I'm not sure how. I know you can use Ultra Hand to open it, and I know that somebody's... Uh, that It's possible to fly through it by doing um, infinite arrow height, but... I mean, maybe we can just fly through it if we get the timing right, but that's going to be crazy hard. Let's let's try this. Let's just get over there and see. We might have to, like, try to stall in the air. Oh, wait, the timing perfect. Oh, my God. Wait. Wait. I think Smollett jumped through it in his challenge, but he had a sealed surfing jump. Guys, what if we could fly into it as the gate opens for like a brief second? I accidentally bet points. Can you refund me one point back so we have, so that you have 420? I don't know how to refund points. I don't think that's possible, dude. I'm sorry. He doesn't have a shield though. Yeah, I don't have shields or anything. Hmm. What if I slotted in an object to, to jam the door? What about that? Like, if I have an object that's keeping the gate from closing, will the gate just not close and then it'll just stay open, maybe?
Let me see what happens if I put my hover bike, like, inside the gate. Like, I wonder if it actually stops the gate from closing. Okay, it breaks the hover bike. It doesn't stop the gate. Hmm. Tricky. That's tricky. Okay, I need to just use recall for this, or I'll just use all trims. This feels weird. I never build a hover bike backwards. I always do it the other way around. I guess I just do like this. Uh, it's janky, but I think it'll fly. We, we gotta just take this back to the beginning and then aim it forward again so that we don't have to like rotate it. We can't rotate it. So our angle has to be good for the for the takeoff before we load the before we load our save. I think what we should do is time it. I'm gonna set a stopwatch and then try to figure out exactly when that door opens so that maybe I can find a consistent launch time that's working. So I'm starting it right now. Let's just sort of beeline it straight to the gate and see how much longer it has before the door opens. And I'm gonna try to keep it low so that I can easily like get in there. Okay, so we gotta wait a while. We gotta delay a good amount. Yeah, there's no way I could save this, right? I don't think I could save this. Let me try holding straight back and see if I can just go straight up. Try jamming it with a sled or wing. Okay, yeah, I can't save this now. So, I am gonna pop Ultra Hand right now, but I'm gonna just use this to get it back and then I'm gonna reload the save. It'll just be faster than like going back to the alt save. There's no point in going back to the alt save. We can just move it over. So let's get it like that. Reloader, clean save. Okay, so we should wait like... Let's try waiting 10 seconds before we get on. Try jamming with the sledder wing. I tried... Oh wait, I didn't try it with a one object. Maybe. Okay, wait, 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 no. Still too early. Wait, wait, maybe, maybe. No, oh, whoa. dude, that could have been it. That was so close. Wait, let me, I could jump off here. Wait, 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 wait. If I could click B at the right moment. Oh! I got it! I got it! <laughs> Let's go! Oh, that was sick. Okay. We got recall. Huge. Huge. Let's go. What happened to Todd? Uh, we lost him. We'll get him back, though. There's recall. It would have been sick if I flew into it, but I'm pretty happy with that, too. Ooh. That's hype. Okay. I don't think we can ride a wing from here. But I really want to ride a wing. Yeah, we need to get back there somehow. So we might as well ride, ride, ride a wing to get to back, back to the temple of time. Damn, I'm not speaking English today. <laughs> Alright, so... I guess I just lot a wing. I could do that. I'll just lot a wing over. Wait, is this save? Okay, this is save with the recall completed. Sweet. Rip Todd. I guess we should go get Todd. Let, let's go get Todd real quick. We'll, we'll revive Todd. Do I have a torch in my inventory? 
I don't have a torch. Let's let's grab Todd real quick and then we'll continue. The wing works, Korok of Doom. Wait, what Korok? What Korok are you talking about? Give Todd to Zelda? We're going to. Don't you worry. What did you miss? You were in the shower? We got recall done, which is pretty hype. I thought recall would be super easy. And to be honest, it wasn't that bad. But it was kind of a neat thing we had to do to get past the door. I kind of like wedged the, the fan the hover bike, I should say, into the wall, and then I jumped off while the gate closed or opened halfway. Oh, wait, I need to go to the tower. What am I doing? Todd's the goat. Hey, we're getting him. We're getting him. Do you have any commands like exclamation point sniff or exclamation point hours? What is? What do? What does sniff do? Exclamation point sniff? I'm guessing hours just tells you how many hours you've been live for. But no, I, I don't really have that many commands. To be honest, I usually don't have commands for streams, but, you know, these are special challenge streams. I want commands to be here. Especially since this is, like, a very confusing one, where, like, if you're a new player or a new viewer, and you join up and you're like, yo, he's using a paraglider, he's using a shield, he's using a sword, He's got sages. Bro, fail the challenge. So, that's why I'm, like, giving out all the info about, like, the alt save and stuff. So people understand it. It's such a weird glitz, Zuggling. Without Zuggling, all of this would be impossible. Again, Zuggling's the one that lets you move things between saves. In a very glitzed state, mind you. Okay, so Todd's here. We're gonna pick him up. We're gonna set him on fire. Yeah. And we're gonna juggle him. And then now we need to go to Nacho, yeah. And we're gonna f use Entangle a wing and juggle that wing so that we can so we can go straight to the Temple of Time. What's up, Inside Town? Yeah, we got Todd. We got Todd. We should do like a little like uh, a little song just to like celebrate that we have Todd back. He's back, fellas. Let's put the orchestra back on. How about that? Oh, Zelda's a lullaby. I'm down for this. Todd is the king. That's nice, that's nice. That's real nice, okay. So shield, fuse and tangle. Wow, so that one didn't break immediately, interesting. I'm gonna put this super far back because as soon as it starts going, I need to juggle the shield. Hopefully this works. Okay, I think this would work, I think this will work. So, clean save. We need to run outside and immediately hop on that wing before it leaves us. Because it's going to start riding off into the distance if we don't get on it. That's our bus ticket right there to the Temple of Time. We got to make our bus. Go! No! No, come back! No! Oh, I ran out of stamina as well. No, that's my ticket out of here. Let's not take it out of here, man. Man. I want to ride my wing. I really like riding wings. Okay. How else could I do this? Maybe not run out of stamina would be one. <laughs> There is a Legend of Zelda Orchestra Concert Nintendo of America channel name, posted and played the Tears theme with the saxophone and other songs. That's what we're listening to right now. Recall then reload. 
if I recall and then reload, it'll get recall locked. And if it gets recall locked, we can't move it. Holy shit. Hi. <laughs> I don't know why it does that. Why does Fuse Entanglement be so weird to wings? Okay. Boom. Bang. Okay. All right. We're trying it again. We're trying it again. We got a whole ass to get on that wing. I believe we can make this. I believe we can make this run. What are we doing? We're trying to run onto this wing before it leaves us. Go! Don't run out of stamina. Oh my gosh, it's so fast! We're not making that. We're absolutely not making that. Oh, I want my wing so bad. Hmm. I need to like set it up so that it takes a while before it gets on the track. So what if when I had Zelda it like turned fall? into a dragon the dark Zelda lullaby, I didn't hear the OG version, but now I hear it. What if I do it backwards? What if I do it sideways? Oh, that slows it down. That slows it down. That slows it down. That's the time we need. That's the time we need. This is gonna work. This is gonna work. That slows her down. I believe in this. I believe in this. Literally just save next to the takeoff area. That's such a boring solution. And the music's too hype for that. I'm making that run, bro. I don't care what it takes, we're making that run. I'm making my bus. That's not gonna work. That will work. Don't despawn. Okay. Okay, so we want this to be at a perfect sideways angle, right? Let's have it like slide in, like right here. Let him cook. Is that gonna make it? That's not gonna slide in, that's not gonna slide in. Right here. Okay, that's, that's the one, that's the one, that's the one. Tilted. Right. There. Love the save. We make this. We make this. It's going to slowly tilt down. It's going to slowly turn like this. It's going to start going full speed down that ramp. And as it's going full speed, I'm going to catch up to it. I'm going to land on it. I'm going to jump on it. And I'm going to make that bus. With time to spare. Oh my god, I got stuck. Because there's one right here. I guarantee you if I move this right now, it's gonna start moving again. Guaranteed. Wow, dude. Wow. That's so unfortunate, bro. Okay, okay. Sure. Sure, dude. Fine, Nintendo. I see how it is. That's fine. That's fine. I got plenty of solutions on my sleeve. NVM, he burnt it. I don't mind. Oh, what a voice crack. Okay. Here's what we do now. We drop our sealed. Collect it. Oh my god, there's a lot of sealed. I... Yo, thank you for the follow inside. Alright, we're going to fuse and tangle. Don't despawn. And now, what we want 
is a sideways leaning tilt like this. Like this. Ideally, right? Let's test it. Let's test it. It's going to fall into the nose. That's going to delay it. Then it's going to slowly tilt back. Then slowly turn to the right. Tilt, tilt right, tilt right, tilt right. Honestly, this works. Even if it doesn't tilt right, that works. That works, that works. Let's have it tilt like this a little bit. I need to zuggle first, though. Burp. This is gonna work, this is gonna work. Oh yeah, and that tilts it, that tilts it. Okay, right here, right here. Right here. Just like that, just like that. Okay, as we're loading, it falls, it hits the ground, it slowly maneuvers to the right, starts going down, right when we catch up to it. We make these, we make these. I ran out of stamina. I ran out of stamina. You should try going on the wing. Go, Link! Go! Go! Oh my god, if I didn't run out of stamina, if I didn't run out of stamina, dude, my plan was perfect. If I didn't run out of stamina, I was there. I was there, man. I was there. Have you tried being faster? Have you tried being faster? I'm gonna try that on this attempt. That's actually really good advice. Thank you so much for the really inspirational words. I'll make sure to do that. If I just don't run out of stamina, if I just don't run out of stamina, we're there. If I just don't run out of stamina. That's all we need. Yo, thank you for the follow. This is the right one, right? Because it's upside down, surely. Try throw or crab. Okay, sprinting. okay, okay, okay. Sideways? Wait, what about a sideways tilt like this? Oh, that's delay. That's delay. Actually, no, it's not really delay. Okay. We're going back to basics. It's the 49ers versus Chiefs Slight checking tilt. 19 to 19. There might be overtime. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Holding B. Put the cold Jira theme on. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Yes! We got it. Hell yeah. I told you it's the stamina, man. Just the stamina. Feels good. It feels so good. Damn, it's already running out. Oh, I guess because it went through saves. Wait, am I gonna make it? Why is it running out so fast? We just land in the water. It's fine. Screw the water. Really bad it is. I like that. Clutch on the side. What does that mean? Okay, we already know how to do this. We just run and jump. Why would anyone use recall here? It's actually crazy to use recall here. It's like faster not to. <laughs> All right, fellas. theme is This is the moment that I've dreaded for for decades. This is the one moment where we will have to give up our spirit orbs. For a heart container. Which means for the rest of this run, 
We're going to have to play hitless. If we get hit, we have to reload our last save. And there's our fourth heart container. So we picked up the Kietum. As long as we don't get hit, we're not using it. <laughs> okay, we're actually using our fourth heart. <laughs> we can't avoid this. We literally cannot. It's such an L that Nintendo did this to us, but we can't do anything about this. I wish there was another way. There is another way, but I'm not doing it. I'm not doing GSI skip for this. GSI skip would like fix one problem and create 20 more at the end of the game. So we're going to try to do this with as few key items and items as possible. So if you want to keep track, we've technically kind of used like one key item so far. If you consider like that door. But then use light to blessing. Yeah. Yeah, that whole exchange is pretty much un unskippable, unavoidable for our purposes. But what is the least we can do? That's what we're gonna try to do. Oh shit, why do I keep ascending, bro? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> yeah. My brain just goes on autopilot and I just start using runes, dude. It's... I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you for the reminders. Okay, wait, how... You could how... do skip. You could do GSI skip? Yeah, the thing is... If I do GSI skip, then you can get off GSI without using key items or regular items, but then you can't beat the game. So I want to try to beat the game with the least amount of key items and normal items used. That's what I want to try to do with this run. And doing GSI skip would make that not work. Because in order to do GSI skip and beat the rest of the game with no items, like, you would need... It, it just wouldn't work. Like, there's too much setup, and you wouldn't build a plot and zuggle enough items. Not to mention that if you did do GSI skip, you would, if you die once, then you'd have to restart all of GSI skip. Okay, I think I have to build another hover break, guys. I don't think I could make this... What is a KSI skip? What's GSI skip? So GSI is the Great Sky Island. It's the island that I'm on right now. It's like the whole... It's like, if you look at my map right now, this whole island, or I guess string of islands, is the Great Sky Island. It's got the four shrines on it. It's got, you know, the, like it's the tutorial island, basically. So Timber found the Great Sky Island skip. So you can skip doing this whole island by doing a very, 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 very complex setup with like alternate saves like I'm doing, but it takes about two hours to do, to like set it up fully. And probably a little more. Thank you for the follow, by the way. So if I did do that, the problem is you don't get any saves after GSI skip and you're actually locked in the army fight. So if you leave GSI early, like he, like Timber does, the only place you can go after you leave GSI is army. And with no items, like, I would definitely die in army. You know? Like, we need to be set up for army. And we can't set up GSI skip and set up for the end of the game. So no matter how you slice it, it just wouldn't work. I mean, let's be real, this whole challenge is kind of just nuts. Like, it's very unlikely to work even with what we have now. But we'll try our best. We'll do our best. Can you eat Ganon? Yeah, what's up, Phelps? Can I eat Ganon? I guess. If I'm hungry enough. Yeah, I wish GSI skip was like a easier and be like more useful it's kind of like a a neat trick but it doesn't actually really solve anything it kind of just creates a lot more problems although it is possible to beat the game without any key items you just have to use items like the thing is like 
I'll put it simply. I'll put it very, very simply. I've proven that you can beat this game without using any items, but you can use key items. Timber's proven you can beat this game using no key items, but using items. Now I'm trying to combine the two and find the middle ground. The complete answer is that you can't. You can't do no items and no key items. You have to choose one or the other. So I'm trying to just like do the absolute minimum. What's the lowest amount of things we could do? So far, it's basically like zero. We've had to use our heart container um, and we've had to like do the like trading in our soul orbs. So right now we're kind of at, the, depending on the way you look at it, like one or two. The heart container door is unskippable with the way we've done it and the, and the spear rub thing. Thanks for the follow lemon. Use to send. This is the alt save, guys. This is the alt save. This 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 is the save I can use stuff on. So we're gonna we're gonna build on our hover bike. So steering stick. I didn't use the send in the clean save, did I? So big battery. We slot that. Oh, whatever, that's fine. Please entangle that. Oh shoot. Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna restart this. I'm getting confused now. So two fans. Zona devices are items. Yeah, this is the alt save, guys. We can do whatever we please on this save. We're, we're basically slotting in items to the clean save right now. So we're gonna build a hover bike with a big battery so that we don't have to use our normal battery. The reason we're doing this is to get to the end of Great Skyland, because you see, like, we can't jump that. The bridge is broken, or the pathway is broken. So we need to use a hover bike to get over it. So this is the same way that we got to recall, by the way. Clothing equals alt save. Yeah, that's actually, I'm, I'm thinking about putting that on OBS just so it's more clear because I understand that people are kind of confused. But yeah, if you guys see that I'm wearing clothes, uh, that's the alt save. 100% you can know for As sure. As a wise man once said, so the best way to get something done if you if you hold near and dear to you that you are like to be able to. Anyways, I, I, I'm we're ready to get a lot done. Okay. Um, hang on, uh, sorry, oh, Joe Biden. What am I listening to? What was that? <laughs> Okay, this doesn't need to be perfect by any means. Oh god, that's it. I want it to be a little better than that. That's fine. Let's just throw a battery on the back. I think it should support the weight. So now, we load back to our clean save. Which is this one. And the bike should be like, basically exactly where we're standing. I don't know what happens if we load where we're load where the hover bike is actually. Oh yeah, it's here. Sweet. Oh gosh. Okay. We're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. <laughs> it's so fun just riding the hover bike around. I love that we can do this. Alright, let's talk to Zelda. Let's give Zelda the torch. You guys know how it goes. Time to scammer. Oh, <laughs> and the bike's in there too. <laughs> Dude, it would be crazy if the bike was also in the cutscene with Zelda. Like, imagine Zelda standing on the bike or something. Like, you can see the bike on the side. <laughs> Master Torch. Todd. 
You're going to a better home, buddy. You will be missed. Yeah, it gives Zelda a Zelda sick hits wheelie. The wheelie. Yeah, Zelda might hit the wheelie in a second. Although I don't think... Dude, I wish I parked the... If I had known it was going to be in the cutscene, I would have parked it right where Zelda is. Is it worth going back and rewatching the cutscene just to get the Whenever hoverbike in frame? Whenever you are done streaming for the night, I have the beta version of the tutorial level finished. I need oh, really? 15 minutes to upload You can turn. see the bike! You can see the bike, it's covering the camera. <laughs> God leaving brings a tear to my eye. A oh, tear switch the, the camera angle, I want to- No, not like that. Switch it again. Where's the bike? Where's the bike? Where's the bike? Oh man. Zara, there's a motorcycle right next to you. You wanna ride it? Oh. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> See, Link knows how to angle the camera right. <gasps> Gotta love rendering cutscenes in real time, dude. I love it. When I when I'm like the bike toddler. Hmm. I feel like Todd has to be reserved for the torch. I think we can come up with something different for the for the bike. Yellow. Link, you must find me. Link, you must find me. So is this Ganon talking, or is this actually Zelda? It's Ganon, right? I guess we can ride- oh, no, we can't ride the bike. Ted bike Todd torch. Oh man, we could have ridden the bike somewhere cool. Ah, oh, that sucks. Okay. You know what? We have the save. Let's go back to the the dirty one and just re-angle the bike. <laughs> Cause then we just get a free hover bike ride. Like why not? Name it bike hill? Pronounced like Michael. <laughs> Bikel? <laughs> I actually go so hard. I actually love that. Bikel? Michael, but with a B. That's like... It's so cursed, but I love it. Put bike on Zelda. I don't think we're gonna watch the cutscene again. We could, though. Is it worth it? That was a terrible jump. Guys... You're gonna hate me when I show you the plan to kill Ganondorf. You're gonna hate me. It is going to be the most hell-inducing thing you've ever seen. Like, it's it's rough. If you thought beating Ganondorf with uh, the laser emitter, with beating the game with uh, only key items, if you thought that was bad, you don't know the half of it. You really don't. Because let me tell you, that whole laser emitter thing relies off of having, like, I mean, I guess I could load in big batteries, but, like, even the big batteries won't last long enough. Also, I don't have auto build, so I won't be able to clip out of that room using the same glitch. So that whole, like, laser emitter situation is not how we have to kill him. It won't work. And let me tell you, I've been workshopping this for a long time. And I've tested it a lot of things. And it's, it's bad, okay? It's, it's bad. It's really bad, guys. Like, it's to the point where I believe that my plan could work for, like, a machine... But for an actual, like, human to do it would be almost impossible. So let me lay it out for you. Do a flip. Do a flip. Maybe later. Does it involve a wheel stick? It doesn't. 
Spy Girl, that is what I initially planned on doing is a wheel stick. And let me tell you, no. <laughs> the wheel does one damage per second. And Ganondorf has 7,500 health. I would have to stand in, in the Ganon arena, hitting Ganon with a wheel stick for however long 7,500 seconds is without getting hit. I'm going to emphasize that without getting freaking hit, dude. So that's not going to work. And the laser emitter is not going to work. So someone sent me a glitch that is like, it requires so many miracles, but it could be something. The glitch actually allows us to use weapons. Not by attacking. We can never attack. That's out the door. But we can have a weapon with its hitbox enabled attached to Link's hand. So imagine like this torch, but imagine it, its hitbox is like, attached. Think of it like this. If I were to throw this torch, it would hit an enemy, right? Like if I throw this torch, like imagine... I know, I know the torch is like fake and stuff, but imagine I had a real torch and I throw it at an enemy. It would hit the enemy, right? That's because when you throw an object, the hitbox gets enabled for that object. If you recall lock an object that's fuse entangled while it's being thrown, and then you fuse that to another object, and then you juggle that object, then it will actually keep its hitbox enabled. I know nothing made any sense that I just said, and that's just the way that this goes. But when you see it, you'll believe it. There's one really, really, really massive problem with this, though. It, and it's probably, like, the biggest thing that's gonna stop this from being possible. Because, like I said, this whole challenge is probably not possible to do with, like, the current amount of key items that we've used so far. Is that it breaks it has durability still so it does damage it does good damage even enough damage to kill ganondorf but to kill him without getting hit and we only have one shot now it's not like we lose the weapons if we die in ganondorf but the problem is we're only well, gonna like zuggle in enough split. The bike's kill name Ganondorf. is either Ted, Baikal, Shad, or Fred. Hyrule Kingdom. I'm actually gonna head straight down to army. Like, I know in the other runs, I was like, oh, let's do all the dungeons. There's really no point in doing anything. Because unlike the other run where I was allowed to use key items, oh, this is shoot. a like minimum key item, now. minimum item playthrough. So anything we want to get is like we, like we can't progress. What we have right now is as much as we can possibly progress, which is nothing. Like the whole point is that we can't use anything. Well, yeah, it's, it's, it's nothing. Like even though we have pure pad, runes, battery cell, we've never actually used any of those. Never used our heart container either. The bike can be all of the names. I kind of like... Bikel. I kind of like that name. So we are bashing our heads against a wall hoping we win. Yes. Yes, that's exactly what we're doing. Spy girl. You summed it up very well there. So I'll... I'll show you the document I've made. I know it's not going to make any sense to every single one of you because it doesn't make any sense to me but the plan is insane the plan relies off basically like three consecutive miracles happening in a row and doing it hitless is not one of those miracles <laughs> That's just like a bonus that we have to do it hitless. <laughs> That's gonna be so fun, guys. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for this. <laughs> Cold Gear theme. 
Kogera theme. I'm not gonna put music on just yet. Wait, why am I going over here? Oh, wait. Guys, I remember we have to do a fall damage cancel to get down there, actually. Okay, this is possible. There's a way to cancel your fall damage without anything, but you need to climb right before you hit the ground. Also, our manual save is dirty, right? Yeah, it's dirty, okay. Okay, so we need to grab the wall right before we hit the ground to cancel our fall damage. Because we're not going to have the paraglider. Focus up, focus up. How am I going to find a good wall to even climb? Ugh, these walls are terrible. I want like a flat wall. Just like a nice, clean, slick wall to grab on. Oh wait, maybe this, maybe this, maybe this. No. I don't know. Oh, we got our first right. Let's go. We're fine. Okay. And now we have to get to the army area with uh, nothing. <laughs> we can't clip out of bounds like last time. So we have to go through the enemies. Thank you, Supreme Trick, and I appreciate that. Where's the entrance? There it is. No way! It's here? No. He's back? You can't make this shit up, dude. You actually can't make this shit up. Michael's back. Holy shit. Can we get a dub train? Can we actually get a dub train? Michael's so back. And he's like in a spot where we can ride him. Oh, sh. I used the battery cell. Okay, wait. It auto saved right before. It auto saved right before. It's fine. We can't use Michael, but it's all right. It's fine. It's, it's just nice that he's here. It, it feels like he's like trying to like, you know, he's, he's, he's wishing us well. He's telling us, hey, good luck, man. I know you're not going to need me ever again, but it's like, it feels like he's just, look, he's, he's leaning towards us and it just feels like he just wants to say like, hey, man, here's the entrance. I'm wishing you the best. Take care of yourself. That's how I see a bike right now. I mean, could he have landed in any better spot than the entrance to the depths? Seriously. Get Minu for duping items? I can't get key items, guys. The whole point is using and getting the least amount of key items as possible. Oh my gosh, how did that not heal me? Okay. I'm doing this without a paraglider is a little scary. Oh, shit. I can't take damage. Guys, I'm going to forget this a lot. If I take damage, you gotta tell me. I mean, I guess I'll see it eventually. But I'm not allowed to take a fourth hit because, or a first hit. Because that fourth heart is a key item. And I'm using it if I get hit. So, Terry the Torch. Todd the torch, Terry the shield, Bikel the bike. Yeah, biker's here for morale, exactly. Can I do this? No. <laughs> oh man, this is... This is like not even something I thought about, is getting through this whole area. Because there's so much gloom. There's so much gloom. We might actually need to get Baikal. Like, we might need to, like, revamp Baikal. Like, set him up again. Okay, I'm gonna try to do off this ledge. No. <laughs> I don't know, man. We have to we have to like land and then immediately start running away so we don't get killed by gloom. Bike makeover. We need something to get through that. I don't know though. But it's been like six hours. Let the horn statue take away your heart. 
Doesn't that, what does that, what does that require? Wait, that's actually a really interesting idea. That's a really interesting idea. Does that require anything? If, if the horn statue takes away my heart. Cause that would, that would be really nice. If it could take away my heart, cause then we could actually take damage again. I didn't think about that. But if, if the horn statue can take my heart without anything. Rupees. Okay, rupees is not a key item or a normal item. We're allowed to get rupees. As long as it doesn't show up in like one of the spots. And rupees doesn't. Ru you see rupees is on top right? We should definitely do that then. That's kind of funny. The one way we can progress is by unprogressing. <laughs> we have to get rid of hearts to progress. Don't they just take it and you have to buy it back? We've been bugging about that idea for 30 minutes. Oh, really? I'm sorry. Okay. How do I get out of here? Oh, shoot. I can't teleport out. I think I have to reload a save before I went in. Hyrule Field? Hmm. Where is this? Is this before I went in the depths? I didn't even think about it, but like, if I go in the depths, I can't get out. I guess I technically can if I get Bicol with a bunch of large batteries, but it'd be a pain. But you would be using Light of Blessing to make rupees? Wait, what? How are we going to be Gandor with nothing? I'll go over the plan in a bit. Uh, let's wait till we get there, though. Hey, what's up, Bincraft? What have I been doing the last three hours? GSI. Finishing up GSI. And we did it. The only thing that has uh, brick walled us so far is at the end of GSI, it's the thing that happens to Smollett too, where it's like you have to turn in your spoon rubs for hard container. I've spoken a lot of you about that as well. So it's not like I just like didn't give it a second thought. And like, it, it's just something that the only way to skip is GSI skip, which is just not worth it. I think the horn statue just takes it the first time and doesn't give you anything. I mean, if the horn statue gives me, what, what would it even give me? How would I get there though, actually? How would I get to the horn statue with nothing? Like, I need to break the wall somehow. I guess I could do time bombs again. I, I'll just lot in time bombs, I guess. The statue is in the Royal Secret Passage, so we need to clip in there first. We can't clip. No, we can just, like, overload clip. So we can clip. It's just, it's very hard to control. There's, like, overloading clipping. Because we only go straight down. But luckily, it is underneath us. I think we can just break into it though because we can slot in time bombs which will work right we can just do time bombs okay no. open it up wait what whatever happened please go talk to pure forest she doesn't give me anything the first time right i don't think i don't think she gives us anything here We should be fine. Have a little chat with Pira. Hello. Okay. Now where have you been? GSI? Oh, don't keep walking. You're not a ghost, are you? Don't walk any closer. Looks interesting. <laughs> she's looking at Todd. <laughs> she likes Todd. I, I'm getting the vibe that she's into Todd, Loki. One step five... at a time. Yeah, one step at a time. She's referencing taking things what slow with Todd. Happened? She's like, oh, Todd. 
I gotta take this one step at a time. I can't rush things. My one chance with Todd. I'm sorry, Pure, but Todd's mine. Like, that's a done deal. We're, we're together. We're bound. You can't unbind us. So when you and Princess Zelda go beneath Hyrule Castle, Todd. you discover a mysterious mummy, which suddenly reanimates. I'm skipping this. I'm already bored of this cutscene. <laughs> Pura x Todd. No, I won't let it happen. Huh? This torch is not leaving my hand, let me tell you. What? This torch is glued to my hand. We're not letting go of it. This Raru you met, I think that's what the first king of Hyrule was named. Hmm. Are they the are they one and the same? So much this doesn't make sense yet. Hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna spam text. I know the story. I know the story. Please don't give me anything. Here, take an apple, Link. All right. So now we can go in here, right? He's gonna be like, oh my God, you're Link? I had no idea, bro. Shit, my bad. Open it up. Todd got all the girls. Oh, you know it, dude. Todd pulls. Todd's got those curves. He's tall, he's strong, he's powerful. He's independent. Actually, he's not. He's kind of like dependent on Link to be held. Can you scope check? <laughs> no. You want me to fail? Okay. So we need to go through here. But how do I move this? Oh no. Is it Ultra Hands? God legit pulling girls. Is it Ultra Hands to get through this? Huh? Mm. Alright, wait, do we have a save nearby? We do. I'm gonna test Ultra Hand here. Oh, it's not Ultra Hand. Okay, sick. Wait, so how do you open it? I'll reload to before I use Ultra Hand. How do you get in there? Have to do a temple? You have to do a temple to get in there? Oh. You have to do a temple. Hey, dude. That's awesome. That's so fun. I'm not doing a temple. I'm not doing a temple, guys. But listen. Oh, we got Todd back. He's lit again. Let's think about this. Go around from castle side. Actually, you know what we should do? Here's exactly what we should do. We have to go to this dirty save. We're going to be smart about this. We're going to clip into that room by Zuggle overloading Tulin. and SLDing a stick. Tulin? We don't have a paraglider. Guys, no matter which temple we do, it'd be so brutal. It'd be so brutal. Plus, we can't finish it. If we finish the temple, we pick up a a steering stick. I mean, <laughs> what am I going to say? We pick up the sage's will or whatever, the sage's vow, so we can't finish it. So what I'm going to do, this is the save file, this is the alt save file. I'm going to go over there, I'm going to write down the coordinates of exactly where that angel statue is. And I'm going to do a few things. I can't slot the steering stick that I'm going to clip with. Because if you slot a steering stick, you can't clip with it. So I have to SLD the steering stick. Which is another glitch to get things through saves. But it's way less useful. Okay, so it's like almost right beneath the surface. So we gotta click B pretty quickly once we go on the steering stick. Okay, let's check the cords. Coordinates are... Let me write this on my phone. Minus two, three, eight. 
157 0004 Okay So now we're going to go to that spot above Actually first we need to overload We're gonna just overload a lot. So you just can be disabled? Yeah, but I don't wanna pick them up. I don't wanna pick up key items, I don't have to. Also, we should at least try this first to see if this works. Can't you skip army entirely by Zuckle Overloading? No. You can skip boss rest by Zuckle Overloading. But there's so many problems that like... It, it, it's not that simple. If you have a steering stick that's not attached to you, and you're Zuggle Overloaded, you can clip with that steering stick. Which is kind of what I'm going to be trying to do to skip boss rest on this attempt. But it's also like... There's like 30 levels deeper than that. Because also, if I'm Zuggle Overloaded when I beat Ganondorf, I'll soft lock at Demon Dragon. Because like being on Zelda is like the same as being on a steering stick. So if you clip while you're on a steering stick, you'll clip when you're on Zelda. And if you clip while you're on Zelda, you get stuck in a permanent loop where you can't do anything. It's like you spawn on Zelda and then you clip out of bounds and then you spawn on Zelda and you clip out of bounds. So it gets very broken. Okay, so now we're gonna load a save. I really gotta be careful about the autosaves. We gotta be really careful that we don't lose our autosaves, because our autosaves, we have like, I think we have three clean autosaves, or maybe four. Welcome back, Bubba. I wonder if you can beat a LEGO game using only glitches. Okay, so now Link's super overloaded, which is what we want. You can see this body is like very missing. A lot of things are missing with Link. So I'm gonna zuggle up a little bit more actually. Okay, that's definitely a lot of Zuggles. So we need to go to those coordinates again, which is negative 238, 157. We also need to get a shield out like this. 238, 157. This is all save, just to be clear. If I get this first try, I'd be crazy. I don't think I will though. 157. Is it like in the water? Shit. That's not good if it's like in the water. Because it has to be somewhere I can put the steering stick down. It's like in her room. 238 is right in the doorway. And then 57. I mean, this is like the closest we can get is right here. This is like pretty much right above it. So what we need to do is put a steering stick. We need to just lock the steering. You can't use fusing this equipment. What? 
Can't use fuse? Why? Is it because I'm like too slow overloaded? I guess I gotta un unzuggle a little bit. Now does it work? Still no. Let me try dropping my weapons. Does it work now? Still no. Hmm. So I guess I'm too overloaded for this. Slow to save real quick. That's kind of confusing. Keep switch shields. Keep switch shields. What does that mean? It's like just switch shields. I think I tried that. They did patch that, by the way. Crazy Alex. But there's also several ways to zuggle. The way that I'm zuggling is, like, the OG method. There was a 1.0. This is not the latest version of the game. This is the OG version of the game. Let me just test out the SLD first. So the SLD is, like, you fuse and tangle, a steering stick. Then you have the steering stick, like, here. So, you pause, drop this, equip this, pause buffer, drop that, and then load another save. So this is not fuse entangled, or is lauded, but it should still be there if I did it right. The steering stick should still be there. And it's not attached to Link, it's not like connected to Link at all. Bluetooth. Bluetooth. This is not Bluetooth. <laughs> that Bluetooth is the other one. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Ted Rodman? To Redman. I don't know if I read that wrong. Okay. Yeah, you see that? So the steering stick's still here, even though we didn't slot it. We need that to happen when we load into our clean save, but we then we need also to be Zuggle overloaded. Okay, so we got the SLD. I just wanted to test that real quick. Let's we'll zuggle overload a little bit, but not too much. Because I need to be pretty overloaded, but I guess if I overload that much, it breaks things too much. Because I need Link to start losing his face and stuff. Like, a, like if he loses his hair and his like body and clothes and stuff... That's what we actually want to happen. Don't forget Todd. The more desync that he is, the better it is for us, like the easier it is to clip, basically. So we want to be overloaded, but I guess if we're too overloaded, we can't SLD. Just kind of a problem. Let's try with just this many. Let's try this. Don't forget Todd. I'm not going to forget Todd. How about we just ascend from this statue to see where you need to go down? It didn't let me. I tried that. I'll try again now. Okay, sick. So we're pretty... Oh, wait. I can't ascend right here. Yeah, I mean, we're pretty much there. Like I said, it's kind of in a weird spot. It's, it's definitely not in a great spot for what we're trying to do. 
Oh yeah, we have to really hope that this SLD works. So... Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, so we fuse and tangle that. That's good. That's very good. So we're gonna put this right... We want this to be as close as possible. Like there. And then... Let's juggle more weapons. I'm kind of scared to zuggle the shield right now, just because that's what we're SLDing is the shield. But I'll zuggle some shields too. I'll just make sure not to zuggle that shield. I really hope we get this first try, but I don't think we will. Okay, let's try it. Does that get rid of that? Shit, it does. Oh gosh, is it, it's probably not gonna let me do it now, is it? Gosh dang it, I screwed it up. I should have just been happy with what I, with what I did. Okay, well we can kind of like test if this would have worked anyway. By loading the save and seeing if we clip with a steering stick. We can test this. Yo, what's up, Mr. Manga? How you doing? Life is so easy and privileged on 1.0. Fuse and tangle and zuggle like it's no problem. I'm on 1.2.1 if I've been working on a fuse entanglement chain for like an hour. <laughs> Why can't you get 1.1? I mean 1.0. What's up, what's up, Iraq? Alright. Obviously, this is the dirty save. But like, if this worked, this is a proof of concept. We're gonna just place the steering stick here and see if we can clip with it. It's kind of a weird spot. Let's put it... Okay, we can't even move it. Okay, that's proof of concept. That's proof of concept. That is proof of concept. We clipped through that. I did spam B way too quickly, but honestly, that's good. That's really good news for us. That's really good news for us. Because if I had just not messed that up... Okay. It's possible to get into that room. I, I'm almost certain. I need to like wait a lot longer before I hit B. Because when I hit B, I get off of the steering stick and I lose the no clip. Okay. How is our saves looking, by the way? One, two, three. Okay. All of our auto. We have four clean auto saves. Okay. We're going to load back. One more time. And we're not going to goof it up. We're going to zuggle until we're overloaded once. Then we're going to... Reload the save. Fuse and tangle the shield. Zuggle overload only with weapons. And then try to load back our clean save. That's our plan. That's our plan. This got back. Did you get the horn statue yet? No. But we have a proof of concept to get there. And it doesn't require us doing the temple, which I'm very happy about. Although it's probably going to be a little challenging to get in. Okay, so step one, Zoggle Overload. We're going to overload until a weapon drops on the floor. That's my, like, marker. What's the point? To get the Horn Statue is... It will remove one of our heart containers, which sounds bad. But the idea is I want to beat the game with using as few key items as possible. So if I get hit once, that fourth heart container is technically getting used. But this horn statue guy, he can get rid of the heart container. So that would mean we can actually get hit. That means we're able to beat army with three hearts, not zero. <laughs> so instead of doing army hitless, we can get hit in army and Gandorf like once. It's not like the best thing in the world. <laughs> it's still gonna be hard to do army when Gandorf with three hearts, but you know, like I'd rather do it with three hearts. Okay, that's good. I'd rather do it with three hearts than uh, a quarter of a heart, I guess. Sound like the pussy was out. KC won the SB, damn. Welcome back, pre-gems. Alright, let's... 
Let's start by doing the fuse and tangle now. I think we should still be able to fuse stuff. Steering stick, shield. Yep, we're good. Okay. We put this right here. And now we only struggle with weapons. We can't switch shields. Yeah, we can't we can't switch wheel shields and we can't juggle shields because we juggle shields, then that steering stick is connected to Link. And if the steering stick's connected to Link, then it won't clip. I don't know why that works like that, but that's just how it is. Okay. So now we have to do the SLD. So pause. Drop this. Equip this. Pause buffer. Drop this. Okay, now we're going to our clean save. Now we're going to our clean save. All right. Prages in chat, please. Can we get some prages? Okay. I need to be very, very careful. Don't hit B too early. Don't hit it too late. The problem is you clip very quickly. So I have very few, t very little time to do it. It's also not a good thing that Link has his body right now. But we'll see how this goes. We have to hope that it clips. There's a chance that we don't even clip when we get on the swing stick. Yo, thanks for the follow, demons. Okay. Dang it. Okay. Let's try reloading the save real quick. There's a chance that when you reload saves, Link gets desynced even more, which is what we want. But it's unlikely. Wait, he got his full body back? Well, now it's definitely not gonna work, but how did that, how did that happen? Oh, and also reloading saves wouldn't help because it's SLD, it's not as lauded. Oh, it didn't work because all the shields were on the ground, not on my back. So I wasn't actually that juggle overloaded. I'm so confused by this whole glitch. It's so awfully confusing. Okay, but we did it once, so I know it's possible. Oh, Todd, beautiful torch, I offer my guidance to thee. Help our hearts to clip and be free. <laughs> you guide the way with our sparkling light, keeping us warm in the dead of night. That's a good one. What's up, Ramen? Thanks, Redman, I appreciate that. Okay, never mind. Why am I... I don't understand why I would be desynced when I load this save, but not the other one. Like, if I spawn a steering stick, I'm not gonna clip, right? No. I don't know, dude. I don't know. This is also a stupid spot for the save to be. When the wind howls fierce and the storms draw near, Todd's flame burns steady, vanishing fear. In the darkest of nights, he's become bright, guiding us home with his radiant light. Damn! Damn! I like these. I love to see the Todd love. Okay. Let's drop that. Holy guacamole. This is the easy way out. Actually, I don't know why I dropped that. I gotta stop juggle drop juggling and stuff before I think of what I'm supposed to do. Because now I have to juggle again. Okay. I want to juggle shields? Does it matter? I don't think so.
I almost want to go back and look at the clip of me doing it, because I did it right. I got it to work without juggling again. Let's see how overloaded we are at this point. I'm off to bed. See you in the next one. Bye-bye, Swinny. Thanks for tuning in. This glitch makes no sense. Yeah, it really doesn't. Zuggling's weird. SLD is weird. Okay, we're not even that overloaded. So I guess I should overload more, because I want Link to be decent. I want Link's hair to be missing and stuff. Also, by the way, when I get this statue, I'm gonna call the stream then. And I'll probably find another time this week to finish off this challenge. Because, like, it's going to be like the other one where the ending is going to make up probably like 75% of it. Like, I might have to do like two streams just on the ending. Because it's brutal. It's brutal. At least we're not losing our saves. I'm a game developer myself, and I've been always amazed at how Nintendo manages to make games with these stupid glitches. It's kind of perfect, though. Like, I love the glitches in this game. The glitches in this game make this game a lot more interesting Mind and fun. Mind finishing with my peaceful game. Talk to anyone that knows the glitches in this game, and they love the glitches. Like, fuse entangling is such a cool thing. Like, it almost deserves to be in the game for how cool it is. In fact, I would not blame you if you think it is, if it does deserve to be in the game. Okay, steering stick. Please work. Okay, nice. Okay, I'm gonna try to zuggle as much as I can. We want to zuggle so much that when we load that save, he's still overloaded enough to clip. I guess if I'm zuggling past the point where the weapons are falling on the floor, then it doesn't matter. Because I don't think it's actually zuggling, is it? Anyway, I'll do one more. This is the last one. Let's try it now. Oh wait, before I try it, I need to do the SLD. Okay, so... Drop, equip, pause buffer, drop, load. Not this save. This save. Prage! Or I'll, I'll have to do that in our stream, or I'll do that on like a Twitch stream or something, I'm sorry. Oh, we have our belly. I don't like when we have our belly. I feel like if Link has his body, he's never gonna clip. I could be wrong. Hmm. I really don't wanna do a dungeon, guys. <laughs> Doing a dungeon with no, no nothing. I need to go, I'm gonna go back to my stream and watch what I did before. Cause I swear that the time that it worked, I didn't have all these shields here. I feel like because these shields aren't zuggled on my back, that's part of the problem. Let me see exactly what I did. Hmm. Do, 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 do. 
Do, do, do. It's crazy I got it to work. I honestly did not expect it to even work. Because I've never gotten an SLD clip to work like that. Okay, here, I'm gonna show you guys my screen so we can watch it together. And we'll kind of just like look through what I did. Let's, okay, let's try it. turn that off and do this. Moai, Moai, Moai. Oh yeah, this was the one that worked. This was the one that worked. Okay, there we go. We can test this. Yo, what's up, Mr. Manga? Maybe it was Mr. Manga. Maybe he was like the what made it all work. Hold on, let's listen to this. 1.2.1. I've been working on a fuse entanglement. So where are the shields at? That's my biggest question. Is on the one that attempt on that one attempt that worked? I mean 1.0. What's up, what's up, Iraq? Alright. But like, and see if we can click move it. We're gonna dirty save. But like, if this worked, this is a proof. Yeah, the shields the aren't there. So why are the shields on the floor now? We're gonna just place a steering stick here. Oh, but I didn't SLD that time. That's why. Because I never SLD'd. That's why the shields aren't there. Wait, then this might not work, guys, because I need to zuggle overload enough to clip, but I need to drop the shields, which unzuggles all my shields. What if I use, what if I zuggle bows? Wait, what if I zuggle bows? That might work. That's an interesting idea, actually. I could SLD with the shields and just not zuggle any shields, and then try to zuggle overload with bows. Let's try that. Let's give that a shot. Let me put my window. Um, switch display. Okay. Going back here. I'm not going to stop writing Todd poems, guys. Hey, don't stop. No need Can't to. Can't see screen. Yeah, sorry about that. It's, it's good now. The depths of despair. We need not wear armor or weapons to spare our poor hair from the zuggle overloading. Guys, can I just... You guys want to see something horrifying? Do you guys want to see something absolutely horrifying? Look, I'm gonna- I'm gonna explain it in another stream too. But let me pull it up real quick. Hold on. It's scary. It is... It's the plan to kill Gandorf with nothing. Let me pull it up. It's a Google Doc. Some people on the Discord server have already seen this, by the way. Shout out to the Discord fellows. If you want to join, it's pinned. It's in the description as well. Okay. <laughs> Plan to defeat Ganondorf. Hold on, I know you guys can't see the top. Whoops. Wait, how can I? Let me do this. Whatever, I'm just gonna do this. That's fine. Step one, don't. This Step two. This is how I found her last name and LinkedIn. <laughs> this is our plan. We get a lot of big orange swords. I'm probably saying that wrong, but this is the sword that has the most damage to durability ratio. So it does the most damage over the span of its entire lifetime. Like, it's got good durability, and it's got good damage. So we're gonna get a lot of big orange swords on the alt save, obviously. We also need wooden sticks. You'll see why later. We obviously make a, a manual save at the top of army. Then we have to fuse and tangle the six big orange swords. I'll kind of, like, skim through most of this. The whole idea behind most of this 
part with the Bighorn Swords is that we're going to have six Bighorn Swords that are like zuggled in Link's hand with their hitbox activated, which means every time we like walk into an enemy, it will actually like stab them and deal damage. And it does good damage because, you know, when you throw a weapon, it's that hitbox. So it's not just like the regular attack. It's a full on like throwing a weapon damage. So it's good. And if we have six of those, it's very good. So it's, it sounds like good news so far. Uh, don't worry about this. I'll come back to this Fuse and Tangle stuff later. Um, all of this is still part of the, like, um, most of this is part of the sword stuff. Setting up the sword stuff, setting up the sword stuff. Clipping through Bashra's store. So we need a, this is in, in the dirty save. We need to get through. And we need a Fuse and Tangle, a steering stick, which is, um, this is with, this is for the SLD. Because after we beat army, we needed to clip through the boss restore with the SLD, which is like what I'm trying to do right now, where I have a steering stick in our in our clean save that we can clip through. Which means we also need to be Zuggle overloaded when we go into that clean save. Uh, and the reason we have the wooden sticks Zuggled is because once we get through the army door, which is like very, very hard, we will need to unzuggle, and there's no way we can drop any of our items. So in order to drop our stuff, we're gonna have to slot a flame emitter, like in the hallway to Ganondorf, and then have like our weapon turn that on, and burn the sticks. If it burns like a lot of our zuggled sticks, it'll unzuggle us a little bit. It'll un overload us. Uh, and then also, we can't use the big orange swords in army. But they're so good. Why can't I use the big orange swords in army? Well, I can. It's just that they don't have enough durability to get me through army. In fact, they run out of durability before I even beat Bacoblin phase. That's bad. And I need to defeat Ganondorf with that. So, I need to beat army with a flame emitter gassed onto a wooden stick. The reason it's on a wooden stick is also because when I get past army, I would need to burn the wooden stick to, like, get rid of the flame. Because flame doesn't do anything with Ganondorf. And it's going to, like ruin my vision so that's that's the long and short of it there's a lot in here that just kind of like flies over most heads but you know what that's that's kind of the gist of the plan is to use a gassed flame emitter to kill army then be overloaded oh yeah i didn't explain this thing um the reason we're like building this this is a hover bike the steering stick and the two fans is because if we go to where we need to clip, which is on the gloom wall, the gloom wall is like angled like this and we clip straight down to where the Ganon hallway is. Uh, to get up there, it's full of gloom. That whole wall, you take damage when you go on it and we only have three hearts. So the whole time that we're running up that wall, we're just going to be dying. <laughs> so we need to like use a hover bike to get up to where that, uh, clipping spot is and then clip through and then uh yeah like the the big painful part of it is that we have to kill army with a flame emitter and nothing else and if we die then the sld has gone and the whole run is is dead <laughs> yeah so it has to be first try <laughs> it has to be it has to be first try and Ganon also has to be first try because we, like I said, we only have durability on the swords. So it, it requires a few miracles. But, like, theoretically, this plan is, like, possible if everything went perfectly. But obviously, with the plans like this, with this many steps, uh, there's so many room for mistakes to happen and errors. I will say, though, Tune in on that stream, because if we even get halfway close, even if we just get past the army door, it will be insane. What I'm trying to do right now is just the SLD portion, like just clipping out of bounds with the steering stick. This is like just one of like the 30 steps on that list. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Okay, what, what was I doing? Um, let's check our saves real quick, make sure we're not... Okay, we're fine. So our shields are not zuggled, right? No, cool. Yep, 
Yeah, I was gonna try to do it with bows, wasn't I? That's my plan. Did you mean to keep the timer running while you go over the dock? Nah, it doesn't really matter. It's like, what, five minutes that I talked for? Try. Try juggling with the bows. I think we should get like very desynced off this. But I'm scared that we won't be able to do the fusion tangle on the on the shearing stick. Let's try this, let's try this. This will be interesting. Did you mean, oh, I read that. Nothing is needed but Todd the Great Torch, the flame of hope and courage. He does scorch his light guiding us through the darkest. Yo, thank you for the sub. I really appreciate that. You don't have to sub, but thank you. That's awfully nice of you. Okay, it looks like Link's bald. Which is good. We want him to be bald, because that means more desync. Yo, your new vid popped up in my recommended. It was superb. It's amazing stuff. Looking for the next video. Thank you, High Waters. I appreciate that, man. It means a lot. Okay. We're going to pop a steering stick. I, I love seeing all the new people in, in here today on the stream. Really, really nice to see you guys here. And I hope you enjoy the streams. Okay. Let's... Fuse and tangle? That's not gonna work. Okay, fuse and tangle that. Yes. Okay, now we're just gonna zuggle a lot with our weapons and bows. If this doesn't work, then I'm pretty sure that my plan for army also won't work. This is like pretty sad to say. But if this doesn't work, then I don't think it will work. Because I don't think there's a way to SLD without unzuggling our shields. So we have to pray that being overloaded with our weapons and our bows is enough. Because if it's not, it's just. We'll have to at least use an key at them, which is fine. Um, I don't even know if we would be able to do it with just one more key at them. What key item would I even want to pick up or use? A sage would help with army. But it, no, I would need something to clip through the boss restore. I, I guess auto build. Beating the game with only auto build would be a cool title. I will say. How I beat Tears of the Kingdom would just auto build. Okay, I think we should be good so now sld drop equip drop okay no not the save not the save all right we have to prage like this is like really really prage because if this if this one attempt doesn't work this means very 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 bad things i mean maybe not the worst things but it just means Damn, I still have... Why are my bows not on me? That's weird. I thought I said my bows. And if this attempt doesn't work, it probably means we can't do it with our current amount of key items used. Oh, let's try it. I'm a little, like, weirded out by the fact that my bows didn't zuggle. Let's try reloading once. What's a watch streak? I'm not sure. Let's 
Like, if you juggle bows, I thought they're supposed to appear in your hands. Huh? Let me just, like, double check that, though. Because maybe I didn't juggle the bows properly. If I didn't juggle the bows properly, then that doesn't really matter. Yo, I just stumbled on your channel and it, uh, and watched your newest video all the way through. It genuinely was amazing video. Keep up the great work. Dude, thank you. You guys are so, honestly, so genuinely nice. I was feeling so rough yesterday, actually, because my video is not doing so well. And I'm very happy that the algorithm picked it up a little bit. So I thought the video just completely flopped. It got like 300 views in the first day. What's I was like, damn. And it was just going down. It just kept going down and down and down. The impressions were getting so low. I was like, man, that sucks. Because I knew I had a really like cool idea with the shrine video. And I, I'm so excited for the shrine video. It has 24. Because I know if you guys, if you guys love that video, you're going to love the shrine video. Wait. Because the shrine video is crazy, man. The shrine video is actually wild. The things that happen and the solutions that we came up with. Because in shrines, you don't have sages, you don't have auto build. Like, all the really useful things that we were able to use, we can't slot in shrines. There's like all these, like, actually, we can slot in shrines with Zona Swords, but we didn't actually do any of that. Because I didn't know about that then. Yeah, see, now I have a bow zuggled. Why did it not work before? Okay, guys, I think that last attempt was actually fake. I lied. It's not Jover Jover just yet. It was so good yet. that I watched every stream and watched the videos, and I plan to watch the shrine vid as well. Hey. Yeah, I'm excited for it. And I hope I make this a video. I think this has been a pretty fun stream to make into a video so far. But we'll have to see how the ending goes. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't beat me down to a pulp like the last challenge. Can't use fuse in this cone. Okay, so we have to unzuggle and drop everything. Oh my god. Talk about zuggling. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. And that wasn't enough to clip us through the game. Like, having all these weapons still wasn't enough to clip. That's crazy. That's crazy. We had so much, and it still didn't clip? Are you kidding me? Uh, load back to save. So, the kind of weird thing about this whole glitch- If you glitch, can't win for any reason, just show a clip of you crying and leave us all confused. I mean, we are gonna try to do this challenge. If I can't do it with the current amount, then I'm more than happy to get auto build and use auto build. Because auto build would solve this SLD problem. Auto build allows us to do auto build canceling. We do have to activate the ability. But we'd only have to activate the ability once to get through the boss rush wall. I think I would only want my only allow myself to use auto build once. So that I could say only like used it once, you know? Instead of like, oh, we used auto build canceling like 50 times like in the other video. Okay. I'm gonna go crazy with the Zuggles. I'm gonna go crazy. Need to use Ultra Hand. I really want to get to the statue. <laughs> if you can't tell, because doing army hitless sounds awful. Yo, Timber. What's up? Am I trying the stick clip? Yep. Yeah, Timber, do you have advice for me, bro? Have you ever been able to clip out of bounds with an SLD clip? through saves because I'm starting to realize or starting to have some problems I guess my problem is that when I zuggle the shields and I do the SLD I drop all the zuggled shields so I'm trying to do with bows and weapons now to see if that's gonna be good also from what I understand um people say you want to you want to have Link, like, super desynced before you load the save, right? You want to have, like, Link not have his body parts. I don't know if you can, like, confirm or deny that, but from what I've heard, 
you want him to be like missing his hair, missing his body, and that gives you like the best chance of clipping. Okay, I might have done it too much. So I'm gonna load the save now. Oh, you know what? The save is actually way closer. We don't have to ascend anymore. You can't juggle clip on his lauded stick. I'm not slotting it. I'm SLDing it. I'm aware that you can't clip with his lauded one. And that's hell, because it means with the with the with the SLD thing, as soon as you die, that stick's gone. Because it's just a normal stick. It's not like connected to Link. Ooh, it stinks. Okay. So steering stick. Fuse entangle. Timber will fix all the problems. Alright. And now we're just gonna keep zuggling as much as we can. Also, once weapons start dropping on the ground, does that mean like zuggling past that is useless? You might be able to SLD the sealed. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. What's up, Kyle? If you glue the sealed to the stick in the new file... Like in the alt save? Okay, let's hope that this actually zuggles this time. I think I'm doing it right. Let me try putting it away. Okay, yeah, it is a attached to his hand. Okay, so we're definitely zuggling the bows now. I'm gonna keep doing this until they start falling on the ground. I think they are. I'll, I'll do it a few more times. I don't know. I guess technically it could be a little bit more desynced because he still has his hair and his hat. All right, let's let's try this. So drop, equip, pause buffer, drop, prage. How will I be Ganondorf? Man, it's it's a long process. I'm not gonna do it this stream, but. I'll say tune into next stream if you want to if you want to see how. It's not like a guaranteed foolproof plan or anything. Okay, we do have the bows. It's gonna be really tricky to kill Ganondorf. Cause with the current setup I have, I have one shot to kill Ganondorf pretty much. If I die, it's over. Okay, let's prage. No. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna work, guys. I don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> let's see how many. S Actually, we. Let's load back the save and see if he gets desynced at all anymore. You've been doing this for one hour? Bro, that's the grind! That's the grind set. Hopefully, it doesn't take forever to knock out Gan this time. Oh, dude, it probably will. <laughs> You were SLDing the stick is the same as lotting, unfortunately. Wait, really? Why? Why? But I've clipped. It worked. I've clipped before. Oh wait, no, no, no. That was not. Wait, SLDing the stick doesn't let you clip. Is that for a sure for sure? Is that for sure for sure? Because I'm thinking I'm I'm running out of Todd poems. Oh no. Oh no. Glue the shield to it. Does that make a difference? Wait. Wait, so no matter what, there's no way to get a save. Yo, thank you for the resub. Bird. Half a year on Git went to quick. I appreciate that, bird. Thank you so much. So Timber, are you saying there's no way I can transfer a steering stick through saves and then clip with it? That doesn't mean it's over over. At least for this, 
because I can pick up a steering stick. A steering stick is like one of the only things in this game that I can actually pick up and move around. So I could, theoretically, find a steering stick in the overworld somewhere, pick it up and carry it all the way over here while I'm Zoggle overloaded on the clean save and then just clip with it there. That like kinda would work, right Timber? Please give up. Damn, Vaincrafts. Why, why are you out here telling me to give up, bro? We're trying our best. That's well, that's all we can do, is try our best. Todd's steady flame of is guide our guiding light through valleys and mountains, forests and streams. He lights our path. That's a sweet one. I wish I had Todd right now. Where's the closest steering stick? That's a great question. I don't know. I'll have to look at the object map. Timber, you're saying do the same thing, but just try gluing the shield to the stick? That's the only difference. There's a steering stick in Terrytown? Bro, I'm not going all the way to Terrytown. I'm not walking from Terrytown to here. That's brutal. There's a stick pretty close, too. Wait, Timber, do you know if the, the method would work? If I did the... The steering stick glued to the shield? Like, why, why does it change? Why does it make a difference? Okay, I need to uncycle. Wait, I only zuggled two bows? Huh? So confused. So confused. Why are my bows never zuggling? I was like so positive I did it. Resyncs the shield and stick. Would that work? Here's what the glitch spreadsheet says on clipping. Stick desync clip SDC by dropping a shield just before mounting a steering stick that is fuse entangled to it. We can clip through floors easily. Step on the steering stick, drop the shield. The steering stick is fuse entangled to, okay. Hmm. It's okay, prisms. <laughs> the world will survive. Alright, I'm gonna try just gluing this shield to it. I don't know if that would actually make any difference. I don't see why it would, but we'll try it. I'm desperate. I'm a little desperate at this point. Because if this doesn't work, then army definitely won't work. But I could have sworn that it's possible to SLD and immediately clip. I wonder why the bows aren't zuggling. That's like the most confusing thing to me. Savage Lionel bow, let's try doing duplex bow. Super, they need a dungeon? I know, I know. Wait. Guys, isn't there another way in? Guys, isn't there another way into that horn statue area? From the other side? Like, can't you get in from the castle side? Isn't there like a secret entrance? I swear there's like a back, a back entrance. I can go through the caves? Then why are we doing this? <laughs> we should go through the caves. Oh shit, that fixes everything. 
Wait, where, where though? Where's the caves? I don't know where Sui now are. say it back. Sui? <laughs> did we just waste our time? No, I don't think we did waste our time. The reason we didn't waste our time is because that was my plan to clip through the boss restore. And if that doesn't work, then we know for sure that my current setup for army is not going to is not going to work. Listen to your chat next time. Oh, we're still super zuggled. Look, I know what it looks like, but this is our clean save. <laughs> You see how clean the save is, guys? It's very clean. This is like old equipment, but we can't actually use it. Isn't that beautiful, though? Just how many rockets, dude? One, two, three, four, five. The quintuple rocket. This is a really off-topic question, but what is your favorite Zelda game? That's not off-topic. Off we're playing Zelda. Tears. I know it's a generic, kind of like, what I'm playing answer, but, you know. Straight up, I just like Tears. I've only really played and dedicated a lot of time to Tears and Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild was my old favorite game. But yeah, Tears, I think, is a little bit, of, a little bit better. It's also my favorite game, like, period. It's just my favorite game, not just my favorite Zelda game. Is this challenge going to be a video? Probably. Yeah, I think so. If I were a betting man, I would say it would probably be a video. I think we might need to use auto build. I think we might need to pick up auto build. Same me. E. But auto build would basically be the only rune or like ability that we're actually having to use. So I feel like I could go out and title it like I beat Tears of the Kingdom with just auto build. Maybe. I don't know. That's a long ways away. Also, beating the game with just auto build would still be significantly challenging. It would solve one problem, but there's still like the problem of beating Gandorf with only one shot and beating Army with only the flame emitter. That just solves the SLD problem. Do you guys know where the entrance is? Because I'm kind of just walking around me, blind. Fuck. <laughs> I'm not going to put that in the vid, then. Please, please keep some of the Todd poetry. Oh, yeah, for sure. We'll have to keep some Todd poetry. You're not permitted in there? Oh, my gosh. Why? Why? Why am I not permitted? Is it down there? No, that's a Korok. Let me grab something real quick. I'm just gonna grab a snack. A little snacky. BRB. Actually, let me put on some music for you guys real quick. You wanna listen to this? What is this? Some classic Wii. All right, I'll be back. One second.
Timothy the chair. Are we naming the chair now? Oh, we're about to hit five hours, boys. The other entrance is in the, in the observation room. The other entrance is in the observation room? Observation room. That's... How the mic? Howard the mic. <laughs> we just name everything. Timothy it requires chair. Ultra Hand to open. No, this is the gatehouse. Okay, I'm gonna. Let me go on my alt save and look around there, because it'll be way faster to look around in my alt save than in my clean save. You could try clipping in behind the guy that doesn't let you pass. Is that like the closest way? Or the fastest way? You know what I could do, guys? I could go on Yuzu and use Ultra Cam to find like the fastest path. But we can't clip. The only way that we can clip is by carrying a steering stick from like really far away. And it's also not consistent. So even if, even if we got the clip, it's likely it doesn't work because it's a very hard room to get into. Like you fall very fast when you're clipping if you don't hit B at the right time. You'll either clip into the ceiling of the room or the floor of the room, and you won't be able to get out. It might not work. Oh, it's got this theme? It's got the- mo hold on, hold on. I'm gonna turn this up. It's got the Bablane theme? Oh my god. I forgot how much I missed the Blaine theme. So this is the dirty save, by the way, guys. If you're ever like, hmm, I wonder if he's on the dirty save. Uh, I would say the easiest way to check is if if top left has a shit ton of hearts, it's dirty. It's very dirty. Okay, I don't know where I'm going, guys. Let me open Yuzu real quick. If you don't know what Yuzu is, it's an emulator. So we're gonna find it on the emulator. Because there's a, there's a mod called Ultra Cam. It's very cool. You're gonna like this. You can basically like clip through any wall, anywhere. Whoa, what is that? Oh, that's Yuzu. We'll do one of these. You gonna find a girlfriend? Bro, one day. One day. Okay, continue, emergency shelter, oh, this is perfect. This saves exactly where I, would, where I want it to be. Oh gosh, I apologize that the stream looks very janky right now. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. There we go. Alright, uh, this is Ultra Cam, fellas. Okay. 
so we're like in a camera state where we can move around anywhere. This is how I got a lot, of, a lot of the drone shots. For anyone curious, how I get some of that cool drone footage in my in my videos. It's a mod. So that's where we need to get to. This is the backup entrance, the like the the secondary route goes through this cave. I guess looking at it through underneath would be best. So that's a dead end. Let's see. I, yeah, this is also a dead end. There's no way to get into there. Hmm. Damn, so this cave goes deep. I, there's not really any like entrances over here. So. I guess, hmm. Where did, where's the entrance at? <laughs> is this an entrance? I think this is an entrance, but it's not even loaded in. I need to like go in the cave so that it loads this part of the map. There's gotta be a way to get in here without talking to an NPC, right? I think so. What's up, Fairlord? Is this Bed War? I don't know. I, if you're talking about the song, I don't know. This cave goes crazy deep. Okay, does it render any more now? Oh yeah, it renders a lot more. So now we can see the bosses in here. We gotta keep going. Honestly, let's go here. I think if we start from the castle side, it'll be a little easier. What am I eating? It's a kind bar. It's one of the chocolate sea salt kind bars. They're pretty good. There you go. It. It's my dinner. <laughs> I skipped dinner. I'm going to ask ChatGPT to make a Todd poem. We should have like a Todd poem like challenge between you guys. See who can make the best Todd poem. I'll be the judge. But I don't want anyone getting offended. If I rate your poem badly or whatever. I'm just gonna take my honest best choice and put it out there on the line. Okay. Surely we can see more of the cave from here, right? Oh, cave. Where does the cave start? <laughs> I thought this would make it easier. I swear it's like, Maybe I should just go through the cave and like actually walk it. It's like everything's a dead end. I don't even know which cave, there's so many. Hmm. Somebody said observation room, right? What is the observation room? Rita's, I bet you got so many girlfriends. If you sew one on stream, you'll lose them all, right, man? Yeah, dude, yeah. <laughs> Bro, you know what you're talking about. But, like, keep it on the DL, please. Can't be, can't be having them to know. Like, if one of them's on the stream right now, dude, you're just outing me. Todd fanfic with Timothy? Hey, yo, what? <laughs> Can we not have the Todd fanfics? Todd's an innocent torch, guys. He's a friendly little innocent torch. He's got nothing wrong with him. He's just hanging in there. He's just, he's living life.
All right, I'm gonna bite the bullet. I'm biting the bullet. I'm going back to look at landing. I'm just gonna walk the course. I'm gonna get the feel of the lay of the land. Hmm. How are you still here? It's been seven hours. I feel like it'd be a it'd be a conclusive ending if we end with getting rid of the heart. So I want to try to end with getting the heart, but I'm gonna call it at like let's say 12:45, which is in uh like 40 minutes basically. If I don't get the heart container in the next 40 minutes, I'll end stream. So if you if you're sitting there and you're expecting me to beat the game tonight, that's not gonna happen. This is gonna be a multi-stream thing. So if you enjoy the stream, you know, follow the Twitch or turn on notifications and you won't miss the other ones. I haven't decided which day I'm going to continue this challenge on, but I want to say Tuesday I'm going to be kind of busy. I think Thursday would be best. I think Thursday would be an ideal day to continue this on. Or the weekend. But I really hope we can get rid of this heart. I'm also gonna be so mad if I can't go to the heart because the heart's like, gives me another item or something. I need 400 points the dude can eat. Dude, I, it's, it's fine, bro. I got food. But you're very sweet. Also, I gotta read some of these, uh, these poems. Let me do first. Also, I have, I have infinite stamina on Yuzu. It's just mods. This is, like, super modded. But obviously, this is not the Switch. So here's to Todd, the torch so true. In the heart of adventure, he helped see it through. With burritos at the helm, they conquered the strife in the world of Zelda, re -re rewriting gaming life. Gaming's life. That's gotta be Chad GBT. That's gotta be. You did not write that. They're like, I know Chad GBT, when you ask it to write poems, it always makes them so rhymey. It makes it so like wholeheartedly and rhymey. That's gotta be Chad GBT. If I'm putting money on it, that's Chad GBT. Okay. Subscribe after the latest episode, enjoying the content. Thank you so much, Kristoff. I really appreciate that. I'm glad you're enjoying the content. Guys, I made a Todd poem. Having no sin, Toddy is holy. Don't ruin it. We gotta see it. This is a Todd poem by Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Every time I think of Todd, I feel cool, man. That's it? That's... <laughs> At least it's Morgan Freeman. That adds a lot. That adds a lot of character. I will say nobody else has used TTS to make a Todd poem. So, you got that. Is that a dead end? Where is the non-dead end? Oh, up here. Where am I? Wait, so I need to go... I'm there. I need to go... Up. Damn, I am super lost in here. Okay, I need to go up there. So... Alright, I'm just gonna follow the path to the left. Is this the right way? No, I walked the wrong way. Okay, just go up. Just go up in the previous room. Just go up in the previous room. Just go up. 
This is gonna be confusing to navigate in the clean when we don't have the camera to get around. I did not realize that it's like an actual maze to get there. Wait, guys, I think we actually found an exit. Maybe? We're also gonna need a lot, a lot of time bombs to get through all these rocks. Oh! Oh, I know exactly where this is. Oh, it's here? Oh my god, that's so simple. Oh, we can get in that. Oh, but we can't use Ultra Hand to open the, the little gate thingy. Hmm. There's gotta be another way. There's got to be another way. Legends once said there is gonna be three heroes. Todd the Torch loved by Burritos fans, Timothy the Great Chair and the Mic. Wait, how are we gonna get in here? The Great Chair and the Mic. There's gonna be three heroes. Todd the Torch loved by Burritos fans, Timothy the Great Chair and the Mic. Bro, what about me? <laughs> Where do I fit in the equation? Uh, so is there no other entrance? Wait, so I believe this is, is this a dead end? No, this can't be a dead end because there's like an opening. So that might be an entrance. Is this a dead end? Okay, this is a proper dead end. Yikes, okay. So let's let's go through here and figure out if that's a dead end. I once got deja vu of this, I swear. Is this the right one? No, one more up. Did I just get knocked down to the bottom? Bro knocked me, I think. Dang, it's so unfortunate that to get into this little area, you need to like ultra hand something up. Guys, we need like brain power on this. There's gotta be a way to open that gate without clipping through it. Like I'm sure if you could have a fan on next to it or something. Wait, what? Oh my god, that took forever to render. What the heck? Oh no. Wait, no. It is a dead end? Oh, it's not a dead end, but it's just another one of these. See, this is our problem, guys. I'm gonna turn the music off. So, like, to get in there, I need to use Ultra Hand to open this thing. What if I like had a bomb at it? Like if I dropped a bomb on it or something? Does it like bounce up? Oh my gosh. <laughs> no. What about from underneath though? Because I might be able to build a contraption that like has a fan blowing a bomb. I don't know, man. I don't know. Link, recall lock, something holding it up. That's a good idea. That's a really good idea. Yeah, the bomb thing doesn't seem to work. Okay, but I like the recall locking idea. I can't test that on this playthrough though, uh, on Yuzu. Let's go back to the clean. I'm gonna close Yuzu. Let's go back to the switch. Okay. Where was I? Oh, sweet. Is this our dirty save? This is our dirty save. Let's go to our clean. 
This is our clean, I think. Actually, let's drop all of our stuff. First gatehouse. I think this is our clean. Banger Vedia, can I beat Tears of the Kingdom with only Todd? Someone said that earlier, and it's not possible. Because Ganon doesn't take fire damage. But if I don't juggle the torch, then I could attack with it. So it's like, maybe possible. It might be a fun idea. It is a fun idea. It might be possible, is what I should say. We, we would have to find some glitches to make Todd really overpowered. Alright, let's jump over here. Oh my gosh, we're gaming. We're gaming. I put a phony poem in Discord. Okay, I'll check all the poems in Discord. I haven't looked in the Discord in a hot minute. I bet it's been steamy in there. Wii music goes hard. Yeah, I'll put it back on. I'm sorry. It's going back in. Okay. Wait, where's the first gatehouse? Oh, it's over this way. I see it. All right, so we're gonna go here and we're gonna try to recall lock an object in the spot that would hold that that little gate open. Recall locking is like if you fuse entangle something and then you recall it and then load a save. It like won't move. Give it a mega attack boost and durability transfer with glitches. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Because the durability of the torch is actually really bad. The only reason it doesn't break for us is because... Bruh. Is because we we don't attack with it, you know? It's, it's juggled to our hand, and since we don't have any other weapons to attack with, we just never have any chance to break it. So what does actually break it, though, is when we, like, go into our alt save and do other things. The only other thing that can break it is a uh, burn. If you go in like a lava area, it could catch on fire and burn. Like obviously normally it's meant to catch on fire, but if you go in like a very, very, very hot area, like the fire temple, if you go back and watch any of the clips of me doing fire temple, I will never have the torch in my hand. Cause it's so hot, even the torch won't survive down there. Sag. I don't have Discord, but I put my entry above. Okay, well, let me look at it. What's up, Luigi Star? What am I doing? I'm trying to beat the game with as few key items and as few items as possible. So, so far, we've never used a key item or a normal item. What do the ChatGPT question suggestions make up a five cent story about Sharky? Didn't we already do no weapons? This is no key items as well. From another save, Todd the Torch was gave, his presence saving the clean save. With his warm glow creating light, he is the true one who dispelled Ganon's blight. Todd the Torch, need I say more? That's good. I might still like the other one more though. I was talking about a Todd poem for about 30 minutes. It was about him having more wisdom, courage, and power than Nehru, Feror, and Din. Wait, so what is this exactly like? Is it Tears of the Kingdom, but it's modded? No, this is not modded. Okay, I'm going to do the recall lock. This is normal tears, guys. All right, let's see. Did we get an autosave? Okay, we did. That's good. Okay, so this is a dirty save. This is not a dirty save. Let's go back to this save. So just to kind of re-explain the rules real quick, which let me off. 
So I beat the game in my last video using only key items. So key items include things like runes, sages, puripad, um, other useless bullshit. But I wanted to see how far can we push that limit. And like, quite frankly, there's only one real place left to go, which is, hey, let's see what can we do with like actually nothing, you know? And at first, when I was looking into it, I was like, no, this is impossible. Like, this is a stupid video. But I learned so much after doing, I'm not going to say all the shrines, but I did a lot of the shrines with only key items. I learned a lot of things. And there's been a lot of discoveries that have been very, very helpful that have made me want to try this challenge, which is we're still picking up a few key items, but we're not able to use them. That's the whole goal. Now, so far, we have turned in our spirit orbs. Because that's like a forced thing to get off the Great Sky Island, unless you do GSI skip. Which I've already talked about several times. But... That's the only thing we've done, is trade in our spirit orbs. Everything else we haven't used any runes. We haven't used any abilities, any items, any weapons, any bows, any shields, any zone devices. It's been a clean save. Which is pretty cool. Because back when I did the only key items run, like so many things felt barely possible and like little miracles. Like the fact that we had three boulders in the fuse shrine. Like we didn't we weren't able to able able to use Ultra Hand in that fuse shrine. So we had to come up with another solution to fix it. Which was also like really cool. We had like a permanent like cannon on our back. Anyway, let's try this uh recall lock method. So we're gonna drop let's do it with I guess a hover stone would be a good one, right? Cause it's big. So Recall lock holds things in place through saves. So we're gonna, I guess we have to juggle the shield. I mean, the thing is, when I load the save, it's not going to be on the floor over there. So doing this wouldn't actually help. I think I need to do it like halfway in, halfway out. Like this, maybe. Maybe like wedged. Let's try that. Let's try that. All right, this has to work. I hope it does. I don't know what else we could do. Who named Todd? That's a great question. Who did name Todd? I don't remember. I think it might've been Zuzel. Correct me if I'm wrong. Pray. Oh, <gasps> it was open for a second. It was a hundred percent open for a second and it's moved. You see that? You see that? It's bent downwards. Okay. Now it's bent in the wrong direction, so we're not able to get in. But this is promising. This is very promising. So instead of tilting it like this, I should tilt it like this, I, I think. Wing? Maybe. Maybe wing would be better. I think we could make this work with the hoverstone, though. Yeah, look at this. This is what happens when you recall lock something. It just, it will not move. So, if I unequip... Use actually, a stake. If I just fuse... A stake? That's an interesting idea. A stake. And then what would I... Stake with it, though? Like... I mean, I, I guess I would angle it out. I don't know. Let me try this. Let me see what happens when we just do this. 
because it's like mostly under but a little bit over so i might push it up i don't think it'll push it down because there's so much like more hoverstone beneath it it's gonna push it up a little bit so maybe we can crouch under this my sound was muted what did you tell me oh <gasps> let's go it worked yes this is our clean save we got through arachnid well dubs and chat for arachnid w's 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 w arachnid right now that's all you dude i don't think i would have thought of that at least for a while i'm like i don't recall stuff ever ever recall lock that's such a glitch i just don't use but that's like such a a good instance to use a recall lock <sighs> okay we saved it i don't want to die oh wait i used my heart I gotta remember, I cannot use my heart. If I take a hit right now, since I have four hearts, I'm using a key item. As stupid as that is, I'm using a key item if I if I get hit. Thanks for the reminder, Spygirl. I appreciate that. What did I tell you? Oh, I was asking, were you the one that named Todd? Why did it... Why is the Hoverstone gone now? That's weird. Uh, let's try it again. Same, same strap. Drop it right now. Recall it. Doo -doo -doo -doo. You out of breath, dude? Am I out of breath? Am I panting? I do this sometimes. People always say I'm a loud breather. It's a terrible curse to have. I guess I should just move the mic away so you guys don't have to listen to me existing. Okay. Is that open enough? I think we can crouch that. Yeah, we're good. All right, let's not get hit. No hit, no hit, no hit. Cannot get hit, cannot get hit. Oh, it's a little scary. <laughs> Doing no hits a little terrifying. Okay. I guess we need to slot some stuff over here too to break this wall. Oh no. I'm not, I don't have an autosave here. I want to get an autosave really bad. I want, wait, if I read this, will it give me an autosave? Deep beneath this land, our mighty knight, our mighty first ruler imprisoned the demon king. To ensure the king's magic would hold, we erected a castle here to protect the sacred site. Without the castle in place, the site may be disturbed, allowing the Demon King's hatred. Since when has this been there? Save, please save. That's a bit unfortunate. How can I force the game to save down here? I really can't. Okay, let's load back. I need a lot of bomb. A time bomb. Spoilers? Oh yeah, when I read that when I read that sign, I really spoiled the whole game for you, didn't I? Guys, I'm gonna say something crazy that's gonna spoil the whole game. The Demon King and Ganondorf are the same person. Call me crazy. Okay. So what I have to do 
is get a hover stone. Slot it, drop our sealed, then get a time bomb. Slot it. Okay. Hopefully one's enough. I, I hate those like rock walls that just keep going. You know what I'm talking. You know if you know. When there's just a rock wall where you break through like half. Wait, Kanan is in this game. It and it just keeps going. Yeah, what's up? And then, and then the mommy. That's a hard one to pronounce. How you doing? Okay, so now we pick up this one. We juggle this. We're gonna have to do the recall lock last because we have to load the save right when we recall it. So let's pop this pupper open. What's and the name of your mother? The name of my mother? For what? Uh, I'm not gonna say that. She's a wonderful lady. Okay, I'm just gonna do this to make it easier, although it might not work. Okay, I don't think it's gonna work. Don't activate. No. Can you confirm that I am your dad, son? I guess I should have done it under here. Okay. Let's redo this real quick. So I can drop my shields. Hoverstone. Okay. Can you confirm that I am your dad? Yep. Confirmed. You're my dad. Mr. Morales. How are you, dad? You doing all right? How's life treating you, Dad? Good? How's the kids? They doing alright? Man, how am I supposed to get this down there without blowing the bomb up? <laughs> so many unusual things to solve. The stupid ass spiral. Who designed this staircase, dude? I mean, I'm sure they probably designed it without like the, the holes and gaps when they built it, but still. I want I want their degree taken away. Their building degree, they don't deserve it. Oh my God, don't explode, don't explode. As long as the bomb doesn't explode, the world is fine. Please, leave me alone. Please leave me alone. I don't care, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything is doing good. We just gotta put this here and we'll be happy to do. I've missed you, son. Yo, with all your spider activities and the Dad. streamers things. I've been good. Oh, yeah. How about you, I think you, there's not son? gonna be another rock wall for a little while, so that's good. That's a very good thing. So we already zuggled our stuff we just need to put the the hover stone in this spot and then recall lock it oh perfect that's exactly where i want to be so we just gotta do actually steering six steering six oh yeah i'm pretty sure we already zuggled this i'm not even gonna test it let's do that and then load the save I gotta be a little careful since our auto saves are not all clean. I guess spiral staircase look cool and it can help fit more stairs in a smaller place. True. I can't argue with that. That's good logic. What? Man. That's not cool. Okay, that's not a big deal, though. 
I don't think we have to get the, the bomb down there again. We just have to rezuggle and then move the thing a little bit. Is there a way to unrecall lock something? Good night, Prism. I pray you seize my poem. I was looking for it. I was. Could you send it again? I scrolled up for a while, but I didn't see it. It might be like a, a long while ago now. All right, let's. What if I recall it? Okay, that fixes it. Okay, cool. So. I just need to do this and then do this. Okay, that's like not enough. It needs to be a little higher. That's also not high enough. Gotta get that sweet spot. That's also not high enough. Wow, that falls so fast. I guess I can just like load the save when it's in the right spot, I guess. I'm not good at recall logs, guys. That's too high. No. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try that. Oh god. This is scary. I have like one auto save this clean. That's too little. What am I what do I mean by only glitches? So I'm not allowed to pick up or use anything. I'm allowed to pick up key items, but I can't use them. No. It's still poking it down. Dang it. Okay. So is this save clean or dirty? Honestly, let's make our manual save clean for a second. Which I don't usually like to do. But it's probably the right thing to do right now. Since we're running really low on clean saves. I cannot forget. Because if I lose the 100% save, that's rough. I want to see your shirt. Okay. I I'll never say no to that, bro. I'll never say no. If you want to see the Todd shirt, I can show you the Todd shirt. Hold on. Soak it in. Enjoy it. I do every night that I sleep with it. You know what I do, guys, when I sleep? I'm just like, I just rub my, my belly. You know, when, uh, you know, like, how you, you like, can tell if rub it's the clean or dirty belly if it has the luck. star next That's what I do to the save. Pod. I just go like this. What's up, Argle Bargle? Ah, Todd Merch. Merch. Why am I under here? Okay, so unrecall lock that, move it away, pop this open, put it back. I'm gonna get this first try. I'm gonna get it first try. Wait, what if I just do. This might be mega consistent because it's like a very easy setup. I really hope this works. Come on, please. Good. 
bro why is it going down why is it going down okay it has to be like fully down and a little bit up it has to be a little bit up not a lot just a little little bit uncle todd was a good uncle burrito oh uncle todd was a good uncle burrito seemed to like him more than me Look, I am Brias Todd, okay? Who else is repping the Todd shirt? Yeah, I think it'd follow. One day, I'm gonna give this Todd shirt away. But I wanna give it to someone that, like, knows the streams and knows Todd. That knows the history. Wait, can I just do this? I'm so stupid. I'm the stupidest person on... Oh my gosh, I feel really dumb. You can pop recall immediately from Ultra Hand. You don't have to, like, wait. You don't have to, like, try to time it. I, I was trying to, like, drop it and then pop recall at the right frame. It still goes down! There's no way that's going down, bro. Okay, I'm not gonna use the the stupid hoverstone. There's gotta be a better way. There's gotta be a better thing than the hoverstone. We need Todd merch one day. I would love to make Todd merch, personally. I'd be so happy to see someone repping the Todd. Todd backslash. I showed my friends the Todd shirt, and <laughs> they thought it was really funny. But they didn't understand it. It's like, how do I even explain Todd to someone that doesn't play the game? It's a, it's a Zuggle torch that uh, traverses through saves. What are you on, bro? Did you smoke crack this morning? No. It's my favorite torch. What do you mean, Goro? Can I have it when you give it away, please? I don't even know how I'm gonna give it away. I think it'd be cool too. Oh <gasps> yay! <laughs> it opened! Okay, don't get hit, 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 don't get hit. Don't get hit. We're chilling. We're chilling. Tell me the bombs here. Tell me the bombs here. Pain. Pain. Pain, pain. <laughs> We're going back. We're going back. Okay. Here's the strat. Here's the strat. What is the strat? Wait, I'm so dumb I should make the manual save down here that would save me so much time okay let's go back here okay I'm just gonna make the manual save right in front of that wall dude if the hoverstone doesn't open the gate I'm gonna punch the shit out of my monitor <laughs> the monitor is gonna have a bad day if the if the gate does not open right now Oh my gosh, we're good. We're fine. Okay. Down we go. We should never have to open that gate again. That's the good news. As long as I don't goof- Oh no 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 no
We just save, we just save, we just save, we just save right here. We just save right here. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. The bats will despawn. We're fine. Alright, now... We go here. Back to our alt save. We're just gonna slot in a bomb. All we need. I'm gonna just watch until... Until I, one, run out of RAM, or my AI just finishes or stops in Minecraft. You almost forgot. You almost got hit by that gate going half the speed of sound. <laughs> yeah, recall lock's a funny thing. You know what's actually crazy, guys? Someone in the uh, beating the game itemless commented they found a fall damage cancel by opening your paraglider the moment before you land. I thought that was so funny. Because I feel like everyone already does that. <laughs> okay. This is going to work. Back to the clean save. Lot in a bomb, and then we will be free of this dumb shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and then we have to walk through the whole maze. Don't forget that part, Spy Girl. We're like, we're like a quarter into this. Like, we've got the entrance down. Now we just gotta do the whole thing. We're... Shit, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> I don't really know what happened there, but I think the bomb, like, exploded in the rocks because I, like, I slotted it inside the rocks. There's more... There's more rocks. Are you kidding me? Why is there more rocks? Why is there more rocks? I, it's, I'm, I love rocks, guys. I love rocks. If you guys know one thing about me, and I, like, dude, rocks, me and rocks, it, it's, we're so close. I just think the devs just really understood the assignment when they wanted to make a lot of rocks and caves. Like, it just, it, like, triples your enjoyment of caves, doesn't it? I love it. I love it so much. I love when you break a walk, rock wall, and there's a rock wall right behind it. And then sometimes they hit you with like a third rock wall. Oh my god, dude. It's like so surprising too. It subverts your expectations. It's such a fun mechanic. I love it. 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 Alright, time bomb. Uh, there's a lot. That's not gonna work. Please leave me alone. All the rocks are hating on me today. Back to the clean save. Alright. Surely there's no more rocks after this, right? There can't be. There can't be more rocks. I want to be sniper. <laughs> no, you don't, bro. I think everyone that has like five brain cells uh, knows that Sniper Wolf is. Don't hit me. 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 Did that open it? Yes. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Kim. I'm so happy. I'm so genuinely just happy that that hole was open for us. Okay, it's not this way. There's another way we can go in this cave. We should also... Did we get an autosave in here yet? No. Next time we get an autosave, we should switch back to make the... Really? 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 Then I have to go that way, Nintendo. And I have to go that way? That's the only way I can go to get to the statue. Well, that's fine. That's fine. 
I'm enjoying the rocks. I'm enjoying breaking the rocks. This is a really fun game. Mechanic. These rocks going to make you insane. These rocks are great, dude. I don't know what you're talking about. I love the rocks. I love it. I love it. Hmm. When I was six or seven, I watched Sniper Wolf. I think Sniper Wolf's like the classic. Like you load on to YouTube and you get like recommended three Mr. Beast videos and one Sniper Wolf video. So it's like an easy click when you're young, but I think it's like definitely very, very young targeted content. I don't really like how she does like reactions. Cause she doesn't like credit people really well. All right, so we're going to do a bomb. We're going to do fuse and tank. And we're going to do Zuggle. I wish we had like a, a Zuggle counter. Xander, go to bed. I'm gonna go to bed in like seven minutes. Oh, welcome to Twitch Island. Is your name Xander? It is. My name do be Xander. Okay, bombs here. Don't kill me, please. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. The bomb is still there. Damn, I just got hit with a massive wave of deja vu. The only time I watched here was or see funny comments on the video about vegan teachers, so I don't really hold that much of an opinion on her. That's fair. Okay, let's not get hit. Okay, bombs away. Beautiful. Those darn rocks. Those darn rocks just keep on coming, don't they? Nintendo, why? <laughs> why? Why did you have to make a rock wall followed by a rock wall followed by an extra thick rock wall? I don't... Why? What drugs were you taking? Okay. Wait, if the rock is here on this 100% save, and it starts here, oh my god. Okay, wait, is this a dead end? This is a dead end, right? Let's make sure we don't go to the right. We need to go straight. We need to go straight. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's try doing the same thing Drop before. We're inside the wall. Yeah, I was about to say that. I was about to say let's do the same thing as before, where we just lot bombs in here. I like that idea a lot. I was not supposed to do that. It's fine. So bomb, can't take that out here. What are you talking about? Okay, let's do like two. Let's do one at the end and one at the entrance. I think that'll do a good job of getting most of our coverage. So like this one could be right here. Actually, no, let's make this one like here. And then let's do another one. Actually, we have to drop our shield. And let's do another one. Let's do three. I feel like three is definitely gonna knock it out, right? OK, 
Okay. We zuggle this one. We zuggle this one. And we zuggle this one. And this one. And then we just gotta choose the layout that we want. So we're gonna like triple bomb this. So we want one at the entrance, one in the middle, and then one at the end. We don't care about that room on the right. So we're gonna skip it. So I think this one... Maybe we could have it like... Here? And then maybe we should do one over here at the end. Let's try it. Let's try it. I think this will work. I think this will work. It's not exploding. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Where's the other bombs? Wait, why didn't the other bombs explode? Okay. I don't know why that didn't work. I mean, we got one. Just weird though. I'm so committed to this now though. <laughs> I really want to get that statue. I really want to end the stream at least getting that statue. What do you guys think? Save the statue for next stream or get the statue tonight? I want, like, can I get the statue in the next, like, 15 minutes reasonably? I feel like I can. But is there going to be this many rocks everywhere? Get it tonight? Okay. The chat has spoken. Okay, I'm going to try to do two here. Oh, shit. I goofed. Guess that's terrifying. I'm about to get shocked. Oh, I can't even drop it because it's... Wait, so that just got rid of one of my bombs? Ooh, I'm just going to try with this. Let's just try. Please, I hope this one just explodes. I really hope this one just explodes. Eat? Yeah, I probably should eat a little bit. I'm a little hungry. Boom. Nice. Oh, yes. We got it. Okay. Yes. Okay. No more rock walls. Please, Nint. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That has to be a dead end. Please. No. Uh, no. Why? Okay. 
Hold it. Hold it. When does the rock wall stop? When does Nintendo decide that enough is enough? Five rock walls. It's plenty. It hurts. <laughs> and I'm not getting any auto saves down there either, which is like just annoying me. <laughs> I'm just annoyed. I'm not getting any auto saves, and it just keeps hitting me with more rocks. If I see another rock wall after this, dude, I'm I'm gonna be a little unhappy. I'm gonna be a little, a little unhappy, okay? I'm not gonna be a happy go-getter if I see another rock wall after this, okay? No more Mr. Nice Guy. I'm done with all the bullshit. Wait, did I make a manual save? I don't think I did. She, wait, did I not? Oh no. Please tell me I made one. <laughs> the rock wall's still gonna be there, isn't it? Please. I hear the bombs going off at least. So maybe they broke the one in front of us. They didn't break the one in front of us. I'm not that lucky. I, why did I not save? Boom, I should have saved. I should have saved. Save, 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 save. I gotta remember if, if, a, if a rock breaks, I need to save the game. If rock equals broken, save. Rock break, save. Rock break, save. Rock break, save. Bro, just a lot regular bombs over. But how would regular bombs help me? Because I can't throw them. I can't throw regular bombs. Alright, two bombs is going to do the trick. Actually, you know what? You know what, chat? Watch this. Shit, never mind. Don't watch this. Okay. Okay, start watching right, oh, excuse me, right now, bomb, fuse and tangle, drop shield, new bomb, fuse and tangle, drop shield, new bomb, fuse and tangle, drop shield, pick up shield. Zuggle. Unequip. Okay, two bombs are gonna be dedicated to this wall. The third bomb is gonna be dedicated to the next wall. If I aim all, all three of these perfectly, if I get the god aim on all three big booms, hear me when I say, we will not only break just through this wall, we will break through the next wall as well. Gee. Okay. Where's the third bomb? There it is. There it is. Let's not start this. Keep it nice and steady. Steady, 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 steady. Don't mind the fact that I'm on one heart. And let's not even plant this in the bomb, in the, in the wall. Let's just put it right there. Let's put it right there. 
Can you stop moving? Please. I, I want you to exist somewhere where you're not gonna move. So right here, that's good. All right. Break, rock wall, save. Break, rock wall, save. Break, rock wall, save. Okay. Break rock wall, save. Break rock wall, We got this one down save. and one bomb. One bomb, baby. We got two bombs to spare. We got a bomb to go. We're taking one to go with us. We got a spare. Okay. Throw it. There it goes. Please, make it a one-hitter. Make it a one-hitter. No! I didn't save! Is my other bomb still here? Where did my other bomb go? Why did I not save? I had one job. I had one job. I had one job. You were supposed to break walls. I forgot that the bomb... I, it killed me. I was. I didn't expect the bomb to kill me. I thought I was far away. I thought I was far away. Okay, this is the one. You know what? I'm gonna play the summoning song music just to prove it. I can't lie if the summoning song music is playing. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate that. Alright. Everyone, get in the groove. No more pouting. No more messing around. We're locking in. We're gaming. The mission is simple. We have one task. And only one task. Break the wall and save the game. Many called the task impossible. Some never believing in the dream. Break wall, save. But one individual believed it was possible. One individual, individual sought it out. Actively pushing the boundary of what is and isn't possible. The task seems simple. Just break a wall and save the game. But nobody done it before. And so one man came from the shadows and did this. I'm toing it. I'm only toing it. I believe in the tour. Wait for it. Wait, what happened to this bomb? Hello? Is this a bug? There's no collision! I've been scammed! <laughs> Has anyone seen that in their lifetime? It's fine. It's so fine. Alright. We're going back to the Good Brother song. I'm gonna line up the B drop with the bomb. Wait for it. Sorry, hold on. I missed it. I'm sorry, that was terrible. Let's go! No. Oh, we're fine.
That's progress, baby. That's progress. Onwards and upwards. Clipping won't work yet. Clipping doesn't work. We can't clip. All right, is the next one a one for or a two for? Do we need two bombs for this? Let's do two to be safe. We might have one for the road. Uh, a bomb for the road never hurts, right? Okay, bro. Wait, one of my bombs is blow? We're going for a one. It's gonna be enough. It's gonna be enough, trust. It's gonna be enough. 100% enough. There's the bomb. Break the wall, save. Break the wall, save. Perfect lineup. Walk away so we don't die. It's a twofer. Save, 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 save. It's fine, it's fine. We know the drill. We know how this goes. We're ready. I can take 8,000 more walls before it breaks me. 8,000 more walls. We're not even close to that number, bro. We're not even close. I just want this done tonight. I want to end the stream on a positive note. I want to end the stream with three hearts, not four. That is how you end a stream. On a, on a top note. Is beating it, is like deep degressing, regressing, regressing. I want to regress. I just think that's hilarious that we're doing all this to lose hearts. That's awesome. That's what makes it all worth it. I love the summoning salt playlist. Is it too loud though? I think the music might be a little loud. I'll, I'll, I'll turn it down a bit. I am kind of vibing to it. But I don't want to break your eardrums. She's in there. Please. Nom 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 you woo Alan cat dot x has stopped responding. Did that make no difference? I feel like that didn't do anything. Am I crazy? Why did that feel like it did nothing? It's a triple. It might be a triple. It might be a tripler. Nintendo doubled down and then tripled down and then quadrupled down on this freaking rock wall concept. They really said, this is so good. Players are going to love it. We should do it again. And then after that, they said, hey, we could, this, this could do another rock wall. I feel like they're like, you know, this cave feels a little dry. Let's add another rock wall. <laughs> you know, I feel like we should make this cave still more interactive. Didn't save noob bozo. What should we do? Uh, we got an enemy. What's like the worst enemy we could add? Oh, what about those ones that like shock you and like shoot? Yeah, like oh, uh, shock like like no players love that. Yeah, they'll love that. What about um, what about adding another rock wall here? I think players will also really like that. What 
Wait, did someone just sub? Oh, no, 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 okay. That was from a long time ago. Okay, few. This is how you design a cave level, guys. All right, we got three bombs. We got three. That's a lot. Was it my sub you were looking at? Uh, let me check. It was from like an hour and a half ago. Undescribed gaming. Yeah, it was, it was, it was your sub. Resident sleeper, 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 resident TTS is a privilege, all right? TTS is a privilege, guys. If you're spamming, either you're gonna get banned or you're gonna like ruin TTS for everyone else. But I'm probably just gonna ban you because it's so annoying people spam TTS. Wait, whoa, that's so neat. Look at this bomb. It's like middle of getting activated. Whoa, and I can't move it. It's like a recall locked bomb. That's so weird. I am a privilege. What happens if I throw it? It just hurts me? Oh, that's so weird, dude. Okay, I'll stop fangirling over this. Let's see. So I need to do it not here, because this is where the other rocks are. I need to do it here. Boom. Oh gosh. It's such an annoying spot to do this lotting, just because it's like everything rolling around. But it's fine. I like what I see in this next room, to be honest. It seems like it's pretty wide open. Alright, we're doing three bombs again. And we're not going to put them in other bombs. Or in walls. We're just going to let it flow. Alien shield, time bomb shield. Okay, I'm a little scared that the time bombs don't actually break this kind of rock because this is like the first unique Woman rock. Woman raising that we've hand, seen. female sign. All right, let's just fuse these together, honestly. And then let's make sure that this is like a safe location. So I'm gonna put it right here. Okay, let's hope, let's hope. I both love and hate time bombs now. Yeah, it's like, they're kind of like amazing for what we're doing right now, but at the same time, it's kind of a pain. Like I wish we could just have like a cannon instead that we could just like keep turning on. Yeah, I want to watch what happens because I'm scared that this doesn't actually break the, the wall.
Why, Nintendo? Why? Why is this rock just, like, harder to break? It just doesn't break? You just made a wall that just doesn't break from normal time bombs? What kind of freaking wall is this, then? How can I break this wall? Do bombs break it? What if we recall lock a bomb inside of it? By the way, we might as well just break these, I guess. Save again. Or rocket, more bombs? No, the bombs don't do anything. Unless you're just saying normal bombs. You can recall lock a bomb and use the time bomb to set it off. Hmm. Recall lock a bomb. I don't think the bomb would go off since it's recall locked. Hmm. Wait. Holy shit, there's another one of the walls. Oh my god. I'm gonna try to ignore the fact that we're gonna have to break through more of these. Let's just see if the if the bomb works. It doesn't. Okay, that's that's a little spooky. So the bomb doesn't work. Does like anything else work? What about the classic like recall combo? No. You need to throw multiple, multiple bombs? Why would multiple bombs break it? It doesn't have like HP, does it? Are you saying if I like triple shot bow this? Okay, this is gonna be five bombs. Oh! Does that mean time bombs work as well if you have enough of them? Okay, maybe this is like too many. Just shoot it once. Does this just not work? Can I see it one at a time? Okay, I think it has to be normal bombs. I think the time bombs don't do jack shit, but enough normal bombs will do something. But this is also crazy because we have to Did like you try a cannon. We have to like slot the bombs. I don't know, dude. It's, it's whack. Did I try a cannon? Like, how would I use the cannon though, without using my battery? I would say yes to the cannon because I love the idea of using a cannon. Wait, why is it not slotting? That should have slotted, right? What is going on? Can you not slot bombs? Time bombs don't work, it has to be normal bombs, and also I think you know bow works too. Wait guys, the bombs aren't working. Like I can't slot this bomb. 
Steering anything? stick and big battery for cannon. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Wait, well, yeah, let's just do that. Okay, let's do cannon. Uh, if I put a steering stick and a cannon... Wait, this might make our life so much easier. Because I can pick up steering sticks in the alt save. Even without ultra hands. Okay, I can't move it. That's gonna be the only like really painful thing is we won't we're not able to move it. Let's try this. TTS for only 50 channel points. This is even better than fail boats TTS. Sweet. I don't know who that is, but yeah, I, li I like TTS. It's it's kind of just easier to chat with you guys with TTS. Because I don't read chats, like, super consistently. I try to. I do my best. But trying to read every chat is challenging. But I do prefer when people use TTS for, like, more, like, meaningful stuff. Like, don't use TTS for, like, every chat. If you're using TTS for every chat, you're not using TTS for it. Oh, wait. I'm being stupid. I have to drop this. Okay, let me redo it. So steering stick. Guys, to be honest, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get the statue tonight. I'm starting to lose a little bit of hope. Like, I think we can get the statue, but I don't know if we can do it tonight. Just cause it is a school night, it is late. And I have been streaming for a while. I don't even know how close we are. I feel like we're not that close. But we have come so far. I think. Apricate, I can't spell but thank you for randomly showing up in my FIP son. Fuck school. <laughs> Bro spitting facts. Local TTS price equals 50. If TTS abused, then TTS plus equals 10. Yeah, I think people to spam TTS, dolls get banned. Okay, the scary thing about this is that I can't get hit by the cannon. Because the cannon's gonna be like suiting. So I need to have it in such a way that it doesn't kill me. I don't know what the like right spot to do this in would be. I guess I want the cannon angled down. Can I have it angled like straight forward? I guess I can, yeah, like that might go sleep now glad i told you about the statue later you guys think this is good later man thanks for tuning in the stream i appreciate you okay let's try like from back here Card the torch is a torch from an alternate save that I glitched into the itemless save. I'm unable to attack with it because the game doesn't recognize it that as like a weapon. That's like the perfect example of something that like does not need to be TTS by the way. Okay. I really hope that this works. This is gonna kill me if it doesn't work, dude. What if you attach a normal thing to a slotted thing? Uh, it disappears. If it's not slotted as well, it's just not going to be there in the other save. That actually happened earlier, where I slotted, like, a lot of things onto uh, a little plane that I made. But I didn't actually slot the the base of it. So all the parts were there, they were just floating. Let's start not floating, the they torch were just, like, count. in the ground. hope this doesn't kill me. Oh, it tilted. And it didn't even break it. And I can't move it. Okay. That's not gonna work. This Use is a hard, stake man. this good for TTS. This is a strange problem to have. I 
I mean, the only other thing I could think of is having like a bunch of bombs recall locked. If this doesn't work, guys, I'll, I'll probably try this again the next time I stream, but I don't really know how I could break this wall. I'll have to like th think about it. I'll have to really do a think about it. Okay. Oh wait, I can't drop the bombs, so I can't. Yeah, this doesn't. Woth statue. Cannonus kick. My game just crashed. I think my game just crashed. <laughs> okay, I think the game is telling me. Bob bomb. A lot of ruby. I don't think the ruby would break it either. Okay, I think my game just crashed, guys. Hey, thank you for the follow. Okay. Fellas, I think, if anything... Oh, the software closed because of an error. Yep. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Sledgehammer -like I think this is the game telling me hits. we should probably wrap the stream up. You will it's need 1.30 to in the morning. To break blue wall. It's been a good one. Thank Bob you for the follows, guys. I appreciate it. I hope to see you on more streams. I hope to see you in the next one. I think the ending is going to be wild for this, for this challenge. Hopefully, we can get the, the statue... It'll be worth it in the end because it means we can get hit. F in chat, boys. But I'm gonna call it here. Let me see if there's anyone Good I could anyone I could read right now. But yeah, glad to see there's a lot right of people here from the, from the last video. Left magnifying glass. Right magnifying Always glass. Always lovely. Left magnifying glass. Always nice. Right magnifying glass. I'm gonna left do a lot more streams. Glass. Okay, right I'm gonna magnifying turn glass. Sorry, I have to turn off TTS. It, who did that? Okay, Fair Lord. I'm not sure what that Fair Lord. It's about the end stream, bro. All right. Let's raid Player Five. If you guys don't know who Player Five is, he's a speedrunner for the Tears of the Kingdom. So if you want to see what a speedrun for this game looks like, then tune into his stream. Say hello. For the YouTube folks, if you're watching on YouTube, uh, this stream is going to end. Oh, wait, I did the wrong thing. Raid player five. Will next stream be Friday or Saturday? Probably Thursday or Friday. I'm going to say Thursday or Friday. But join the Discord if you want. I'll put the Discord link one more time. And I'll update you when I got that information. Thank you, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Have a good day. And one last time, before I say goodbye to everyone, or before I close it off, give a warm, a oh wait, a warm goodbye to our friends, our loving hero, Todd the Torch. Bye everyone, good night.